Welcome to Bitter Bits. Welcome to Bitter Bits. Welcome to Bitter Bits. Welcome to Bitter Bits. Welcome to Bitter Bit.
Hello, hello, everybody, and welcome to a little, uh, little Thursday, little Thursday thing. We're gonna be doing some Project Zomboid tonight, which is a game that is uh, garnered a lot of attention lately. It's definitely something we knew about, but it seems like it had pretty, pretty sizable update, and it seems like folks are, uh, folks are digging it. So I figured I'd give it a shot. Take a little break from Xenoblade tonight. We are not done with Xenoblade, but I figured it'd be a good time to. Maybe uh, maybe take a little uh, take a little short break from it, which is cool. We'll uh, we'll be back to it and figure out what we're gonna do with it. King Boo, Zach, Vagrant, Cobra. We're during a hype train right now, and here's what we're gonna do for this hype train. If you decide to participate in it, I want you to pretend. If you give to sub or if you fucking do bits or whatever, I want you to pretend like you're excited about Kingdom Hearts three, and that we don't know Welcome that it's gonna be an bits. absolute disaster. Let's do that. Let's just pretend. Let's all pretend it's 2019. Let's pretend the promise. The promise of Kingdom Hearts is still on the horizon. It ends up bombing, but it's okay. We don't know that yet. We don't know that it's going to end up being, you know, weird, like, whatever the fuck it ended up being. Bro, I'm so hyped for Kingdom Hearts 3. I can't wait to see all my favorite Final Fantasy characters returning. Me too. There's so many of them. There's so many that could come back that have been pivotal to the plot, but let's, but let's not bring them back. We got your Cedric. We got your Arido. You got, like, you know, Squelch. You got them all. They're all here. They're all here. What's everyone's opinion on Sora going from bright colors in Kingdom Hearts to full black in Kingdom Hearts 2? He wasn't full black. He still had all kinds of colors on him. Still had like yellows and reds and whites in there. And then on top of that, uh, whenever he shifted forms, he went an entire different color. And I think that was the, I think that was the reason of keeping him in a uh, light or dark outfit was probably to allow the forms to really cut through. Because when you think about it, you had valor which was red you had wisdom which was blue you had the what was it skill or whatever the hell it was yellow and then you had ultimate which was white so in different different like uh different colors to shift through so that's probably why they went with a black outfit instead of something that was already a base color so they could shift around is this a fizzle train oh my god it is oh it's not quite a fizzle it, we went to level two from some subs i think it was almost a fizzle train kind of you know Smoke weed every day. i wait what is it? What is this like three minute video at the beginning? What is this? What am I supposed to do with this? Thank you, Asgirl, for the dollar. I don't I don't know if we're diving into video time just yet. I think I need to start my stream before we start linking stuff. Um But uh but yeah, thank you all for being here and uh thank you to who all did stuff so far. We had uh Denim with 31 months, thank you for the resub, buddy. We had Faulkner with the 67 months, Luigi with the 47 months, says goddamn my subs twi more than twice as old as me. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. I didn't know you were two years old. Dolphin with 41 months says the bus never ends. Please, I'm hungry. Can we stop at a convenience store? Absolutely not. Steve gets an out of sub to Cosmic Vivian. Inferno gets it with the 19 months. This thanks to Zaris for my gift sub. And Ezgorilla with the first donation of the night with a dollar. Thank you so much. Here it comes. Level one hype train clear. Yay, we did it. We don't see like, uh, we don't see big hype trains really ever anymore. We saw a bunch of them during, uh, what was it? 20... It was probably 2020. They were mostly... They were pretty quiet for 2021. Especially the back half of the year after the Twitch breach. And then on top of that, uh, we probably, I think that was like our first one maybe since... Uh, was that our first hype train since 2022? Oh my god, it was. Yeah, that was the first one. Holy shit. A little baby hype train was the first one of 2022. Look at that. I got a I got a dolphin that's got like glasses on or some shit. That's interesting. <laughs> that's that's interesting. I'm leaving up the start screen for a little bit longer because I want people to get a gander at this. This was the uh, this was of course, as the little blurb up there in the top right says, this is the starting screen for Kingdom Hearts three in 2019. Um, uh, yeah, so uh, it was pretty cool. I, uh, I I liked it a lot. This is probably one of my favorite, uh, visually probably one of my favorite start screens. It's very impressive. Uh, it's got a lot of detail going on with like the track from like the hearts up at the top, got, like uh, the little light thingy is going on in the background there. It's got the spinning, uh, spinning like platter thing that looks like one of the dive into the heart bullshit thingies at the beginning of the game. Uh, whatever the hell it's called. What is it? Deep dive? What, what do they call the the thing where they fall into the ocean or whatever? I don't fucking remember. Uh, whatever that was. Uh, the start. The chat boxes were enormous back then. They're super wide. Look at that. Very very wide. Hype train's rare because some people moved off bits. That's true. Some people did. Some people moved off. Uh, I think like the, I, I'm telling you, dude. I think for small and mid streamers, 
from some of the information I've seen, that fucking Twitch data breach it impacted us easily the most. It didn't seem to really do anything to like the Turbo Massive channels because I feel like some of the Twitch zombies who like spend just forever on the platform who will just watch fucking anybody that's huge. I feel like they didn't really give a shit um, as to like that whole thing, but I do feel like it impacted smaller and mid communities a lot more. A lot. Maybe it is dive into the heart. I, it's something like that. Dive into the heart or um, deep dive or whatever the fuck it was. Point is, yeah, it's uh, it's neat. Um, I do remember people being like, why is the underwear hanging out? Which was really funny because I guess they I, like just go pull up a picture of Sora. You'll see the pink thing. You'll see it because it's like the, the whole suit is like one. It's like one piece. So it's like a it's like a like a unitard type thing or whatever. Cat boxes were why because I made some super early one wide, then we just use that as a starting screen as a template. Yeah, these fucking thick ass, thick ass chat boxes. It was interesting too because I think some of the original ones they we we did them in two pieces where uh, the part that says bitter bits starting soon was actually a separate element, so you could actually nest the chat like kind of underneath the logo thing and stuff. It it was interesting for sure. <laughs> yeah, somebody was like, "What's the underwear?" It's like, what are you fucking talking about the underwear? <laughs> like, what are you talking about? But no, this one looked, uh, this one was really good. I like this one a lot. It's probably, uh, probably, probably up there. One of my favorites. Um, and I'm, I'm glad we're doing this too. Cause I feel like it's, uh, I feel like it's, it's good to look back at the, good to look back at some of the older ones because I think there's like some really cool shit that it's, there's some really cool stuff that happened and it's good to this. I mean, honestly, this one, you can't even really tell is like an old one. Like you can't. In my opinion, I, this this could have been made like a couple months ago. There's uh, like the line work and everything like that, and the coloration on the key art is is incredible. I actually think, and I like both of them. I actually think that the Kingdom Hearts artwork. I actually like this one a little bit more than the 14 one, which we showed last time. Uh, which those were both in 2019, so they were actually pretty close together. But I think this one's just got this one's got a look to it that I really like. It's very um very smooth, very clean. So is the other one, but. Just it's got this one's got a very particular feel to it. I also feel like the um I also feel like the coloration's really nice with the channel theming. Like you got like, the light blues and the pinks, and I think I think they're peppered in throughout the outfit pretty well, as opposed to feeling like uh as opposed to because sometimes we've we've gone like almost for like comedic effect, like shoehorning in the on brandness. Uh but this one's really nice about it. I think it's I think it's integrated extremely well. It actually looks like it's part of um it actually looks like it's just part of the outfit. Uh, which is interesting. That's the funny thing, too, is I do remember you feeling like you struggled with the 14 one, which was hilarious, because that was one of the few times, since since I know you normally do grill for all your, for, like, a lot of your artwork, it was interesting that that one you were, like, more worried about, because I figured that one would be a little bit easier, because we don't normally get to do that for start screens, because me no grill, so, you know, you normally have to do, like, this or whatever, so I thought that was interesting that that one did, uh, I remember that one being a bit more, um, strange which is weird because that that definitely seemed like it would be more in your wheelhouse i guess would be what i'm getting at here uh anyway for anybody who's joining us thank you guys for joining us and thank you for the uh thank you for the resubs and thank you for the donations thank you for keeping this show in business i appreciate it uh thank you for throwing bits and donating and doing subs and all that stuff it definitely helps keep the show alive and well so i really appreciate it and uh thank you for keeping this little little bitter bits land in business um, we're gonna go ahead and switch off of this though, because we're uh, we're moving into the just chatty. God, my, my hair nut, crazy today. This is all over the fucking place. I because I blow dry it like to the left and then the right and then the left. So I have to blow dry my hair when I get out of the shower for uh, streams because otherwise I'm gonna be like all sog. And I, I ain't doing I ain't doing sog sog stream. I ain't doing it. Oh, petition to keep this one. Well, I think once you guys see the uh, once you guys see the new one. I think uh, I think you're gonna probably be into that. I gotta actually um, let me send something really quick. Uh, also, where's the tweet? If you guys wanna go share this around, if, uh, if you got any friends or anything like that that are into uh, Project Zomboid, and you wanna share it with them. You're more than welcome to. As is as is how the Twitter do. My camera has been so weird lately. I feel like it. I feel like I, I move it around all the time. It's so strange. Um.
There we go. What is this Zomboid? What about Xenoblade? The game Bitter Man bought both games. It's uh, it's there. Oh, um, I so I put out the probe. Um, the probe on the D and D game officially. It is in the tabletop chat in Discord. So if you go into Discord and to like the tabletop role, you'll see it. Uh, so far, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 21 people who are interested in joining the D&D thing. Naturally, we can only have... Uh, we'll only be able to pick four in addition to myself. So if that is something that you're interested in, please go to the tabletop thing and say, like, hey, I'm interested in it, and, or send me a PM. Say you're interested in it. Uh, so I can put your name in the running for it, because we've got... I'm going to have to pick a f just a few people from that, but... It's very nice to see that there was a large response of people who were interested in playing. Um, if you do not get picked, uh, d don't hesitate. You can start up a game with like some folks in the tabletop chat if you want, or stick around because we'll probably do an. If that if the D and D game is successful, we'll probably end up doing um, a second one. So, uh, uh, yeah. So if that's something you're interested in, you will still want to participate in the D and D game, or at least throw your name in the running. Uh, please. Um, I did not see the line work thing, no. It looks really, uh... Looks really good. I like that a lot. It's really nice. Um, but yeah, if you wanna- if you wanna be in the- be in the D&D &D thing, and that's, uh, that's the stuff, then make sure you go and, uh, send me a message on Discord. Uh, you'll get a bitter pasta if you- if I saw the message and got you added. I literally just caught myself, because I thought today was Wednesday. I do- I- my date- it doesn't even feel like a new year. It doesn't. I still got the Christmas shit up, which needs to come down. That has got to happen tonight. I changed out the Christmas emotes, but God, I've got to get the tree down and stuff. As much as I love the tree, I actually don't like that tree that much. I love it, but like at the same time, it was like a different type of tree, and it's very stabby. It's not like a soft Fraser fir. It's like... It's very pokey. So, um... Oh, Fairy, you missed the, uh, you missed the Kingdom Hearts start screen. You came in, you came in a little... There it is, look at that. For anybody that just now joined us. Since we're going through the uh, the asset roulette, uh, yeah, man, that was the that was the big boy from Kingdom Hearts three in 2019. I fucking again, I loved that start screen. That was a amazing one for a game that ended up leaving me dry as fuck. Dry as fuck. Fuck that. I'm leaving my tree up for a month at least. Uh, the main tree is like in great shape. Like the one out in the dim, that sucker is like soft as hell, still nice and hydrated. Like. I don't see a reason to take it down yet. Like, it's it's in really good shape. <laughs> so I was like, just gonna leave him up. Like, he's looking good. So. We're looking pretty good. Peeve with the 40 months. Thank you, Peeve. I appreciate it. But yeah, if you're interested in the D&D thing and you have not replied yet or whatever, uh, go check in tabletop chat. Vagrant has some general, general specific kind of stuff going on as to what the game is going to kind of look like. Uh, and of course, PM me if you would like to be added to the list of people. I'm probably going to just draw at random at this point, because I think everybody on that list I know is more than capable of hanging out and talking and stuff. They're all people I've talked to at least some point, or interacted with in chat or whatever, so probably just be completely random at this point, since we have so many people, so. Making my own oxygen. That is true. Yeah, it's true. We're doing a little, doing a little, just making our own oxygen. It's all good. So, uh, we're gonna be doing Project Zomboid tonight, which is, uh, which is not a new game. This is a game that came out in, like, fucking 2014 or something like that. It has been, it's been in early access, I believe, um, almost, uh, seven, seven years, I think. Uh, it is one of those games that appears to be very, uh, very robust. Extremely robust. Uh, and I don't, e I don't even know exactly what we're getting into. I know it's like a, it's an RPG type thing, uh, you know, I'm not exactly, not exactly positive as to where we're going here. Uh, small game. Oh yeah, it should be. It was very small, wasn't it? Um, I don't know, I don't know exactly what to expect, but I've heard that, like, the barrier of entry is kind of high, but, like, it's not too, too bad if you're just, like, popping in and, you know, poking around and trying stuff out, so. Uh, yeah, it's definitely got, definitely got some age on it, but it does seem interesting, and I wanted to do something a little different than, uh, a little different than, like, you know, uh, I feel like we've been R we've been RPG and well, shit. It's another RPG. I feel like we've been in the JRPG ish kind of hole for a while because we've been doing like fourteen. We've been doing, uh, you know, we've been started up uh, Xenoblade. I guess I guess we really haven't. I mean, we did Devil May Cry and Chibi Robo and all kinds of other shit. But still, I don't know. Just just to just to change up the feel of it, and I'm sure some people are interested in seeing what this is anyway. So, 
Uh, there is a tutorial for this. Um, I guess we'll go ahead and give that a shot. I'm gonna go ahead and flip over here. Let's do the tutorial, bump around in this and figure out what's going on. I don't normally like doing tutorials because I like to just kind of go in there and just fucking just, just die, but we're gonna, we're gonna try this. So we're gonna see, let's uh, get the audio back on for this, which is uh, gone. There we go. This is how you died. What if I didn't? What if I didn't die? I may not have. Welcome to Project Zomboid. Soon you'll die horribly. No one will mourn you, and you will be swiftly forgotten. Everything will have been for nothing. So let's make sure you go out fighting. Great. First thing is you can zoom with your mouse wheel or the uh, or the plus or minus. Or, yeah, there you go. Uh, minus and equal keys. Give me a bird's eye view. The lonely place you're about to die. Miserable and alone. Cool deal. Give me a good bead, man. Zoom back in. Look, uh, you're great at this. Let's have a look at your character information. Click the flashing heart on the left. All right. Oh my god. Here you see your health status. Scratches, bites, bleeding, broken limbs, all listed for your convenience. It's also here that you can bandage and treat your wounds. All right. Uh, do you know another good panel? Yes, the skill, <laughs> skill panel. Thank you so much. Uh, let's see. This panel shows your points in various different survival skills. Okay. Bro Mario, bits. getting dragged on the bus by Jiggy Kuro. Thank you so much, Jiggy Kuro, for dragging him on the bus. I hope they enjoy the ride because the ride of Marines. Time to take off those training wheels. Uh, close the character panel by clicking the cross, and we'll move into the next exciting aspect of survivor life. Dude, the, the UI is so tiny. Is there a way to, like, is there, like, a UI scale option? Because, man, this thing is teeny tiny. Uh, blood decals. Let's V-sync it. Mm, a lot cursor window. Well, actually, we don't need that because of borderless. Uh, holy shit, please tell me there's, like, a UI scale. Oh, please. Oh, please. <laughs> Uh, there's font size. Maybe it's under accessibility. Uh, cycle container type search mode. Oh, no, no, no. I don't know about that. Oh, I like that thing song. <laughs> it's so tiny. Uh, it's looking at stuff. Woo, woo, woo. Hold down the right mouse button to move the mouse. All right. Uh, you'll turn to face any angle. Holding left control and moving the mouse will do this too. Okay. So you can like kind of, it's like, oh, that's interesting. So like you can only view... I guess, like, there actually is some type of semblance of, like, field of view where it'll darken things you can't see, like, around corners and stuff. Uh, let's get some blood pumping. Before it, uh, congeals and rots, move around with the dwazzed keys. Why not walk into an adjacent room? It's definitely safe. It's safe! It was safe! They were absolutely true about that. That's good. See, I told you it was safe. Now let's strafe. Holding the right mouse button will let you look around while walking. So help you line up attacks and watch your back. Stray further in the room by holding the right mouse button and using the wazzed. All right. I hear some I hear some grunt tundling out there. I hear it. <laughs> Somebody wants that Krispy Kreme donut. Say like that a Krispy Kreme. <laughs> I, I wish like I had some stuff. So, I, I want that to be grounded reality in some way where there's like some fucking crazy coworker I had who would just be like <laughs> Donut. Starvation can be delayed by looting from the homes of the recently deceased. Move your mouse over the loot panel to expand it. All right. A dead mouse. To pick it up, double click. Why the fuck? I don't want that. It's rotten. What are you talking? I don't want that. Get that out of here. I mean, I guess I'm fine. Whatever. Oh, God. Uh, okay. See see those moodles to the right? Looks like you got some... Uh, looks like you got a rumbly Welcome tumbly. Time to, to eat. What do you mean right click the fucking dead mouse? You're crazy. That was so stupid. What a bad decision that was. Would rather not eat. Rogue, thank you for gifting out a sub to Makes Cash. I appreciate it. Thank you for being a friend. Okay, fill up your water bottle before the water supply is cut off. Right-click items in the world. Bring up the interaction options. Yay! All right, look at that. We still got a... That's like The Sims, but like, you know... Not. You automatically drink from water that's carried in your main inventory. Let's see what uh, Let's see what's in the other cupboards. Let's also see if there's options settings in the- Oh! Voice act voice activity detected mode. Oh, I didn't know, uh... I didn't know that, like, voice activity was gonna be a thing. That's gonna be bad! I'm never gonna survive this zombie apocalypse if, like... I'm never gonna do that. <laughs> I'm never gonna be able to survive this shit. If I'm yelling in my fucking microphone constantly. I'm gonna bring up the sound a bit, and we'll bring it down... ...as time goes on, because I, I do want, like, some extra... Beefs. Seemed like it was a little quiet. Well, it's near enough to a weapon. Right-click the frying pan and equip primary. All right. Okay, so we got a bonk stick now. That's good. Oh, that's for multiplayer. I thought that was like, zombies can hear you. I'm like, that's awful. A zombie in a hat. Let's get out of here. Pressing E will interact with objects in front of you. Most notably, doors and windows. 
All right, this is still really quiet. Let's go, climb out of the window and beat the corpse back to death. Hold E to climb through the window. All right. Uh, holding the right mouse button will ready your weapon for an attack. An isometric cursor is shown to help you gauge the angle of your approach. Hold the right mouse button. All right. Uh-huh. Ready the frying pan. How do I... Oh, you just got a bonk? <laughs> well, we did it, everybody. Oh, are they not dead? Oh, God. The isometric cursor is vital to this. Do I need to, like, still bonk them? Uh, you could have also pressed space to shove her, but right now we need to go for the head. Okay. So do I, like, just get up there and just, like... No? Oh, is it the... I'm, I'm very confused. Is it, like, the... Oh, okay, I see. Uh, line yourself up using the right mouse button and use the circle at the bottom of the isometric, isom isometric cursor to target the head, bash the left mouse button, and you're in place. Yeah, look! Why are they covered in grass? <laughs> Why? Why are they covered in grass? They got some dusty shit. Th Hang on a second. They might have some good fashion. What the? No cope. Okay. Wow. Oh, there's another. That's that's like an Edie man. That's not that's a zombie. That's not like a. That's not a good person. Uh, <laughs> vegetative shambler in the vegetable garden. But he's got a. Uh, but he's got enough brain function to see you. If you sneak, you'll make less noise. You'll be less visible. Press C to crouch. Oh my God. C to crouch. C these nuts. Wow, it's like you're invisible. I mean, you've maxed out your skills here, but that isn't... We've maxed out your skills here, but that is impressive. If you sneak close to a wall, fence, or vehicle, you'll crouch lower and reduce your visib visibility even more. This is some special forces shit right here. Oh, I'm sorry, stuff. Wait a minute, why... Oh, he wasn't visible because he was out of our field of view. Interesting. Uh, Alright, your your arm will raise to show your place. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna stab his ass. Straight by holding right, right, mouse, right mouse button and attack with the left click when you're directly behind. I right, get ready. Get ready. Uh huh. Gotti. Gotti. You did it. No more daddy issues. Now take his bag and put it on. What? What? <laughs> what? I'm taking all of his shit. What are you talking about? Oh, I took the wrong person. However, uh, I could use some of those sweet, that sweet, like, whatever that they had. Why do I, uh, make sure you're standing over the corpse and right click the large backpack? Oh, I probably have to close this? Maybe? No? What is this? Oh, it's like when there's like two people, it'll actually like, if they're laying on top of each other. That's actually pretty nice. That, that works out pretty well. Oh, look at this sweet backpack. Look at that. I don't know what's up with the daddy issues thing. Maybe that was supposed to be the daddy? Da daddy. Let's see what's inside. Oh, wow. They had a shotgun. That's fancy. That's also not fancy. What was that? The window in Dad's shed just broke. Right on time. Vault the fence and let's check it out. Running at the fence will make you jump over it. Eep! Wow, look at that. That was fancy. Okay. This is broken. We're gonna fucking get, like... We're gonna get stabbed. What are you talking about? All right. Dad was a prepper, but he didn't prepare for what for you, did he? Let's take his gear. Ignore the glass shards. No! What? We had to have gotten cut. Oh, no. Your hands are bleeding. The broken glass in the window shredded them. Oh, how could that have possibly fucking happened? How could we have possibly had that happen? Okay, the bandages from the backpack will help. All right, so we can bandage that. Perfect. You know what? It kind of it kind of feels like uh, kind of feeling a little Kenshi, to be honest. Like, almost feel like a zombie survival like kind of Kenshi thing going on. Curtains stop you seeing out, but they all they uh they also stop the hordes seeing in. Open the curtain. It's probably safe. <laughs> that was reasonably safe. Yeah. Look if you count your sister on the floor there. Damn. Damn. All right, thicker clothing and headwear protect you from bites and scratches. Put on what you think is best for the final encounter. I feel like if, if most people did wear, like, big padded jackets, that, like, most human teeth wouldn't do very well getting through that. Like, we've got some pretty solid incisors, but, like, I mean, if you're, like, a shambly-bambly corpse that's just chomping, I mean, good luck getting through, like, some... Good luck getting through some Columbia sportswear. Hashtag not sponsored. All right, so let's see what we got over here. Uh, I guess. Yeah, glass is no fucking joke, dude. I'm, like, scared to cut my hand on anything because I'm just weird about that. Uh, all right, so we got a leather jacket. I'm guessing these have, like, bite defense on them. Yeah, they actually do. Okay, cool. So we can wear a leather jacket, uh, military botas. Why do I feel like some of these things are very hard to probably come by? Uh, there's camo pants, which don't have very good bite defense, but... Uh, that's got insulation on it. That's nice. You can also see the gear. That's interesting. Thank God. 
Hot damn. I mean, we look like an idiot, but, you know, whatever. Ooh, a little baseball cap. We can do that. Yeah, vi you can do visor back or visor forward. That's nice. Hot dang. All right, cool. Now we're Ash catching with the zombie world. That's nuts. Uh, that's good. All right, let's, uh, well, hang on a second. I think we might be able to wear this denim shirt underneath. Yeah, okay. I need to take a look at, like, the, the gear screen that shows, I guess, everything we're currently wearing, which I don't know if there's a way to do that. I would imagine there probably is. Gotta kill them all. Gotta kill them all. Yeah, gotta kill them all. Mm. I wanna be the best ever was. Okay, uh, once you're ready, head through the door. Okay, you have to do E to head through the door. Remember that you can sneak and make less noise. Press C to crouch and move up to the wired fence. All right. Okay. All right. Oh, what happened to the other one? Oh, okay, there he is. Uh, all right, let's see. You gotta, you gotta climb over the wired fence. Okay. Damn. It's time to make some noise. Yeah, sure. Uh-oh. All right. Uh, every zombie in the forest heard the shotgun and they're coming for you. Okay. Well, I mean, we could just like... Okay, they're getting closer. Uh, you know how to run. Here's how to sprint. Uh, sprint to the marker by the outhouse now. Uh, oh. Left alt to toggle sprint. Okay, last advice. If you ever get a zombie bite or fear, fear one is imminent, press the Q and you'll swallow the antidote. Uh, only kidding. All hope is gone. There is no antidote. <laughs> oh, was the cue like a was that like a like a summon? What do you mean all hope is gone? Like I'm not gonna i I'm not staying in the outhouse. Oh my god. Oh my god! That's a metric butt Christ of them. Shit, dude! That's crazy! Dude, we're turbo dead, but the wire fence is gonna hold. I've got a good feel. I got a good feel. This is this is a safe spot. The game also just feels like extremely quiet. Maybe I'm maybe I'm nuts. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. I did find, uh, the other day, though. Oh, there we go. That's a little bit better. I did find the other day that there is a, uh, oh! Well, then. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> oh, my God. There's so fucking many of them. Run! Whee! <laughs> all hope is gone. There's no antidote. Uh, get out of here then, you fucking angry little raccoon. Also, why are you like the mascot? What do you have to do with anything? Uh, strong panic. A a accuracy severely reduced. That's okay. We have a shotgun, so it doesn't matter. Oh, wow. I was about to say, why is the uh, visibility so shit? Oh, hey, anyway, look at this place. This seems safe. It's locked. Can I, like, shoot the lock out? Good. That's good. I think it's probably intentionally locked for the sake of the tutorial. We also have the Chevy Wubby. That's pretty cool. I'm just gonna go hang out in the woods. They, zombies can't go through the woods, remember? Yeah, I did. I found an application after the Devil May Cry 5 incident. Uh, I found an application that actually allows you to extend uh, Windows volume sliders past 100. Uh, you just check, you check a little box and then it allows you to push it past 100. And uh, I thought that was really neat because I was like, oh, thank God. I was like, so in that case, if we ever have another game that's like super fucking quiet. Running through trees scratches you in your clothes. What? That's crazy. I don't even know how to check that. Oh, God. Oh, no. Well, I mean, we're like obviously turbo dead. There's there is no surviving this. However, what is our like character stuff? Oh, I see. Yeah, we get. Wow. We're like really scratched up. Holy shit. And I'm guessing that always like builds when you're going through trees and shit i'm just trying to see like i'm trying to get a gauge of like what that is it doesn't seem too bad uh it seems to be about the same oh if you run through them so like if you like scrundle just slowly through them it's not gonna fuck you up okay cool well, that's neat uh okay i guess let's uh let's just go die because i'm sure like i'm sure the game wants us to die here so let's go do that let's go let's go get a little death what up gang Holy shit! Look at the health go down so rapidly. I press F1 to open up the survival guide, return to the main menu, and then survive the, the Nox event for real. All right, cool. Well, I guess let's go to the menu and uh, do the thing. Oh, I'm sure there's so much it doesn't cover, but it at least shows you, like, you know, how to do whatever. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, whew. All right, let's see here. So we've got playstyle. we got Apocalypse, Survivor... 
which is a powerful combat, uh, or powerful combat, longer lifespan, a challenging playstyle based on PZ's previous survival mode. Uh, Builder, which is construction, exploration, farming focus, a more relaxed experience. And then custom sandbox. Little old raccoon, he's so fucking cute. What a good, what a good little weird mascot. Oh. Soon may the bitter man come to bring us uh, bitter birth, frog and gun. One day when the streaming is done, we'll take our leave and go. You like Prepper Raccoon? He's pretty fucking cute. I'm not going to lie. He's pretty dang cute. All right, so we got a... Uh, what is this? Challenges? A really CDDA? I'm not... You get out of the shower and fall badly. You're blind, drunk, and have a nasty cold. On top of all this, the house is on fire. Today is definitely not your day. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dude, those fucking challenges. Oh, my God. What are, what are the rest of these? A storm is coming. Good. Clouds are gathering. Yeah, this does... It feels very... Um, it feels like kind of Kenshi and like kind of RimWorld and like, but like with a zombie focus, I guess. Okay, uh, I'm going to give uh, Riverside a shot, I guess. This seems like a cool layout. So I'm going to go, I'm going to go with that. Uh, I don't know to do the save name. I guess we'll just call it like uh, uh, Panini, Panini Nini Pizza or something like that. And we'll do, oh, can't do that. Uh, I guess it needs to be, there we go. Panini Pizza. Cool. Oh my god! <laughs> oh god! I'm the storm that is a uh, Unemployed? That's pretty sweet. Uh, wow. Um, I guess as far as... I'm Welcome Burger... Do you Burger Flipper? Don't fuck with it. Corn Dog with the 52 months! Thank you, buddy. Welcome back aboard and hope you enjoy the ride, because the ride never ends. I'm thinking, uh, I like... I like the idea of a, uh... I, that's pretty cool. Like the background here, you can like have like traits or whatever. So, um, I guess for I guess we'll just create a custom uh class here. Uh, outdoorsman seems like it could be pretty good because it's like you know it says that you're not affected by harsh harsh weather conditions. Um, I'm not putting any like detractors there. Twitch streamer is not an option, but then again, like you know, extra knockback for melee weapons, increased carrying weight. Uh, sure. Oh yeah, dude, we could be like Lumberjack, Lumberjack Larry. I'm okay with that. We'll do like a little bit of a, we'll do like a little hiking in there. Um, <laughs> do like a little hiking in there? I don't know. Maybe there is like, maybe there just is like straight up like Farmer or like Lumberjack or whatever. Oh, okay. These are like the major skills over there, I guess, for uh, points left to spend. Negative 16. Does that mean I, does that mean I already, already took too many, uh, I took too many, took, took too many boys? I think I did. Yeah, I did. Oh my god. Uh, I guess that has to do with the... Yeah, I mean, let's do, like, uh... I like, I like that. That's nice. We'll leave that up there. Okay, we have zero points to spend if we pick farmer and then just, like... Oh, you have to put in detractors. Oh, okay. I see. Oh, man. That's, uh... If you pick detractors, it gives you point points back. Can you just, like, not have, like, any major traits, I guess? And just kind of roll with, like, some neutral shit? Mm -mm -mm. Are you suggesting that mindless zombos don't care about mommy milky e girl bathwater? Twitch streamers would be the first to die in the zombie apocalypse. They wouldn't see it coming. I don't know, man. We we get we get we get a lot of random like news and bullshit. So I'm gonna give you have to put in tractors. You're a tractor. All right, fuck it. Here we go. We're just gonna do it. This is a. Uh... Oh my god. Uh, this is gonna be uh Plembert. Uh, Plembert Pennington is going to be the, uh, the name of this person here. He is, uh, I like, I like, I like, I actually like the way Plembert looks right there. Chest hair? Hell yeah, he's got chest hair. This is Plembert Pennington. He's going to do just fine. We got left part. Oh, I like his, I like his gray hair too. Beard type? Plembert Pennington has like a, he's got a full beard. He's had a hard life, but that's what we're, we're, we're going with that. That's Plembert. Uh, Plembert does not like baseball caps. Plembert does have glasses. Uh, Plembert has, he does not want a tank top. Uh, give him, give him a little lumberjack shirt. Oh, it's looking good, Plembert. What other, look at that. That's nice. Got like a long sleeve t-shirt and that. He's got some jeans on. Good for him. He's got some jorts. Plembert, Plembert would wear jorts, but at the same time, I feel like Plembert's going to get his ass eat. So he's watched the fuck out. How about his regular short? Damn, Plembert. 
<laughs> Damn, Flembert looking good. <laughs> yeah, I don't like his formal shorts. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Give him that. Give us just a fancy shoes. That's nice. Looking good. Looking good, Plembert Pennington. Stupid sexy Plembert. He does have some dummy thick ass legs though. That's pretty wild. All right, this is Plembert Pennington. These are the end times. This is your mom. We're not making Zombo Ash catch. I want to get in here and try this. This seems really interesting to me. So like, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna fire it up as Plembert Pennington and see where we can go. Plembert Plembert Pennington's uh, survival is. Uh, Hello, Plembert Pennington. This is how you died. Kenshi kind of started off slow for us on stream, but then, like, people got, like, super into it. Oh, dude, like, spears? Thank God. Those are really good for, uh, Zambi. He said invest. He said he'd clean up. I don't know what the fuck's happening here. Crouch. Uh, sur survivors can now crouch behind the walls and fences to reduce their visibility. Sprint. Auto climb. Stomp the head. Spears. Clothing protection. I feel like this is all... The fuck? Belt. Oh shit, we got a TV! Wow, okay, so this is like... New duck and cover. Uh, yeah, okay, so we got sneakies. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the guide up because I feel like the guide can probably be pretty handy. Alright, so Plembert Pennington, how old is he? Plembert, you're a strong son of a gun. <laughs> he has no... At, at any given time, we basically have zero bite resistance. Uh, let's see. The smell of home, you know? To start, you need some cooked chicken. Okay. Uh, oh, wow. We can, like, actually cook? Look at these grapes. They're fresh. Oh, a good smattering of mayonnaise. Can I take the mayonnaise and then... Can I place the mayonnaise... Oh, God. Uh, can I place the mayonnaise in the oven? I want to cook the mayonnaise. Uh, maybe I can. I want to put in container oven. Okay. Can we just cook? Can we cook this mayonnaise? Turn on. <laughs> I, would, I would like to... <laughs> oh my god, I'm actually cooking the mayonnaise! Holy shit! That's what I'm talking about. That's what you do, Plembert, you disgusting piece of shit. You cook mayonnaise until it's nice and hot. And then eat it out of a bowl like soup. You are disgusting. Take that shit out and eat it. Eat it right now. Yes! Thank God the good, warm, thick mayonnaise! God, there is nothing, nothing, nothing like a good, like nice and freshly whipped, hot, hot cup of mayo. I like to put it in my coffee mug and then just sip on it. You think we should cook the grapes too? Probably not, but I am going to take them, so... This guy, this guy, Plembert kind of leaves like a, he leads like a sad life. Or this is the most hopping life. No, no, Plembert's life is really sad. I was going to say he's like a hopping bachelor, but the fact that his chair has doilies on it means that there is some really dark history going on here. Like, like there's some really, there's some really fucking, there's some really fucking dark history going on. The fact that he got that doilies. Mm -hmm. This is his house. I can tell because of the mayonnaise. Only somebody named Plembert Pennington would have hot mayonnaise. This place would rent for $1,800 a month. That's probably true, depending on where it is. I hope we get a clip of the hot mayonnaise, because I feel like I need to... I need to remember this for the rest of my life, so make sure you grab a... Make sure you grab a clip. It, it's not like... No, it's not sautéed. It's just heated up in the oven. And then, like, it's nice and thick and warm, and you just, like, slowly ooze pour it into a cup, and then you sip it. So... So I guess we just watch some TV, like... Or something. Um... I could disassemble it? Wow, that's interesting. Uh, not tired enough yet to sleep. Uh, I can... Can't just, like... I can't watch the... T oh, hang on a second. Value Tech Television. Uh, power source is nearby. Turn the volume on that TV, dude. Life and Living? What's Turbo? Cut your entertainment your way. Welcome to Turbo. Can I, like, ooh, maybe I could, like, uh, once everything just, like, falls the fuck apart, I could probably just, like, barricade myself in here for the most part. I can tell by the mayonnaise. <laughs> you can tell a lot by how man how a man takes his mayonnaise. And, like, I think, ooh, ooh, I can fill, <gasps> toilet bottle. What the fuck? I wanted toilet water. What is that shit? Okay, well, whatever. Um, 
sit on ground, investigate it. Can I start t <laughs> Plumbert has a very strange life. Nothing is wrong at all, but yet he sits here and he, uh, he wants to <laughs> He's sitting here and he decides to just disassemble his toilet. I guess I'll leave it on the news channel since, like, I don't know when the hell shit's gonna all, like, fall apart. The day. What? Today? Alright. I'm going outside for a minute. Dude, Plumbert Pennington's house isn't that bad. Oh, he has, like, a dog! Uh, somewhere. I don't think so. We need carpentry for that, which, uh, Plumbert Pennington is not a carpenter. Oh, shit, I probably just scratched my weenie. That's not good. Wow. Well, we got a neighbor's house over here. Like, no, everything's fine. Howdy, neighbor. That's not a neighbor! Oh, God, that's the barista from the coffee shop! Oh, God. Oh, shit, they're already, like... Shit has already gone down. Okay. Uh, well, let's, uh, shut the fucking door. Lock it. I don't know if you have to wait. Can I, like, get... Can I, like, put shit in front of that? Because I probably need to move something in front of that. Can I move stuff? Uh, rest, sleep. Disassemble? I don't know. I, I guess you can't grab things. Whoa! Can you? Maybe you can grab stuff. I don't know. I, I went to go get some sugar. I didn't realize that shit was going to be, uh... Shit was going to be going down. I gotta get, like, a weapon or something. All I have... All I have to my name is Hot Mayonnaise! Which, I mean, like, that'll... That'll keep most things away. But, like, you know... <laughs> just a little hot mayonnaise. Um, yeah, I don't know. Can you, like, move shit? Uh... I can check the key bindings really quick. Uh, key bindings... Uh, interact is E, but I, I tried E. I didn't, E didn't seem to work. Um, is something scrundling? What the fuck is scrundling? They ain't scrundling in my house. My house is safety. It's in a radial menu. Oh, God. I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. I still got a television. I could beat somebody to death with that. Fuck with it. Oh, my God. What happened? Where, where am I here? What is this? Uh, no, the voice recognition apparently is only, uh, I don't want to go back out there yet because I'm going to get scrunched. No, I'm not multiplayer, thankfully. Uh, not yet anyway. I mean, we might, we might do that. If I end up enjoying this, we might do that. Mm, oh, well, here's, here's a crafting menu. That's not what we need, though. What, what, what did I just do? What does M do? Oh, M is actually the map. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. What a what a world. Uh, let's see. Hotkeys. Nope, we don't need that. Search mode. Uh, combat. Maybe you can press space to do it. There's there's toggle mode over there. Wow, I don't know. That is weird. Maybe you do just hit E like next to stuff. I just want to put the chair in front of the door. I'm I'm fucking I'm I'm in fear for my life and I can't even. Good, good. Yeah, I tried V too. I didn't see uh, V. Didn't seem V. Just seems to turn off the UI. Uh, hey man, Q is fucking yell, and I knew that, and I did it anyway. <laughs> I fucking knew that from the tutorial, and I did it anyway. <laughs> um, let's see, vehicle heater, uh, horn. Uh, we got headlights. I'm desperate. You know what? Fuck it. I guess we just need to leave because there's nothing here worth defending. Like, I mean, all we've got is... Oh. <gasps> a pencil! Equip primary! Hell yeah! The pen is mightier than something. Oh, that VHS is called You're Dead. That's nice. Uh, there's some books here. There's expert fishing. Metal work for beginners. Look at that. That's pretty good. Cooking for intermediate... I could have done that. They would have told me how to do my hot mayo. Now, I mean, now I fucked up. I could have read on how to hot mayo earlier in the game. But I didn't. Uh, okay, where's our... There's Plumbert's, Plumbert's inventory. So can I just read this? <laughs> Fucking Zambini. Oh! You bitch, get out of here! Get out of here! What are you doing? Look, listen here. Get out, get on out of here. 
That's not good. Well, who broke into what? Oh god, I can't see shit. Let me shut this. <laughs> let me let me shut this. Uh, so we're good. We're good back here for right now. You know, in this uh, area where I'm, I'm not good actually. This will give me some time to continue. Uh... <laughs> you don't have door locks on your. You like an idiot. Get revenge on the book and plop it in an active oven. It's a good point. Okay, I could leave, but like all I have as a weapon right now is a pen seal. However, the pen seal might be. Ah, shit. What do you mean? Don't talk about Plembert like that. I don't remember how to get out of a window. What do you do? Just hit space or you click it or you hit E or something? Oh, God. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. If they come through this door, they're going to get a face full of pencil and they ain't going to know how to handle it. They're going to get it. Plembert ain't fucking around. I will stab a bitch with this number two. Okay, alright, well, I think we're good. I don't remember how to get out of the fucking... I remember space is, like, whatever. How do you... Oh, why? You don't have to do that, though. There was, like, a way you could just do. Okay, shh. Shh. Right. A pen still is mightier than something else. <laughs> what? What are you doing? You gotta get out of here! Oh! Okay, it's cool. We're gonna give him the old... We're gonna give him the old reach around. I gotta climb on through. There's no way I have to fucking, like, contextually write. What? Dude, you're so fast. All right, you better watch out, bitch. You about to get pen sealed. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Got him. Ooh! Uh. <laughs> Things have gone. Plimber, you lost your glasses. Take your time. Take your time. Take your time. I don't even know what's happening. I don't know how to button. You can also right click it and then slight leave. Oh, it said hold E. That makes so much more sense. Plembert, you can live. We got so far, we got into the bedroom and that's pretty amazing to be honest with you. We survived four hours. It's basically, we're good. Like we did it, right? We did it. We did it. So it's time for a new character and I had a feeling that Plembert was gonna fall apart. Uh, maybe once we learn the keys, we'll do a little bit better. So tell you what, this time, let's, uh, let's go with, uh, what are we gonna be this time? Because it, it really mattered that we were whatever we were last time, clearly. Let's go with Construction Worker, because I'm feeling it, but I am gonna spend some points on, uh, Cat's Eye. You know, because that's reasonable. Oh, look, you can transfer inventory items quickly, that's nice. Does it show you as a zombie, like, running around? Oh my god, does it? That's, like, really funny. Okay, I have to get myself a detractor if I want to be a Construction Worker, I guess. Uh, which would be... I'm gonna do... I guess I'll do Slow Reader, because, like, whatever. <laughs> Rip Lambert. Okay, uh, okay, I like the palette we're starting with here. This is, uh... This is Diana... Col... go oh, ooh. Kolchesky. There we go, that's a good name. Good job, Diana. You're gonna be very, uh, you're gonna be very relatable. <laughs> you're gonna be very, you're gonna be very relatable with a name like Kolchesky. I know who reads books. Books are ridiculous. Books are ridiculous. Uh, she'll be rocking a baseball cap. Uh, she's got glasses. I, I like, I like the, I like the starting duds here. These, these are all right. I'm down. I get down with all this. Okay. Well, this is Diana Kolchesky. I feel like maybe, maybe, maybe Diana was dealt like a poor hand, you know? I'm like, I'm, <laughs> I'm thinking that maybe, <laughs> maybe Diana Kolchesky was having a bit of a hard time. Now, I could be, I could be wrong. Um, I could be wrong, but, uh, yeah, they seem to, they seem to have a bit of a, a bit of a time. I'm looking at the tinfoil hats. I am. And, uh, I'm very, very impressed at, uh, really all of it. That was, it was a prom yeah, it was really a promising start, let me tell you. All right, let's, uh, let's random, can we randomize this a little bit? Uh, oh, cool, you can actually... Let me, let me see if I can get some inspiration. What we should do, we should just name each thing after somebody in chat. That way we can just, that way we can just be like, chat, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> chat, what the fuck are you doing? 
I think it's really cute that you get turned into a Zambi and then you should, uh... Okay, I, I need to get like a lock on the keybinds. So next time, as soon as we start this next one, I'm going to take a little take a little time to read through the keybinds again to kind of see what do. I had like a reasonable grasp of it uh, when we were doing the um, the tutorial. Like I, I felt like I had it, but then I just kind of lost it. So <laughs> I don't I don't know what happened. All right, let's do uh, Nightbot. And uh, if you die in the first like five seconds, I'll let you reroll because that was that was pretty ridiculous. I don't know what the fuck that was all about. All right, uh, if you want to type in Zombo, if you want to be a person, so. That was, yeah, that was great. Diana had a really good run. I'm really happy for her. I think she did, uh, I think she did very well. <laughs> oh my God. Are we talking about Zombie U? What are we talking about Zombie U for? Yeah, type in, type in Zombo if you want to. Okay, I can take a look here while we wait. Uh, so, so interact is E, and I guess to like climb through windows and shit, it's like hold E? Uh, toggle UI is V, uh, so that's a UI thing. Um, start vehicle engine, so apparently we can, like, get into a car at some point. Uh, rack firearm, yeah, control is, is, or aim is left control, which I knew that was, that was fine. Um, manual floor attack. Auto detect prone or standing attack. So, like, I guess you can, like, stomp. Oh, so you can hit space when they're on the ground and you can stomp them. That's interesting. I did right click. I don't like right clicking for climbing through a window because I would prefer to like be able to just kind of do it without having some type of like interact thing or whatever. That just seems like a good idea. This apparently supports controller, but I cannot see how the fuck that is how that would go well at all. Um. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's uh let's roll it out. This is the person. Whoever whoever wins this, you got to pick a. Uh, I mean, they're just going to name you after chat or unless you want like a different last name or something like that, but I'm rolling it. Squad. All right. Squad. Uh, we're going to just call you Squad Buttocks, I guess, because that makes sense because that's like your name. Uh, I want Squad to have like... I want to be he's real pasty. Got that chest hair, of course. Uh, I don't want the baseball cap, though. Time to die, boys. Let's go. <laughs> Time to hit it. Uh, like really, really obnoxious clothing. We're gonna put we're gonna put squad in some on-brand clothing. Kind of. Squad's looking good. He squad blends in well. I think, in my opinion, I like that mustache. Though. That's a pretty sweet stash that squad's got. So, I think I'm gonna stick with that. All right, squad, you ready? This is you. You're fucking your mustache, <laughs> bright pink boys. That's the best camo. <laughs> we're going in, gamers. Please don't be dead right away. Okay, cool. He's like in his house or whatever, so that's good. Um, all right, so this time I'm going to try to do a little bit better with like gathering, I guess, stuff we need. So we have a beer in there. Uh, we got a cherry. I don't know how he's going to carry all this. Sh Where the fuck? Like, how are they carrying all this stuff? You don't even have a bag. So I to protect the innocent. Uh, we got a dish towel. Uh, what else we got in here? Can Ooh, can what's that? Can Why do you have canned corn under the sink? Squad, you're a fucking animal. What is that? Oh, that's awful. Fucking canned corn under the sink. Okay, you're gonna use a you're gonna use a frying pan. Uh, that is gonna be that is gonna be your your attack. So get ready for that. Let's go check the uh, let's go check the the bedroom. Oh, that is not <laughs> that is not where I want to go yet. The outside is very scary. <gasps> Foundation makeup. Fuck yeah. Uh, oh, it's toothbrush, which is just junk. Well, I like how the toothbrush in the apocalypse has instantly just become junk. Okay, whatever. Like, dental hygiene's not important, but okay, that's that's totally fine. Uh, we got a comb, we got some pants, we got a t-shirt. Uh, I guess in case our shit gets ripped. Which it looks like we still have, we still have some decent, like, space here, so... That was all we had for that. Uh, TV over here is just doing whatever the fuck it's doing. <laughs> this is pause TV. I, what I want to know is why was the news not talking about like the the apocalypse? That just seems like a bad. This seems like a bad thing to not. Oh oh oh! Squad, you got a vehicle. Oh. I don't know how the fuck. How does this work? Uh, dig furrow with hands. I'm trying to fucking I'm trying to interact with this car. Oh, there we go. It's locked. Oh, it's your own car. Why are you key? Where are your keys? Oh my god. Where are your keys? 
You do have some sweet. Oh, there we go. It's the it's key ring right here. Do you not have your car keys? Does it not automatically use the car keys? Uh, place item, rename, favorite. I mean, it seems like that would be the right thing, but I guess not. I do like the fact that you have, like, your entire, like... D your life is completely normal right now, except for the fact that maybe you're running around with a frying pan. Which, I don't know your life. I mean, you might run around with a frying pan every day, but I don't know if that's exactly the case. So, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I We'd have to sneak up on them to do some serious... Woo! Yeah! Yeah, get him! Whoop, whoop, whoop! All right, squad, you got the first kill. How's it feel? Grab the corpse. I just want to look at it. How do I sniff it? Woo! Bitch, you, oh, bitch, you won't. Bitch, you won't. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Yeah, get frying pan. Wait a minute. Oh, are they dead? <gasps> they had some sweet glasses. Can I, can I grab those? Hell yeah. Okay, uh, we could... Damn! All right, let's get some claps out. We got first, uh, first, first and second kill. Oh, mouse up top to show inventory. Oh, right. Uh, they had a digital watch. Sweet. Uh, some socks, a gold ring. I don't really know what the fucking ring's gonna do. I don't know if there's a red digital watch. That's kind of nice. Yeah, I'll, I'll equip that. Uh, yeah, put that. Hell yeah. Hell, it's a nice watch. That's sweet. I'm gonna be the watch goblin. That's what I'm gonna do. I want all the watches. You got one too, right? Hell yeah. Put that shit on the right arm. <laughs> I am the time wizard. <laughs> I shall be the time wizard. Let me shut this door before some other shit happens. Lord almighty. I'm assuming the zombies have to like... Ooh, advanced foraging. That's probably good. Uh, so let's, uh, let's grab that. We're gonna need, like, a backpack here in a minute. Comic book? That might be alright. Uh, let's grab that. Foraging for beginners. Uh, Metalwork magazine. Trapping for beginners. Okay. Yeah, I'd imagine all those are probably pretty useful, so... I gotta be careful walking in, like, opening doors and shit. Because I have a feeling we're gonna get just, like, snundled here in, like, two seconds. Oh, the fridge probably... Oh, <gasps> sweet! Grapefruits and lemon, lemon frisch. I gotta find me a... I gotta find me, like, a backpack, though, or something. Um, so I decided to look it up. There's a Steam Workshop thing to make the text bigger. I might need that, because this does not seem to play very well with, uh, 1440p. I had to turn this up on my end a little bit. I need, I need, I need to be able to hear the, the Zambies, because I, I couldn't even hear, like, that last one. Bathroom's pretty sweet. Hey, a plunger! That's not useful. Do we have any, like, uh, we probably need to fill up, like, water bottles and shit, right? Wash yourself? Oh, shit, I can get myself a little spritz! Oh, that's nice. You can scale it up. It's in the options towards the bottom. Oh. Well, shit. There you go. All right. And we can... Uh, we can drink, but we can't fill anything yet. Can I, like... Can I wash, like, my shirt? Yeah, I got, like, nasty doo-doo blood all over my shirt. It's nasty. I don't want that. Squad, you're doing good so far, man. Is there, like, a reason to wash constantly? I'm guessing, like, keeping up hygiene is probably pretty good. We could sleep. Remove, remove the light bulb. Great. What the? What the hell is this? Ooh, I kind of like this closet, though. Like, this, this is, like, safety. There's no windows? This is nice. I can sit here. I can sit in the dark and eat my lemon. <laughs> what did you do today? I sat in the dark closet and ate my lemon. Well, at least those, uh, at least those assholes are, um, you know, dead. That's good. Uh, I need to figure out if I can start, like, disassembling stuff. I'd like to get, like, break off a leg of a wooden chair or something like that. I feel like there'd be a better, uh, like there'd be a better striking weapon. Oh, it shows the, the, t the time up there when you have a watch. That's cool. Unless it always showed that and I just didn't notice. I think? That's pretty cool. It might have already been up there. Dig furrow with hands. I, I'm not... I'm not furrowing. Look at this! These guys... These guys hit each other. Why is there blood on the hood? Oh, there's some zombies over there. I gotta watch out. Is there anything in this, uh... Uh, sit on ground. Dismantle car wreck. Vehicle mechanics. Oh my god. 
It's gonna make so much noise. What do you do? Oh my god. Uh, what? Just gonna, just gonna close that for a minute because I feel like that is uh, infinitely more robust than I was expecting. <laughs> That was, that was a lot. Is it a fucking, I'm sorry. Were we next to a graveyard? Is that where we were? This dude has a knife in his back. We gotta take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Come on, squad. You're gonna go pump him. Pump him. Pump him. Bitch ass. God, the fucking frying pan of justice. Oh, hell yeah. Wow, this fucker's got some, uh, fucker's got some sustainability. Okay, he had... Oh, was that a fork that was stuck in his back? Wow. I thought that was like a... Uh... Never mind. I thought that was a knife. I'm a little disappointed now. How's our, uh, how's our frying pan holding up? Like, I would imagine if this is like a cast iron, this bitch... This bitch probably hanging in there, right? Like, a cast iron frying pan in the zombie apocalypse would probably be no joke. Like, that fucker would... That fucker would last forever, and you could also be, just beat the shit out of stuff. Uh, okay, let's take a look at this. Woo! Yeah! Oh! You, yo, you bitch! How dare! How dare you! Get him. Get him. Get him. Well, we, I think we did get bitten, though. Uh-oh. Oh, no! We got, we got bitten in the head. In the head. <laughs> like, I don't know. Well... It's been real. I guess we're dead, right? Because, like, do you just die if you, uh... Do you just die if you get bitten? I'm, I'm assuming you do. I wonder about the... Oh, I suppose it doesn't stop you from, like, surviving or whatever. Ooh, fire poker would be pretty OP. Yeah, we gotta find somebody that has, like, a, uh... Can I use... The, I could dry myself. <laughs> I could dry myself. <laughs> I can't believe I got bitten in the face. What a, uh, what a time that was. Let's, uh, let's use the sink to wash, uh, uh, wash ourselves, I guess, at least. If bitten, it's basically death. Yeah, but we're fine. Like, we'll be okay. We won't turn for, uh, for quite a while, right? How is my favorite weapon bare hands? My favorite weapon is the frying pan. <sighs> yeah, I think, for, okay, so, like, first thing we need to figure out is, like, What's amazing to me is that nobody's bathroom, like, shit has, like, bandages in it, which is just unbelievable. Am I still dripping? Yeah, yeah I'm still dripping. <laughs> oh, yeah, we dripping. Damn infected. <laughs> Woo! All right, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna leak for a little bit. Uh, because unless we can, like, find some bandages. Which, uh, as you can see, there's, like, 400 Zambongis over here. So whatever, I guess. Oh, my God. There's so many of these assholes. Okay, climb through the window. Thank you. Damn, that takes forever. Oh, I should probably should have shut it. Alright, cool. We're good. Ah! <laughs> Alright, into the safety bedroom. Uh, can I... Do you have to be able to, like, move shit? There's no way you can't. Well. Life, life comes at you fast. <laughs> no, not yet. Oh, what are you guys? Hang on. <gasps> can I clap their ass with a trash can? No, but you can use a you can use a garbage bag as a container. Wow, that's interesting. Squad run! Pop one. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pop him on the way out! Jo what? This thing didn't even got no gas. Oh, uh, yeah, things were going, things were going like okay, and then, uh, then they weren't. All right, what we, what we got going on in here? Oh shit! Can't jimmy the window. Oh, daddy yo! All right, shut it. No, that's okay. I'll stay. You're Monetary trapped in here with assistance. me. Monetary. Who's assistance. giving me this stream money? Monetary Clark. Assistance. How's it going? Dude, we were asking about you last night. I was like, I hope Clark's good. I haven't seen him in a little bit. Yeah. Look at squad the fucking unit. Look at this. Piles of them. Bring in the dead. Bring them in. 
They can't stop us. Mine are bleeding, thirsty, got a broken fucking bone or something. Got pain. We got it all. We got it all, but we're fine. Maybe I can find a bandage in here and like somehow hang in there. <gasps> baloney! Sorry, stick the baloney in the in the wound. Stick the baloney in the wound. It will also hydrate you. The oils will. That's how that's how hydration works. Use use the baloney oil. Okay, what all we got in here? We got bread knife, carving fork, a dish towel, and a saucepan. Fuck yeah. Look at the absolute state of this kitchen. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of enamored by the fact that like no one really has. Okay, apply bandage to head. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Um. Now I can now I can wash myself. I guess. You can shred cloth for clothing. Oh, I've like used like a bandage. Well, I found a fucking band aid. I had stuck on band aid brand because band aid stuck on me. Also, thank you, Clark, for the $10 and 10 cents. I appreciate it. Y'all give Clark some love and chat. And happy New Year, buddy. I don't know if we got to... I don't know if we got to see you on New Year's. I can't remember. Blonde hair dye? Perfect. Uh... Uh-oh. What was that? You bitch. You bitch. You bitch. Bitch. Stay away. <laughs> oh my god. Does anybody know how to fucking push shit? Like, there has to be a way to move, like, environmental objects, right? There's no, uh... If, anybody, yeah, if anybody's got, not, got, like, the idea on how to do that, like, the default keybind for it, since apparently I just did not see it. Also, what is this fridge? Hey, Nick, so the person that we thought uh, that kidnapped my cousin in 1986 was finally arrested this morning after the FBI, FBI took her my aunt's case. Holy shit, dude. Uh, that's amazing. Died. What's like, you, you, got, you got to add more to that story. That is intense. I'm going to wash myself in the toilet. Anxious, on edge, slightly thirsty. Uh, can I drink from toilet? Yeah, hell yeah. Uh, sever uh, severe injuries, strength and speed severely reduced. We're actually not, like, in the worst situation. It... Does it say we're infected anymore? I don't know what's happening. I don't even know if we're in that bad of a spot right now. Can I, like, uh, can I, like, pop this bandage off? Yeah, bandage dirty, but that's fine. Uh, can I just take the bandage off and swap it? Uh, let's see. Drop it? Oh, no, I need that. I need that one. Can I use that one instead? Uh, I guess I would need to, like, remove bandage and then put, like, a, a freshie. Okay, now we're bitten, bleeding, and infected. Uh-huh. Apply, apply directly to the forehead. Got it. Okay. All right. So we're no longer, we're no longer dusty damage. Um, okay. So you were saying, uh, mouse over the end table on the upper left. Oh, like this one? What is this? Oh, yeah. I wasn't here on New Year's because I was dog and house sitting for some people. And then I went over to see family for a bit. Well, it's good to see you, Clark. Happy New Year, buddy. And thank you for the $10 and 10 cents. Putting us up to you. $11.10 for this fine Project Zomboid stream. And uh, thank you guys for all the support, as usual. I appreciate it. Okay, so I'm basically going to have to keep that bandage on for, like, ever. This is a crunchy, crunchy glass out here. Oh, dude, I could get those under those dirty, dirty zombie undergarments and turn that into a bandage. That's what I want to do. I want to stuff dirty zombie underwear into my cuts. Nice rotten, rotten stuffies. Okay. Don't think there's gonna be anything in here unless I can like uh, close the curtains. All right. Uh, let's uh, <laughs> fancy toilet. Can I just <laughs> take a, take a full ass shower? I guess let's wash all of our clothes, even though our bandage is dirty as shit again. I'm sorry, Carl. I keep like dodging. There's a lot to take in with this game, so I'm trying my best here. Wow, washing all of our clothes is taking some considerable time. 
yeah, I mean, we ain't dead. Like, uh, we we thought we were gonna be dead, but we're we're hanging in there. We're all right. You can come out with the two dollars. Put us up to thirteen dollars for the night. Thank you guys so much for supporting this show. I appreciate it. Thank you for keeping us in business, keeping me from, you know, being like, I guess let's get another job. <laughs> this is good. Uh, look at that short sleeve shirt. That's nice. A black speedo. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, I got that under my pants. It's, it's good. This is a safe little house. I like this place. Uh, there's a TV remote. Uh, there's a TV remote with no television. There's a baking pan, a bread knife. Ooh, bread knife might be good to stab. Ooh, oh, that's a nice. Hmm. There's a, a fresh orange. Eat that bitch. My aunt never gave up. She went through hell with the Lexington police back in the day. They threatened to drop her case numerous times and just generally don't didn't care. It was shit. Dude, that's fucking nuts, man. Like, I'm so glad that like something's going on with that, right? Like, that's that's amazing. Can I just turn on the oven and then just leave? Uh, settings. Temperature. Five. Wow, look at this! No timer. Absolutely not. Yeah, 300 degrees Celsius. That seems good. Uh, I want to uh, cook... I want to cook my cherries. Okay, there we go. I just, I just want to cook more mayonnaise. <laughs> These are so fresh and delicious. They've only been cooking for like a... I'm just going to leave them in there. I hope this doesn't burn down the house. I do I do tend to like this house. How about we have a sit? Let's have a little sit down. What do you mean sit on the ground? Why can't I sit in the chair? Oh, sleeping. Experiencing too much pain to sleep. God, same. Um, what else can we do? We could, uh, oh, we could read, uh, you know, something, even though we're definitely, definitely dead. I just realized this entire time that the door was just fucking open. Oh, oh, that's a lot. Now they know we're here. And now it is nightfall. Oh, this place is stacked. Oh, my God. Uh, they got granola bars? Oh my god, look at this place. I gotta find something to carry shit in, because, like, otherwise... Oh, fuck, they're bonging. This place has, like, an upstairs... I'm going to the bathroom, maybe they won't find me. I think they're, I think they're gonna find me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, man, they're coming, dude. Ooh, ooh, cooked milk? Yum. Yum. No actual sitting in furniture. That seems like a really weird thing, considering how, like, how many other, like, deep interactables they already have. Like, the fact that you can interact with an oven and change its temperature is, like, absurd. I, I guess we're cool with dirty bandage. What does this mean? Is this, like, heart rate, or is this, like, overall body status? Like, are we getting better? I don't know. I don't know if we're getting any better. We might be. <laughs> Holy shit. What if, this is all crazy. So far, all the food you've seen in people's fridges is fresh, and I won't stand for this unrealistic de depiction of society. Oh, yeah. Do you think that shit would all be, like... Dude, I'm gonna bread knife a son of a bitch. Squad's got this. What is this down here? Oh, I guess this is where you can like... Oh, you can put like quick access stuff down here. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, I'm going to go over to the left because there's a little mini map down there that might interest people, so... I don't know where... Oh, it's like the it's the bunk beds. All right. Uh, what's in here? Red pen. Right. Uh, here's a fucking chair. I guess I could I could get out. I suppose. I feel, I feel like nighttime. Uh, pro probably not the best place. 
<laughs> They're probably not the best shit to be out here at nighttime. Um, wow, that is a big group. Holy shit. Oh my god, they're all over the roads. Jeez. Oh, jeez. Get him, squad. Oh! Get him. Woo! It seems like frying pan was the way, man. That was like the tech. Frying frying pan was a uh, solid. A nice, uh, nice, nice Kong going. Yeah, I wouldn't want to interrupt the goth kids raving out. Hey, coffee, how's it going? <laughs> she has a goth oh, coming. Look at all this trash. Can I investigate the trash? What's what is search mode exactly? Whoa. What does that do? What does that mean? Here's a sweet, uh, here's a sweet, like, news van. Oh! Oh, but we don't have keys. Oh, no. Was this a news station? No. No, it's like a department store. Look at all this crazy shit, dude. This is so neat. Are you kidding? Are you fucking eating my ass right now? Oh, my God. I guess I would have to, like, break a window. Uh... Holy shit, what are you guys doing about the dumpster? This ain't Applebee's! Alright. Break the window. Do it. Nice. Dude, none of this is open. Oh my god. Maybe somebody left their keys in their car. That'd be a no. No key for this car, found. <laughs> somebody just left their keys dangling. How about this one? I mean, are there any cars that we'll ever find that actually just have like their kid? Woo! No, squad, you've been nibbled! <laughs> you've been nibbled! Okay, is, is there any of these places fucking like... This is, this is a, this is an absolute travesty, like... No! Where's my, uh, where's my fucking, where's my stick? Where's, where's old Trusty? There they are. Okay. Old Trusty will break these windows for us. Get out of here! I'm telling you, dude, fry pan is like, that is peak. You asshole! Woo! Oh, oh, oh! Attack! This is it! Come on in, you scrundlers. Yeah, open up. Come on in. Dude, squad's going down swinging. You kidding? Look at this. Oh, God, this is bad. Oh, no, no. Squad, get him. Go down swinging. Well, he did go down swinging. I mean, I got to give him that. That went way better than the first time. We actually, like, got to explore for a little bit. But now I know. Now I know is we need to find a place like this. We need to bust into one of these places. Cause like, this is where the jam is. And maybe we could find like some keys to get a car or some shit. That's what we're doing. Did you get beat? Oh, I got beat big time. All right, let's try it. Let's do Riverside again. And uh, this time we are gonna be, this will start as like a lumberjack. We're ax man, sure. Better at chopping trees, faster ax swing. If I'm a cook, can I like, maybe the burger, maybe the burger flipper can like, I want the burger flipper to be like fry pan power and just beat the shit out of stuff. I like the I like the night vision. You got the eyes of a cat and he does karate or some shit. Okay, uh, next person, we're gonna pull this up. If you want to be a zomboid thing, then uh, type in in chat. Uh, type in in chat zombo, and uh, you, you you're gonna be you're gonna be the uh, the focus of the next thing. You like hot sauce, right? I hate whatever you're about to link because I know it's gonna be awful. I know it's gonna be terrible. It has to be terrible. There's no way this is good. <sighs> Homemade fermented mango habanero hot sauce for my Gen Z coworkers. It's the Among Us and it is uh, a dabbing Among Us hot sauce.
Do you think... Do you think it was made ironically, or do you think this was for real? Or do you, or do you fucking think this is for real? Even if you put it in before, make sure you, uh, make sure you do it, make sure you do it again. <laughs> made for real, ironically. That is true, I guess there is no irony in 2022, that, that, that ain't real. That ain't real. Oh. This has been pretty fun so far, I like this. <laughs> Fucking hot sauce. I mean, I try it too because I like hot sauce, but like. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this has been uh, this has been pretty fun, dude. This is actually uh, it's been a it's been a solid uh, been a solid thing for tonight. And uh, I'm gonna talk about. Oh, actually, I was wrong about the stuff, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight on this stream, we have made fifteen dollars and ten cents, which is the actual number. I was apparently incorrect. And then on top of that, we've also gotten 12 subscribers, which is rad. Thank you guys so much for all the support. As usual, I do appreciate it. And I hope, uh, hope you guys are having fun, because I'm definitely having fun. So if y'all are having fun, because if y'all ain't having fun, then that defeats the entire fucking point of doing this. Rolling this out. Azuri, congratulations. You're going in. Uh, what do you want your last name to be? Do you want it to be, uh, what do you want it to be? Well, I guess it doesn't matter too much. It could be, it could be, it could be Azuri Harrison. Well, I'm dead. I don't think dead people can have fun. Damn. Never thought you were going to play this. Didn't seem like your kind of thing. What? What? Dude, fuck him. After, like, Kenshi and, like, all that shit, this, this feels like zombie survival Kenshi. That's what it feels like. You just kind of start. There's just a bunch of bullshit going on, and you go do, like... It definitely, it definitely feels like that way. It's like modern, modern zombie survival Kenshi. It's got, like, really weird interactables that you wouldn't really expect. Uh, Azuri Corndog. I like that. That's a pretty good name. That's a pretty good name. Apparently you can increase the size of menus and stuff already, so I'm gonna go check that. Uh, I guess we'll leave skin as it is. We're gonna do... Uh, Azuri's gonna have a... I don't know what the Rachel is. Oh, that's like the actual... the, the haircut from Friends, right? Chop, Chop Girls is a little bit terrifying. Uh, what the hell is the lob? I don't like the lob. Not feeling it. Uh, what about the bra- uh, I don't like that one either. Yeah, Bob's alright, whatever. The Brutal Zombie Poopopalypse is very fun. It actually is pretty fun, yeah. Uh, let's do a color hair. We're gonna do like this red hair or whatever. Um, let's do a, a tank top. Let's do like a shirt. A little short sleeve shirt, it could be like a- it could be like a light- well, I guess we can't do that one light blue, because it's like a- whatever. Yes and no. Wait, what was yes and no? I'm sorry, was I moving too quick and I didn't take feedback? Uh, what about grungery? Oh. The only really way to turn Nick off a game is make it a post-apocalyptic pirate-themed VN. Yeah, I would probably do it. Like, post-apocalyptic pirate-themed VN would definitely, definitely, definitely do it. I'm just Stakes has got the bead there with the I don't I can't stand pirate shit like I dry up so bad Why I don't know why I just really do hold back pull back looking pretty stupid too Her last name was corn dog like actually corn dog that is ridiculous. I can't fucking believe that Let's go baseball cap. I can dig it. Actually. I, I can't dig it. That thing's gross Maybe there's like a different type uh, some glasses? We can do glasses? That is true. Gal gun. Well, Gal gun made me uncomfortable because a girl was stuck in a window being like, no, no, and it's like, shoot her to make her orgasm. I'm like, I, this is very wrong. I was like, I don't like this. This is for a very particular type of person who is like, I guess, into this kind of shit, and I ain't into that shit. So, fucking, you have fun with Gal gun and being all touchy and whatever. That shit's gross. Okay, like that hit like that level of like weird Japan that I'm just like, I, I'm not doing this. <laughs> I was like, I'm, I'm not, no, nah, I'm good. I'm good. It, t it takes a good bit for me to feel like uncomfortable with the game and Gal Gun made me feel very uncomfortable. I was like, I feel like this is so far past like, haha, stupid Japan. And it's like, I feel like they're actually going to call the cops. Like this is antidepressants. Hell yeah, Zuri, we're doing good. Uh, we can also drink a little toilet water. 
Let's see if we can find another like frying pan because that was like that was that was the jam right there. We got some canned carrots. It seems like some of the food is not like super hard to come by yet. Uh, but getting like a uh, okay, we got hand torch, uh, also known as a fucking flashlight. <laughs> oh look, a plastic bag! Oh my god, she's seen your card gauge. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Sonor card gauge. Let me get it right. Look at water bottle too. Damn, we're killing it on this one. Hell yeah. All right, we're fucking Sunron card gauge. All right, let's get that saucepan and let's uh equip that as primary. Now I'm guessing that I can like Oh, Desiree, you are a burger flipper. Hell yeah. A respectable profession. Uh so the plastic bag, I guess I like equip that or whatever. I don't know how this works. Put in container covered. Can you not Oh, I guess it has to be, like, certain types of containers. I'm guessing. That's what it look, it's looking like. I think, uh, I think Azuri lives in a tra- Is this, like, a van down by the river? Shit. A van, the van down by the river nowadays would be, like, a very sought-after piece of property. Put that shit in, like, Washington somewhere near, like, a water source? People would probably be all about that. Okay, so this house is locked. Hey, boy, with a dollar, putting us up to 16 bucks for the night. Thank you for doing it. Can I? I don't think I can break that open. Uh, can I just, like, get in this window? I was about to say, how are all of the windows, like, good? This is crazy. Can I? I was about to say, can I not shut that window? The van down by the river would be, like, $2,000 a month in Washington. Yeah, probably. That, what, that was where that skit was, uh... Uh, I can fill the saucepan with water and then beat someone with it. Amazing. But yeah, y'all gave Abuera some love with the dolly. It says, you reminded me the other day of uh, the state of Japanese gaming. All right, we're in the middle of a game, so I'll uh, have to check that here in a little bit. Uh, okay, that's locked. Uh, we got a CD. Look at that. It's in headphones. Wow, that's fun. Uh, let's wear this military green camo shirt, I guess, because it's probably got, like, maybe... Something going on with it? That's plum out of luck. T-shirt on the bed. Uh, that that window is still open. I couldn't close it. I don't think. Ah, whoever lived here fucking sucked. Ooh, cleaning liquid. I can like I can drink that when it's time to go. All right. Uh, let's see. There's a sponge over there. Uh, the meat patty, fresh cooked. Yum, yum. Yum, nice meat. You walk into someone's house you've never met. Zombie apocalypse happen. You see meat in the oven. What you do? All right, dude. We're uh, we're substantially meated, dude. Wait, I saw like a... What was that cabinet I just saw that had like a bunch of shit in it? Oh, uh, there's baloney. What, what the? Oh, that's the fridge. I was like, what the fuck is this? Dead mouse. Oh, my God. Oh, beef jerky. That'll hold. Shove it into eyeballs. Baking pan. Uh, baking tray. Some, some good. There's some solid bonk. Uh, some solid bonk going on Welcome up there. But Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, fuck. How do I? Oh, phew. Okay. Ooh. I need to, uh, I need to equip the saucepan. Uh-oh. Shh. What, what did happen to the saucepan? Is it no longer equipped because I filled it with water? Oh my god. Oh, <gasps> you bitch, you bitch. Don't you, don't you focus me? I'm just gonna go. Uh, okay. We're in, we're in, we're in. I don't know how long we're gonna be in, because they're coming. Newspaper, comb, and a pencil. I just feel like we're not doing very good on the, uh... We have no weapon. We do have some antidepressants, though, so no sad. Uh, that's good. Can I empty this, or, like, what... Oh my god. 
Oh, can't open those windows, though. I really wish I could, like, push shit in front of a door, but it seems like I can't. So, I might be fucked here, because I don't even know if I have a thing. I, mean, I, I could I could beat them with a book. Like, actually. I can't. Actually, that's not a thing I can do. Can you drink the water in the pan? Maybe? Pour on ground? Hang on, zombie. I need to empty out my pan. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Stand tall. Stand tall, Azuri. Come on, bitch. That's a lot more than I thought, though. Uh-oh. These are some sturdy-ass fucking windows, dude. Well, at least the TV works. I mean, we've got entertainment. That's great. Uh, that's really good. <laughs> you gonna die? <laughs> you out there, you gonna die. I don't know, man. I, I feel like if we can... If I could bear... Well, I can't barricade the door, because, like... Can I maybe, like, just turn this off? I'm gonna disassemble this chair real quick. I thought that one had given up. That was not the case. They did not give up at all. Oh, hey! You broke the window! Nice. Thank you. Yeah, but see, if I go through that window, I'm gonna... Yeah, if I go through that window, I'm gonna fucking... Uh... I don't want the thing. I want, like, whatever they have. What the shit? Uh, pick up broken glass, remove... Oh, I can, like, remove the broken glass. Oh, neat! Oh, that's cool! So I guess, like, if you have... If you have time, there's, like, a lower chance that you'll... Like, if you have time to, like, clear the, the passage, you have a lower chance of getting, like, cut going through the window. Yeah, you're not dead! We got out! Like, that one zombie saved us. Since apparently I, for some fucking reason, couldn't break that damn, uh, window. Barbecue info. <laughs> Barbecue info! Oh, you'll get cut in all if you remove the glass. Awesome. That's really neat. <gasps> Trash can. Okay, I really wish the garbage... Can the garbage bag be used as, like, an actual container? Or do I have to get like a real a real bag for that? Yeah, I guess I gotta get like a real a real fucking bag. I really I want the tra I know I fa that's my house, Kanchi. What the fuck? Can't take my trash house. Look at all that trash over there. Why am I shoving? <laughs> Break down a door with a pan. I just don't understand how containers work. I guess. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's a Ninja Turtle. Pop him. Pop him, Missouri. Fucking take him out. Take him out to the ball game, idiot. Get out of here. Hey, a digital watch. Look at that. Uh, set alarm wear on right wrist. Now we know the time. Oh, you need to equip it on either hand for... Oh, so I can use the trash bag. All right, well, let me, uh, let me drop this. Let me go get the... I want the trash bag. Give me the trash. So you have to put it on a... So, like, equip it in, like, secondary... Secondary slot or whatever? Oh, okay. hell yeah! Look at, me. Look at me, man! I don't know if that did anything. Can I place anything in the garbage bag? Like, can I put my jeans in my trash bag? I don't know how this fucking works. <laughs> I don't know how this works. <laughs> oh my god! I'm the trash master! You better watch the fuck out, bitch. Get popped. The trash master don't give a shit. Uh, they got some bangles. They got some sacks. Stupid. Azuri corn dog. Trash demon. 
Hey, man. I, mean, I feel like a fucking, like, homeless person would probably do pretty well. This place is, like, halfway burned down. What the fuck happened there? Somebody left the stove on. <laughs> go, 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 go. I like how we survive night by just like getting doors banged on and just being fucking weird. This is a pretty nice like little trailer park thing. And how do you break window? What does it say? Unpleasantly hot. Yeah. Someone overcooked their mayo. True, true, true. Whoa! Oh, you're also trying to break in. Samesies. Taking Samesies. Uh oh. What? What the fuck just happened? That was so weird. Yeah. Yeah, then. Silver nose stud, tank top, socks, boxers, red digital watch. All right. Oh, I was running through the forest. Oh, okay. So, like, if you can... Oh, so you can smash the window and remove the broken glass. I probably just attracted a shitload of them, though, right? That was probably really stupid. Well. Uh, lipstick, toothbrush, nice. I'll just leave that shut for now, I guess. All these goddamn books. Book learning ain't doing me none good. There's like, there's pl butter. Oh, hell yeah, just eat an entire stick of butter. There's a fresh taco shell. Uh, baking pan, spatula, gr griddle pan. Oh my God, dude. Saucepan, friendship ended. Fucking friendship ended with saucepan. <laughs> now griddle pan, my best friend. <laughs> Give me that fucking griddle pan, dude. Create stir fry from random meat. Okay. Dude, hell yeah, I'm about to go griddle some bitches. McGriddle to me this, McDongles. Pants, polo, neck sweater. Formal shirt, uh, cool magazine, newspaper. All right, well... That seemed to be anything going on over here. However, we were unpleasantly hot a minute ago, so that doesn't appear to be a problem anymore. We're actually hanging in there pretty well. We have, like, water. We have a thing to store water in. We got our gross little garbage bag, which I don't understand how the gross garbage bag... Oh! There's an entire inventory for garbage bags. So can I take, like, spaghetti and dump it in the garbage bag? Fuck. Yes, I am the trash man. Okay, let's zoom out and make sure we're not, a. Uh... Make sure we're not getting zomboided. Oh, God. I kind of want to find, like... <laughs> I love how Azuri's just casually strolling... <laughs> casually strolling through... <laughs> with their trash bag and their fucking griddle. <laughs> oh, my God. It's 73 degrees out. Nobody is unpleasantly hot in 73 degrees. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, my God. That's what a trash demon do. Gotta hang in there, man. Big trash demon style. <sighs> God, there's so many assholes over here. I don't even know where we're going. Is this, is this like open plains? What is this? There has to be like a thing. Oh my God. I don't even know where we are. <laughs> I don't even know where I am. Uh, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty open field here. Very quiet at the moment too. Oh, we're uh, we're moist, slightly damp, rain or sweat. Okay, if I scundle through the trees, I would imagine, I would imagine they can't follow me as well, right? Okay. Oh. I hear those cicadas though. This must be like. This is in Kentucky. I mean, this that bitch, it gets hot there. All right, we're going to try to... Uh, I'm going to try to scootle-doodle through this. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
No, no. All right, go, Missouri, go. Uh, if we stay on the main road, we might get lucky and find fucking something, so I guess let's do that. Uh, slight panic, do your best to remain calm, moist, and unpleasantly hot. I'm confident that if we turned around with this saucepan, griddle, whatever the fuck we're using, I guarantee we could take him on, like 100%, but I'm not doing that. <laughs> Some Android 17 looking bitch up there. I wonder if the antidepressants act- <gasps> Is that a fucking cowboy hat? No, I can't. I shan't. I want that hat. 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 Oh, it's not worth it! <laughs> I like how it almost worked. <laughs> like, give me that hat. I need this. Why are there so many damn zombies on the road? On the road again. It's so great to be on the road again. Uh, extreme panic? Uh-oh. Is there anything we can do with that? Uh, reduces unhappiness over sustained periods. I don't think... Oh, my God. Take the pills. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, squirt some cleaning liquid in your eye. That'll be what you're thinking about then. This is a little sweaty. Yeah, nah, this is definitely sweaty. Okay. All right. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And just keep on going. Keep on going. Wearing an unusual hat in video games. Wearing an unusual hat in real life. <laughs> video games are the best place to to dive into your your weird like I'm gonna wear a strange hat thing. Can you like chop down trees and shit? I'm assuming you can. Hey, firearms, how's it going? <gasps> Ooh, that's interesting. Uh, okay. Good batch. Come on, drop so I can stomp you. You fucking shit. Oh my god. Yes, okay, all right. Uh, real quick. Hospital gowns, strapless bra, black trousers, this ain't shit. I feel like the keys for the ambulance would still be here, because there would be really no reason for them to take them, right? Boo. Well, that sucks. Yeah, <laughs> this is a fucking, like, mini-boss. What the fuck? Well, I saw that it said you could chop down trees. I meant, like, can I just, like, walk up to one and it'd be like, you can't chop down this tree because, you know, you don't have an axe. There was even no, there was no context menu for it, which leads me to believe you have to have, like, an axe of some type, I guess, to even get the menu to show up in the first place. Uh, okay, I'm definitely moist, but we're no longer panicked, which is nice. Man, where, oh, God, where are we? Like holy shit, we have uh, we have ventured quite a far away, quite a quite a ways from home. I, I guess. What's the uh, what's the mod support for this game look like? Is it kind of like RimWorld, where like mod support can really help with just like some quality of life shit, but you know it doesn't really destroy the game. You can't start cars without keys, so when you're in a car, open the inventory and check its glove box. Oh, you can check the inventory in the car. I didn't know that. That's neat. Yeah, I think the moistness, the moistness is important. Moderate exertion. Take a break. Okay. Take a break. Have juicy box. <laughs> take, take break. Have juicy. All right. Uh, cool. There we go. I can. <laughs> the juicy box. It is a cool, uh, this is a cool game so far. I like this. Oh, we're exerted again. 
We can have a little sit. Let's do it. Let's just have a little sit on the ground with our trash. There's like no zombies out here, though. Like, this is a pretty, this is a pretty quiet little place here. <laughs> Last thing I was here for is squad got bit in the head. We have not gotten bitten in the head. We haven't gotten bitten at all this round, I don't think. We've got red on us from bashing zombies, but that's about it. Oh, really? That's funny. I'd like to award you with the Firearms Instructor Best Audio Quality on Twitch 2021 Award. Congratulations and thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. I, all this was made possible by doing nothing. The bare minimum. <laughs> thank you for the award. Hooray. Oh, what is this? Uh, this is a big, like, pathway. Where does this go? I'm surprised there's no other survivors. That's kind of, that's kind of shocking. Like, where's everybody else? Also, where's my health menu? Overall body status, we're good. Uh, protection, we have, like, no bite protection whatsoever. Our sprinting skill is going up. Would, can you imagine why? Wow. Uh... The really, like, we are super far. I haven't seen a zombie in forever. If you're doing nothing, then every other channel is fucking sabotaging their shit intentionally. No, I, I obviously put a, a decent amount of effort into audio stuff, but... That's what I thought it was. I thought it might be like a mansion thing. I was like, oh, dude, we're gonna camp out here. I'm assuming there's ways to... Oh, there's a zombie over there. Boo. Well, let's kill that one. Beat the shit out of it. This is my territory. Oh no, I saw that tree move. Shit. Shockingly enough, there's nothing over there. I thought there might be. Uh, classic Bruce Blast and uh, tank top with socks. All right. Now, I don't miss the zombies. I'm actually happy they're not out here. I'm trying to see if we can find, like, a little... Keep, like, a base of operations or something. Oh, come on, Rob Zombie. What? Oh, my God, dude. If I just got bit, I'm gonna be so upset. Because we fucking whipped that. We did not. We got him off of us. Woo-hoo-hoo. Uh, we are peakish, so I gotta... Socks, gold ring. What is, uh, what is forage? Foraging has changed. It is now based on searching items. Click the magnifying glass on the left side of the UI and end the end key to talk. Okay. I don't understand what that means. Uh, road, whatever. I don't understand this. <laughs> I, don't, I don't understand this. So, like, I can't. Okay, I'm guessing it just shows you, like, what... Alright, well, we're gonna end that for now. I don't know, have you ever... For have, who in chat has foraged for berries? I can actually confidently say, or I, I indeed have foraged for berries at some point. Not out of pure necessity, more because I was just, like, a fucking dumbass kid that was picking blackberries or stuff. But, uh, definitely have foraged. Can, can absolutely say that. Uh, we do have some water here. I can, uh, oh, what? I thought, don't you, like, automatically? Oh, that's moist, right? You automatically drink water. I forgot about that. Dude, blackberry bushes are, like, the greatest things ever. All right, get ready. Bitch. Where'd that blood come from? I guess the zombie. I, I just... Briefs. Again, we gotta tear up some dirty zombie underwear. Okay, so there's apparently a trunk is locked. Okay, I unlocked. Oh, you can unlock the trunk. That's neat. Uh, so there's apparently like a glove box. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so you can check all the seats and you can also check like the glove box and see if there's like a thing in there. Now the trunk is popped though, so I guess we can go and... That's really cool that you can do that. That's neat. I don't know if there's a way to like... 
car battery type standard. Put that in the trash bag. And there's a tarp. That seems nice. Oh man, get out of here, dude. I'm just I was just fucking having a good time with this trunk. All right, cool. So Oh, that one's locked. Shit. Maybe I could like jimmy it. Oh, you can smash the window. Oh, I'm not doing that though. I ain't doing that shit. Empty gas can. That's kind of cool. Oh, you can hold shift to change the categories. But well, we're still we're still a little drip from the uh we're we're a little overexerted at the moment, so I need to be careful with like running. I'm just gonna kinda carry my shitty little trash bag for a bit. Uh beating zombies in the face with a griddle pan thingy, whatever. What is that? Heavy load, movement speed reduced. Woo! Wow. Where'd these assholes come from? Oh man, I gotta drop some shit. Uh, I might have to drop, like, the, uh, probably some stuff in the trash bag. It was probably that car battery. I don't want to get rid of my battery, though. That's so nice. Oh, shit. Uh, let me drop the, let me drop the gas can, I guess. I think that was what pushed us. Oh, got it. Okay, there we go. Oh, that didn't that didn't do it at all, did it? Oh shit. Yeah, that car battery is definitely dragging us down. There's a house over here, uh, to the left, so like we might be able to scoot over there and Oh man, we might be in trouble. Oh, we're in big trouble. That's a lot of them. We're still we're still pretty heavy here. I don't know if like going to that house is a smart call. Hmm. Yes, <laughs> it's a really good plastic bag. This thing's quality. Okay, I could probably pop that dude, but let's uh let's drop the car battery too if I can, because that thing is like super heavy. Hmm, that's nah, gonna take too long. I might have to just I might have to drop the trash bag, which is going to be extremely sad. Okay, I could definitely pop that dude, but like. Oh man, yeah, this is looking. Drowsy could do with a lie down. Oh god. I mean, we have we have been on the uh, we have been on the road for a minute. Okay, 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 okay. Do we have time? Do we have time? Do we have time? Shit! Oh my god, that was so clutch. Okay, we're no longer like over encumbered. So now we can take a take a whack at this asshole. Get him! Get him! Stomp him! Get him! Oh no! No no! Oh shit! Just run! A house! Uh, I don't know if this is safe. Probably not safe. Okay. Uh, let's get inside. Can I lock the door? I don't think it does much. <sighs> okay. I don't know if any of these windows are open or anything like that. There's TV there. I hated leaving my car battery. What is all this? Uh, there's another flashlight, some sneakers. Uh, okay. There's a bedroom here. Let's, uh, close that curtain. A, cl a closed umbrella, uh, pillow. <laughs> Philosophical quotes. Great. Ah, oh, shit. It actually does, I mean, like, reasonably Where does kind of feel like safe. But Coblin, thank you for the resub. I appreciate it. Oh, fuck. I think they, I think they know we're here. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch, I'm in here trying to have a little wash. Get some hair gel, that's nice. 
We got some chili. I could just hang out in the tub, right? Yeah, I could. I sure could. I fill the water bottle with some uh, good toilet juice. Oh, it's because we're very tired. I don't think there's... Uh... It's probably not a good place to sleep. I mean... Probably a terrible place to sleep. I don't actually know how to, like, lay down. I guess you could sit on the ground. Uh, do you have to sleep in a bed, or can you, like, sleep on the floor? We're actually... We're, we're hanging in there, man. We ain't, we ain't dead yet. Okay, was there a z Woo! Get out of here, bitch! Get out of here! God damn, she's sturdy. Very sturdy. Oh, there's a house? A house key? I don't know where they're trying to, like, shimble bimble into now. Yeah, if I could figure out how to, like, move furniture, if that's even a thing you could do, I could totally, like, barricade this and, like, get some rest in here. But I don't know how to do that. I feel I feel like you could do that, but it just seems like a thing you could do. Top left, the cupboard dresser icon. Oh, I see it. Okay, so there's place pick up. I'm not going to be able to move that fucking thing. So what, you like click it and then just tab to change mode? So you would do, I guess... Oh, oh right, because we have too much shit. Let me drop the garbage bag. Yeah, I think that might give us... No, that's not enough. Uh... Yeah, they're banging on the front door, it looks like. Let me grab this, and let me put it in my... Secondary, I guess? Because we're going to move shit to the trash bag. Probably want to move like the heavier stuff. I don't know if there's a way to sort by like weight up there. God, it take forever. Oh no, that's my clothing. That's not good. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. Uh, I didn't throw out shit. This is my garbage bag, man. Don't hate. All right, let me drop this. Okay, I think we might be able to pick it up now. I don't know, the weight was like 10 or some shit, which is uh, probably too much. And then you could like place by... No. Yeah, I think... I guess because like due to, due to the weight or whatever, it's going to be like really hard to... Maybe if I take the shit out of it? Maybe. No, because it's only like a sleeping tablet. Hey, sleeping tablets! Well, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. What if I just pop these real quick? Uh, let's see. I mean, they already know we're over here, so I guess whatever, I guess. Uh, let's put this in the secondary slot, and then we'll try continuously, like, loading it up. I guess I just need to watch out to make sure I don't Actually, put in of our darn soda. Yeah, because the rest of it's all stuff that I have, like. Then I need to drop the garbage bag. Yeah, I still think we'd be under, like, the weight limit or whatever. Oh, I guess if we dropped our 
frying pan for a minute. Maybe now? Okay, maybe we have the weight requirement stuff now? I just don't know. I don't know how exactly this works. So, do you just click pick up and then it highlights it and then you cycle to place? I don't understand how this works. That's the only part of this that like, kind of sucks so far is like some of this stuff is not exactly the uh, <laughs> not exactly the most intuitive. Because uh, it seems like you'd be able to do that. It says uh, chance to break uh, has some like bullshit in it. The weight's 10. Bedroom drawers. Oh, did they find the window? Great. Okay, there we go. I can pick that up. That's strange. Uh, okay, so I guess now I'll do place. Okay, so I was able to move the chair there. Uh, I'm not going to be able to move this thing. This thing is in. If, if that was hard, oh my god, that thing's that thing's fucking enormous. It's twenty weight. Oh my god. Grab the garbage bag. Grab my grill pan. I don't know if they actually found the. Uh, I'm just going to lay down, dude. It's all good. You sure you... I mean, we're going <laughs> to... Like, how much weight was the car battery? Uh, Probably uh, a reasonable amount. I just need to, like, just get, like, a hole up here. Even for just a little bit. Wow, okay, well, that sucks. Um, Unfortunately... I do not have... I do not have my pan equipped. Yeah, it looks like they found the window. What a bummer. You know what we could do, though? We could draw them in here. And then just give them the stomp of justice. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. I mean, like, that's probably our best course of action here. Like, I'll just, I'll just beat the shit out of all of them. Let's let's you hoodle this. Yoo the only problem is I'd have to have the ability to pick up twenty weight to get that thing like over here. Hey hey, Haritsu, how's it going? Uh yeah, I think you need like twenty weight to do that. Or pick up weight, which I guess that shows just how good the stomp look, the stomp of justice is fine. What are you talking about? Uh, remove broken glass, I guess. Yeah, I guess let's, like, go around and just try to kill the zombies, because we don't really have a lot of options. Oh, that's the asshole we killed. We were, like, beaten up a minute ago. Bitch. Okay, so this place... Oh, right, I locked the door. I forgot. Oh, there's a trash can over there. There's probably some good shit in there. I shit. I was gonna. I was gonna try to use that room since that might be safer. Like the closet seems like a great place to sleep, but it, oh, you can sleep on the ground. Thank God. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna sleep on the ground because the closet is safe. That door is now blocked, which means trash bag is in there, and that means I have to go back around. I'm coming, trash bag. Wait. Trash bag's right here. Never mind. <laughs> I thought trash bag was in here. All right, come on, trash bag. Let's get... Trash bag is my best friend. He, he, he's been with me through everything so far. We love you, trash bag. My spirit animal. Okay, so that's, uh, that's locked. So I guess we need to go around the other side. We can still lock the doors, which is good. And it's one less entry point that they have. So I guess, I guess there's that. You guys like this? I'm I'm actually enjoying this. This is pretty fun so far. It, again, it does remind me a lot of like a kind of a zombie survival kind of Kenshi type deal where it's just like really janky but kind of fun. Like, all right, let's. Uh, I can't lock that door, uh, but I can sleep on the ground. So I guess let's do that. Probably gonna wake up to zombies like eating our fucking face. So that's great. Now, hey, we're no longer tired. Hey, we're not dead. All right. All right. Yeah, good. <laughs> good. That's great. 
Uh, okay. Well, now we're going to need... Um, now we're going to need our... Uh, we're going to torch it up. I'm going to put this in the secondary. I get, Well, I can't put that in the... Well, I guess you can put it in the secondary if you've already loaded shit into the trash bag. Yeah, because the trash bag's just got shit in it now. Nasty-ass corpse. I wonder if there's a way to, like... If you get, like, wood and shit, if you could just, like, board up windows. Because, I mean, like, we could we could get rid of these nasty-ass bodies, and we could turn this into, like, home base, man. I mean, shit, we could, we could technically block that window with something. Um, I don't know... I don't know how to repair windows and shit yet, but actually, we could maybe get a... Okay, remove curtains, open curtains, uh, pick up broken glass. Hammer, nails, and planks. Oh, my God. Don't think we're going to do very good with that. Is the power still on? Okay, the power is still here. Like, it hasn't dissipated yet, I guess. Uh, let's drink the malk. Ooh, dude, I should have cooked that malk. That would have been nice. Give me some of that malk. Fairly heavy load, carrying a little too much. Okay, well... I probably do need to drop some shit. Yeah, a little, little fried malk. <laughs> not even a sore bag debuff. Yeah, I feel like that probably should be there, but it's not. Um, Let's drop... Uh, We got a lot of, like, clothing stuff here that I don't really think... Oh, craft sheet rope. Look at that. Rip clothing. Drop. Tailoring for beginners. This is a split... The Spliffo t-shirt. That's pretty cute. Nice. Still don't have a lot of bite protection, which is not great. Was there stuff in, in that inside that end table? Because you can't move things with stuff inside of them? Like, not even a... Oh, shit, I was reading chat. Fuck. I had no idea Zambi had come in. Oh, that sucks. Oh, no, that sucks. They were lacerated and bleeding. Uh, I don't think we were bitten, though. So I might be able to do something. Shit, I shouldn't have looked away. I thought we were clear in here. Well, damn. Uh, yeah, oh no, we're, I'm sure we're bitten. So that's that's poopy. I wonder if I can like uh, rip clothing. I'm assuming dirty rag. Perfect. Let's use that as a bandage. Apply to groin. I'm sorry. Is that where I got bitten? Was the the fucking the nether regions? Great. <laughs> yeah, fucking great. Uh very minor damage. Uh we got that we got that dirty bandage on the uh, on the groin, so maybe we didn't get like proper bitten. I don't fucking know. What a dick, dude. <laughs> the zombo is a thirsty for the groin. Oh, uh, pain, speed, and accuracy slightly reduced. We're drowsy again, which is also not great. Check this car and see what we got in here. Uh, nothing. Apparently, I can't even, like, interact with that. Nope. Let's check out, I got, I got a nice dirty bandage. Oh, God! Ooh, that house is nice. Maybe I could like uh maybe I could like squint in there. Locked. Ooh. Maybe this is the house we need the house key for. Fetch. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Still I still fucking on the controls. Okay, got him. Let's just stand your ground. Do it. Who's giving me money? Stop it. Well, that might be another bite. Oh, fuck. Get him, get him, get him. Got him. Woo! Woo! All right, got him. Let's, uh, what all do we have here? We got anything good? We got denim, denim chicken. Okay. Oh, he's in the house. Oh. Yeah, he's bongling his head on something. I don't want to break the, uh... Well, I guess if I want to break a window, I would prefer, like, one of the... Well... 
I don't think I could even use the, uh... I don't know how you use the house key. Unpack, maybe? Uh... <laughs> Put in container corpse. Yes. Thank God. Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, maybe you do have to equip it. That'd be pretty gross, though. There's a pencil. Alright, let's get ready. Woo! Alright. Let's, uh... Grab the corpse. Can you, like... I'm assuming you can, like, drag these around, right? Okay, that's not exactly how I thought that was going to work. I'm sorry, do you just have a corpse in your inventory? Oh my god, you do. That's gross. Okay, uh, let me take his disgusting ass outside. We can put him over here in the shrubs. Yeah, can I put him in the trash can? Put him in the recycling bin. <laughs> Pickups on Tuesday. Okay, now that we've done that, let's... Uh, I hope... I don't know if we're like proper like infected or anything yet I, I don't know exactly how that works like i guess like maybe there's like an alert for it or I mean, the whole point is to survive as long as you can anyway so like i guess it doesn't really matter right um let me close the curtains okay i like i like this little house this is nice uh can i like oh god this nasty ass okay so there's nothing in this one I wonder if you can pick up stuff that's, like, slightly, like, heavier than what you can normally pick up. Even if it's just, like, you'll be, like, over-encumbered or whatever and you just move slowly. That doesn't look to be the case because that doesn't, it doesn't seem like a, oh, it's because there's a, there's this shit in it. Uh, um, let me, that trash on the floor. So, like, maybe I can still pick it up, even if it's too heavy for me or whatever? That'd be really great, because then I could, like, pick it up and then move it. I guess not. Doesn't seem like it anyway. Yeah, because it seems like there's a... Why? Did... That's so... Oh, I picked up the lamp. We'll put... Uh... <laughs> put it put it somewhere else, I guess. Nick, the two... Yes, Nick, the 200-pound dresser is too heavy to move because of the blouse inside of it. What? Somebody just told me specifically that, like, if it has shit in it, you can't move it. That's what I did. You ding dong. Pay attention. Keep up. How dare you not know everything? You're supposed to know everything. You guys are chat. You know everything. You guys know all the words. Keck W indeed. Kecking all the way to the fucking bank, dude. Big Keck's out, Namish. Okay, so, yeah, because you don't really get, like, a an alert that says, like, oh, it's too heavy or whatever. I guess it's just a matter of the fact that, like, I just have too much fucking shit. Oh, well, I guess you can move stuff to the key ring. Uh, let's... Let's drop the trash. Uh, and... I guess... Yeah, last time we had to basically dump everything. Uh, to get that to work. None of the windows are broken here, I don't think, yet. So that's good. Okay, good. So I guess let's try sleeping here and just see how it goes. It looks like we do have a case of the tired again. And we could get like some dirty ass. What if I could like wash? What if you could like wash the clothing that you have like in your inventory and then use that like as a whatever. Oh, you need tools for some furniture? Okay. I thought like you'd just be able to like drag it or something like that. I didn't think you'd actually have to put it in your... uh. Do I know how to play or own a mouth harp? Absolutely not. Oh, thank you, Quasar, for the 50 months. It's 50 months. It's like double my current time on this rock going around this local celestial body. I ain't got nothing else. Uh, shout out to Vagrant for being knowledgeable on Turbo Weeb games. Get me into it. Uh, good man. Keep him on the bus. I'm definitely keeping him on the bus. He's an invaluable friend and asset. Invaluable. Could not put a price. Oh, God. 
Oh, oh baby. All right, well, let's wash up. I guess all this crap. Looking, looking fresh. Uh, we're hungry. We're in pain, and we're tired. Okay. Uh, let's do. I know we can eat. Well, I, I threw we threw our trash on the ground over here. This is a nice ass house. I mean, it's a horrible, horrible room at the moment, but this is a horrible place right here. All right, sleep. Experiencing too much pain to sleep. Do I have any pain pills? Oh no, we have the sleep aid. I think. I don't know if that would. Uh, I don't know if that would push past that or what. How that works. Secondary. Uh, let's see. Then we need to go to the trash bag. Yeah, we have the antidepressants. That's pretty sweet. Helps in getting to sleep. Useful when anxious or in pain. Oh yeah, perfect. Okay, unpack that. <laughs> And uh, use the, the sleepies. Take pills. Alright. Hell yeah. Alright, now we can sleep again. Next time next time we play, I'm gonna I'm, I think as far as characters go, I'm gonna be Swolio. Get nice and get nice and pumped. I was like four o'clock or something like that. Uh so, oh, we got thread. That's nice. How's that? How's that dirty bandage doing? Is that is that gross or what? It's definitely gross. Okay, there's just a laceration down there now, so that's good. Uh, maybe we can use the rip sheets on it now. It's bandaged. Okay, there we go. So we're not completely fucking dead from whatever that was. Uh, we've also got these canned beans, dog food, dish towel. We don't we don't have to we don't have to be a dog food degenerate yet. So I guess let's go ahead and drink this beer. No 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 dog food degenerate just yet. But give it time. All right, we got milk. Mm-hmm. Good milkies, right? And then we're gonna do a tomato. Cool. Still in minor pain. So that's interesting. I'm not eating a dog. I'm not eating dog food yet. We will not become the dog food degenerate until we have to. Uh, there's also advanced electricity. That's neat. Value tech portable. Ooh, equip a pro. Oh, that's neat. It's like a. Uh, it's like a CD player, I guess. Cool. Let me grab that. Kale. Stop. All right. Let's see. Uh, good cooking magazine. Uh, oh, I, I might be useful. I want to check this shit out. Let's get this. Oh, too late. We already did. Uh, we already did warmed up mayo earlier. So you fucking missed that. You missed that real shit. I put mayo in the oven at five hundred degrees, and then made it nice and a. Uh... What? He was also scratching the door. So, do all right. Anyway, uh, yeah, no. So we did the uh, we did the 500, 500 degree mayo and made a delicious, delicious cup. We're now arguing over whatever because Kale was scratching the door, and then I guess he was scratching his little box, and I told him no. But Erica thinks he was just atta just scratching the box. I guess. Oh look, there's an empty bottle there. Let's uh, let me throw that on the floor, and uh, so can I like? I guess you can like load discs, discs up in that. Let me, uh, let me read this advanced electricity. How long does this take? Whoa! That was, whoa, that was a lot of time, I guess, that just happened there. Did we, like, just stop reading it? I don't... Oh, you don't understand. Okay, because you need to do basics first, I guess. Well, let, put this in the trash bag, then. <laughs> Got it, dude. Put it in the trash, I suppose. I need to uh, put the glasses back on. You could also put on my headphones. You know, that would be really stupid. All right. Man. Takes, uh, takes some time. We're actually, we're in pretty good shape, man. I don't know what the fucking pain is from at this point. I guess it was getting stabbo the crab -oed.
I thought the power just went out. I was like, damn, time has come. I'm, I'm guessing that's something that happens like... Uh... All right, we're drowsy. We're peckish. Minor pain. All right. So we need to... We're, we're going to need to get another... That, that bandage isn't even gross yet, which is awesome. Uh, so that thing, that thing ain't even... Ra it's not even a ratchet. The tailoring seems pretty good because you can probably fix your clothes pretty easy and like maybe reinforce stuff or whatever. Yay, we did it. All right, cool. All right, so we're hungry. Uh, now we need to eat these canned carrots. Canned chili. Oh, man, we could like, uh, we could like go stuff this in the oven or something. We got the griddle. Where's the griddle? All right, uh, put in container. I don't want to put it in the cupboard. I want to <laughs> attach it to your back. Okay. You can also repair the griddle pan. The griddle is damaged. Uh, let's do... I'm guessing I just turn this up. <laughs> What's the point of, like, uh, I guess things that aren't canned, you probably want to, like... Oh, I should probably turn that off. <laughs> I just realized I'm about to go lay down here in a second. <laughs> Let, me... Let me pop on the, uh... Oh, do you have to, like... You probably have to, like, open these with a can opener or something, right? Oh, no. That's not good. Oh, man. That's really bad. Was there a can opener here? Is the griddle pan? Can... <laughs> There's the dog food. <laughs> we might be the dog food degenerate. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah, we might have to. We don't have a can opener. I don't think we do anyway. Uh, we got some orange soda here. We can do that. Uh, drink that. That's good for you. Cleaning liquid, antidepressants, advanced cooking. Put a nice dent in the griddle when you bopped it over Clyde's head. <laughs> when you smack the dickens out of him. Well, uh, we do not have a can opener, so I guess I guess we're not enjoying we might be we might be going dog food degenerate. I mean they do have the dog food down here, and this does not appear to be in a can. So like I could eat that. Hmm. Or not. Maybe the dog food also has to be in, like... Shit. I thought that was, like, bag dog food. I didn't think it was, like, a... Well, we gotta go find a can opener. Fuck, we went from... This is, like, we were doing fine on food, and now I realize that we need that can opener. And that means we got... I've got some antidepressants and cleaning fluid. That sounds like a way to avoid zombie disease. It is the way to do it, yeah. Uh, yeah, so this went south real quick. So now we're really hungry, very tired. Oh, apparently... Oh, we're bored? Oh, I'm so sorry that we're bored. I'm sorry that the zombie fucking apocalypse is boring. Uh, can't sleep here? There we go. Okay, there goes the tired. Uh, we're going to have to figure out something to do about the food situation. That's going to be a thing. Well, we haven't had to deal with uh, Zambonis in a while, so that's nice. Let's open up our door and uh, head on back out into the world, I guess. Bonkin. The quest <laughs> the quest for the can opener begins now. I just want to know what this minor pain is. Like, what, what's wrong? Is it just from that laceration earlier, I guess? Probably. Well, there's a bunch of ass hats over there. Oh, God. Bored in the middle of the zombie apocalypse. Hashtag just... There were so many zombies around here, and, like, none of them were messing with that house for some reason. Oh. That house is burned the fuck down, so that's not good. Oh, like a little sandbox or something. Oh, Lord. What is it? Look at that one chair. Look at how strong that was. It just survived. That's amazing. <sighs> Bitch. That <laughs> bat. Azuri's doing pretty good, man. They're hanging in there. <laughs> I, love, I love the way they go over fences. They just kind of topple. Mm, 
The barn might not be the greatest idea. Uh, maybe. Can you open these? Ooh, you can. It's interesting, but they're just, they just count as fences, I guess. Alright. Dude, we are out, we are out in the sticks. Like, we were in, like, in some kind of, like, suburb area before, but, like, we are way out here now. Is that one dead? I guess so. Okay, uh, let's unlock the trunk. Uh, is there anything in the glove box? There is indeed a key. Franklin uh, value line key. All right, uh, the battery is... Looks like the engine's fucked. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, shit. Ah, shit. Oh, God, it's a decent amount of them, too. There's a hammer, a metal sheet, a shovel. Okay, this tr that trunk is, like, worth... That's worth getting shit out of. That was a lot of stuff in there that we might need. That, that seemed like a real good get right there, too. Like, that was a lot of shit. Come on, assholes. I could definitely do something with it. I just gotta get that... I gotta get back there and get that trunk. It that stuff. All right, how bad are we looking? Okay, let's get let's get enough distance to where I think I should have time to. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, oh no! Bag of concrete, box of nails. Uh, grab the hammer. Fuck. We might be able to take them if I can just if I can keep them split. No! You bitch! No! We're dead. Fuck! Oh no, we didn't even get- I don't even know if we got bitten. Oh, jeez. I'm trying to get a lucky, like, knockdown and then hit the next one. No! Woo! Oh, shit. Oh! Listen, I'm unsub by choice. Nice. It's a good way to roll in. Okay, there we go. Oh, no. Back, back it up. Okay, why'd well, you have the hammer? We could try bonking him with the hammer, I guess. Uh, give that a shot. Might be a bit better, like, damage-wise or something. Mm-mm. Oh no. Oh no. Oh shit, like we damn near like killed one of We did kill one of them. Holy shit. Go go, go hammer power. Woo! Alright. Uh, let's do... We got bag of concrete powder. Let's put that in the trash can. The trash bag. That is so fucking heavy. I should not have done that. Empty bucket, gravel bag, sheet, shovel, a welder's mask, welding rods, wire. Oh my god. There's a ton of stuff in here. I think we're like turbo, turbo over encumbered though, so I probably need to... We, we gotta get like a home base, home base of operations here, because like... We, we gotta have a place to put shit, because we're like way, way, we can't be lugging all this crap around with us. We're gonna get killed. Oh, when when Kale is being bad, it's your cat. But when he's being good, it's our cat. That's how it rolls. All right, let's see. Let's do. What is this? Oh no! Did we get a? No, we didn't get bitten or anything. Uh, let's see. Okay, the bag of concrete powder can probably go. Uh, that's extremely heavy. You can let him in if you want. What was that? What was that saying? Oh, okay. Yeah, 19 out of 12 on this, which is pretty heavy. We got a lot of shit on us. Is that water over there? Oh, wow. Okay, that's interesting. Got a little, uh, got a little waterfront. That's nice. 
That means at least that part is safe, because there's probably no swimming zombies, so... We at least know that everything coming from the north, or whatever that is, is safe. And this looks like a public park type thing over here, I guess. Yeah, I get to go spend like $800 on my fucking car tomorrow. I can't wait. Dig graves. Walk to Sonaga Carpentry. Oh, wow. What is this? Oh, it's like a little gazebo. That's neat. Very neat. I like the gazebo thing. That's cool. I look like a grill. Come on, turkey. You're so fucking excited to be in here. Did you walk in here with the spray bottle to threaten him? What was that? This opening shit. It's a baby. Oh. It's just a baby. It's just a baby. What? I'm here to take him. No, I don't want to. Take the turkey. I've been, I've been dealing with him. So. Take, take this baby. It's the sweet baby Jesus. Oh. Kale, Kale's cooler than Jesus. What is this place? Beef Roundup? <laughs> the beef, better than the beef round down, you know what I'm saying? Oh, come on. Can I break the door? Uh, carpentry, open door. No, I gotta have to, like, break a window here. I don't want to break a window, though. This is, like, a nice place. This is the beef roundup. Dude, maybe we should make the beef... We should we make the... <gasps> what is that? Is that the bait and tackle? Dude! I'm making this the base of operation. This is incredible. Alright. Oh, well, this is, like, a little vending machine. It's a pop. Look at that pop. Grab... Dude, drink it. Drink them all. Drink all the pop. I was kind of hoping it wasn't a restaurant. I mean, it's definitely a restaurant. This is also the bait and tackle over here, though. So I'm about to go inside, and this is going to be the base of operations. As long as I can get inside, which I will get inside. Yes. I am entering the bait and tackle. Oh, look, butter. All right, eat that. Oh, man, is there an asshole in here? Come on. Like, fuck. All right, let's ready up. Whoa! What the fuck? Whoa, what the? Whoa, what the fuck is this? Oh, back up, bitch. I think we got bitten in like the face or something. Why are they naked? Dude, this is fucked. What happened? Yeah, one of them was wearing like a diaper. What the fuck? Dude, the bait and the bait and tackle got shit going on. Get, get him. Missouri go ain't going down without a fight. Okay. Um, shockingly, they did not get a bite off. What? How? Uh, let me turn turn the radio off. Holy shit! They did not get a bite. Okay, I'm gonna grab. Oh, did it not grab the corpse? I need to get these out of here. The, the bait and tackle, this is where it's at, dude. This is where we're staying. Oh, no, no, no. Ooh, don't do that yet. It's out here with the trash. Mm, maybe we did get bitten. No, we didn't. Why are we dabbing? What are we doing? This is the bait and tackle. What, what's going on? Uh, open the can with a hammer. It's easy. Okay, let me drop these gross-ass corpses. Discomfort. Something doesn't feel right. Oh, shit. What does that mean? What does that mean? Can openers and cabinets? Are, is that where people keep can openers? I didn't... I've never owned one. Do you keep... Is that where you keep can openers? What? What? It's probably fine. Yeah, we're good. Dude, electric can openers. The electric can openers are awesome because they come like pre-broken. Like you pull them out of the box and they're already broken. 
Uh, we got military camo pants. Those are probably pretty good. Uh, wear those. Uh, we got military dessert d dessert boots. Uh, we got some overalls too. That's pretty sweet. Uh, we can wear those. Yeehaw! Welcome to Baldy. Come on down. Got down. Got down. All right, what else we got in here? Fucking hoodies, bait and tackle. <laughs> we got. Oh, it's a tent kit. That's cool. That's a terrible fucking idea right now because we have like no defense. But whatever. Uh, we got fishing line, fishing net. Dude, there's fishing tackle at the bait and tackle? That's crazy. Yeah, that's interesting that they were like... Oh, I just realized I don't have my, uh... Where's my hammer? I like this because it has a second floor, which I feel like... The only thing I'm really worried about with the second floor is like... If we have to get out of here, it's gonna be really hard. Uh, magazines. Yeah, I don't like the discomfort. That's a little worrying. Like, I kind of wonder what that's all about. Dish towel, bell pepper. Uh, excessive exertion can barely walk. Well, shit. Hey, look, a can opener. All right, let's grab that. I don't know how many times the can opener can be used. I really... <gasps> can you use a rolling pin as the beatdown apparatus? I hope so. Let me open those canned beans. Mm, open canned beans. We're gonna wake up and we're gonna be a zombie. However, I'm very impressed by uh, very impressed by Azuri's ability to survive so far. This has been pretty impressive. I uh, there's a corkscrew up there. That's neat. Uh, there's another oven. All right. Yes, the beatdown apparatus. Also, what's up, Phaedro? I was just surprised because I saw you in chat, and then it's like I'm unsub for a reason. I'm like, okay, that seems that seems like an interesting thing. <gasps> Lead pipe. Ooh. All right, we're also gonna grab this too, which I'm guessing the screwdriver will allow us to like, ooh, pickles, eat them. Uh, well, actually, we're not like super hungry right now, right? No, we're actually good. We're satiated. So since we're satiated, let's shut this door. Uh, I don't know if you can lock this one. It doesn't look like it. Uh, but let's go get some sleep. Now we got the pipe. Now we are officially Silent Hallway 2. Let's, uh, let's sleep. I want to sleep in the tub. Well, actually, let's get, a, let's get a little wash real quick. I'm going to wash this blood off of us. I'm really impressed and also glad you're having a good time. Uh, getting real Kenshi vibe. Yeah, it's, it definitely does feel like Kenshi. I... I feel like personally, I think I, I I like the 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 gist of Kenji more, but like I appreciate the shit out of this for being like a robust kind of zombie survivaly thing. Phaedro, they've always done that. That's like literally always been a thing. <laughs> that that has always been a thing. If you come in here without a sub, somebody's gonna point it out, and then somebody's gonna handle it. You know how this shit goes. Ooh, I can dry off my moist. Context, the context is irrelevant. They'll pretty much always say something. Ah, uh, let's see. What is tr oh tra oh? Well, that's interesting. Does this show you like everything that you've learned so far? That's neat. Uh, let's see skills. Oh, I guess I can put like a point in tailoring or Welcome something because I have like a doodly bop there. Too quick gets now to sub. Thank you, buddy, for doing it. Okay, well, at least we're safe in here. I guess safe-ish. Uh, I suppose we can actually get a rest right. There weren't like a lot of zombies up here, period, really. So uh, let's get some sleep, I guess. Which that will fix our moderate exertion. That'll uh, find a way to raise your mood. I'll let you know when I find out. Okay, all in favor of making Hootie's Bait and Tackle the, the home base. Bugging, hit me up. Wait, which one is Hootie's Bait and Tackle? Uh, I don't actually fucking know. Where is this? I'm all, I'm all about, I'm all about Hootie's Bait and Tackle over here. But I also don't know where, uh, how, like, I'm trying to, like, discern where this is on the map. 
Uh, so it's the green square that's next to the yellow square, but I don't see that over here. I guess it's like one of these. Is it this? You are come me, but I don't know why. But don't much days or don't much day more apple pie. And there's nothing I can do. Come on down to Hootie Bait and Tackle. We do have, we do have the antidepressants. I could do that. Hey, don't be come me. Go take some pills. Gonna fix the sadness in my brain. So I don't think that worked. <laughs> I don't think that worked. Still not sure what the discomfort thing is. Uh, I feel like I should probably be paying more attention to that. I don't know what the I don't know what the signs of the signs of infectoid are, but it don't be come be down on you no map up high, but there's nothing I can do. Hmm. Well. Uh, I guess let's, uh, well, that means we can leave, like, the trash bag here now, which is good. Or I can transfer everything from the trash bag into this, which I guess you can just, like, stuff stuff into containers. I don't know if there's a way to, like, transfer all. That would be, like, really handy, but I don't think there's a way to do that. Does it queue? Oh, it does queue. That's nice. Oh, that's nice. Hey, look at that. We can do, like, a shovel and everything. Put all that over there. There's no corpses in this house. What are you talking about? Oh, finally. Yeah, it's. I just needed to like pick a place where we were going to be like kind of base of. Put the cabinet in the trash bag. Dude, if I could, I would pick the whole cabinet in there. What do you mean unpleasantly hot? Dude, it ain't that bad. Come on. This is how, this is how you know these people aren't used to the south. All right, so the porta disc can definitely go over there. The thread can go in here. Tailoring, sneakers. Sleeping tablets. Uh, I'm going to keep the screwdriver on me right now. I got these, like, house keys and shit, but I don't think those house keys are going to come in handy, considering we are very far away from... Uh, very far away from the things that we were messing with before, so... Empty orange soda bottle. Uh, I'll put our food over here. Put our can opener in here. Uh, Freddy's big balloon. Okay, so we pretty much trimmed down to... Just the essentials here. Let's get a. Let's open up a can of. Open up a can of chili, and we'll take the chili with us. That was really weird. It like moved it over there, and then <laughs> like moved it back. That's uh. That's interesting. Where is the open can of uh? Oh, there it is. Okay, we'll just take the open can of chili with us just to be safe. Look at that. We're finally you know not bogged down because we actually have like a place to stay. Even though it's, like, very dark and shitty outside, which is probably bad, but whatever. Oh, yeah, it might have been because I put the can over in the cabinet. That would make sense. I'm, I'm assuming this discomfort thing is probably not great. Uh, let's see what we can do to raise our mood. <laughs> your style, your music. I don't know much, but I know it when times are bad. Y'all are thoughts. Hey now, Buck, Buck, you're plum out of luck. Oh, the discomfort's from carrying a heavy load for too long. Okay, so that's not like you're turning into a zombie, get ready to die. Okay, that's good. I was going to use this to entertain myself, but I guess, uh... That's probably that's probably gonna attract zombies, so I should probably turn that off. Oh, okay, so you can mass move. You actually can mass move stuff. That's great. Nick, why is window open? Oh shit, the window is open. Damn. Cool, we got it now. I guess we'll leave this on while the power still works. And there's only a couple dead bodies outside. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, because Hootie's bait and tackles over here by the water, which is nice, because that's like. Still not, uh, still not 100% on, I don't know how the groin's looking. Do I have an extra bandage at the moment? Yeah, we, okay. We have a lot of rip sheets, holy shit. Uh, yeah, I like this little, I like got a little waterside, waterside adventure over here. Very dark, though. 
very dark. <laughs> very, very dark. Do I need to turn the brightness up for you guys, or are you good? I mean, it is, it's just dark, period, but... You're back in the no man's sky hole. Oh, no. Still trying to figure... Is, is this where we're... Like, does it put you... Does it center on the map where you are, like... That doesn't seem right, because Hootie's Bait and Tackle doesn't have... A double green or whatever. Like, what the fuck? What does this do? You always call me with a bait and tackle. I should probably put the hammer on the belt. I think I got zoom out on the big map. Oh, shit. Dude, look at how fuck. Look at how far away we are. Oh, my God. We're so far away. The hell is that? Dude, are they are they busting up the beef roundup? Those assholes. Hashtag justice for the beef roundup. Are they inside? Yeah, I think they're in there. Yeah, they're right there. I think all the... Oh, oh, one of the windows is open. Hell yeah, we in the beef. Alright, gotta get ready to bonk them. Okay. Oh, wow. Box of nails, box of screws, a light bulb. Ooh, man. Okay, so you said control will, like, take everything over? Oh, shit. Oh, I guess you, like, control click. I think I get it. You, like, control click and drag. Or you can, like, select all maybe with, like, shift. Ooh, that works. Hell yeah, dude. That's some good shit. That's some good stuff in there. Oh God, I thought the toilet was full of blood, and I'm like, yeah, true, true. I also have colitis. You know, dude, my fucking... I keep thinking about my fucking car now. I gotta go do that tomorrow, because I have to get new tires. But, in all fairness, it's been, like, no shit, like, 10 years since I've gotten new tires. Because I only have, like, 68, 69,000 miles on my car, so... First time to get, like, proper new tires on it. And, uh, it is definitely expensive. But... It is what it do. Uh, we have a refrigerator that still works in the uh, in Hootie's Bait and Tackle. So, like, we could... We could take that over over there, I guess. Put it in the garbage bag. <laughs> Put all this delicious meat in the garbage bag. Look at all this stuff. Oh, man, we're moving all kinds of stuff over there now. Uh, there is a metalwork for beginners... Yeah, I don't, I don't drive. I don't drive much anymore either. That's why mine doesn't have much. Because I realized the other day, I was like, God damn, I was like, tires are so fucking expensive. And then I was like, I just realized I don't think I've ever gotten new tires on that car. And then I, was, I was thinking to myself, I'm like, that doesn't seem right. But I guess when you look at the fact that it's only got like 60, 60K-ish miles, I mean, yeah, I guess that does seem right then. Yep, we got to jump it. It's not a big deal. My car sat for a little bit, so the battery fucking... I gotta, gotta get it some juicies. Okay, well now that we're here, I guess let's go... Uh, I'll I'll jump it. You don't need to... I, I can handle it alone. It's fine. Um, I can do it. Let's see... Uh, let's put the meat in there. And processed cheese. Uh, yeah, the box of the box of nails and screws and stuff might come in handy because that that means we could actually use that to. Uh, I guess if we could get some planks of wood, we could affix that to the windows to prevent zombies from busting in here. So that would be nice. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I probably would have been driving much more uh, the past couple of years anyway. I guess.
Oh, look, a, a, a cash register. Let's get the money. <laughs> Let's get all the money out. I guess I should probably grab the stuff down here, too, and then do that, but... All right, here's the cabinet. It's got all the shit in it. So let's take all of this. And yeah, the box of nails and stuff should come, uh, come in handy. Yeah, they, I, I looked at a few places that do, like, um, uh, used tires, like, from vehicles that got, like, totaled or, like, whatever, and tires that just were, you know, taken off of cars far before they needed to be replaced. Uh, the quote I got on those was about 160 per tire. Uh, whereas the brand new ones were like 189 and I'm like, well, I was like, if that's going to be the case and I don't have to buy the tires myself, uh, and I can just let the, the folks I'm taking it to go ahead and order them and get them in and everything like that. I'm just gonna let them do it because I'm, I'm not, it, it ain't worth 20, 20 bucks a tire ain't worth like waiting an extra amount of time. I need to go ahead and get it done. Yeah, the, the the place that had my tires specifically, uh, they didn't have like any specials going on either or whatever. They, they did on a lot of other ones, but my car, since it's like relatively small, uses a very particular type of tire. So, because I was talking to the guy and he's like, yeah, there's only like one or two tires that actually fit that car uh, comfortably. He's like, so we need to uh, just make sure you get the make sure you get the right the right ones for this. They've always been pretty good. That they've never screwed me over or anything like that. Uh, let's do, uh, requires a pen. Oh, we don't have a pen. Oh my God. I was going to write my house. Shit. Yeah. They don't make this car anymore either. Yeah. It is, uh, no longer, no longer made. Thankfully, since it's a Toyota though, it uses like the same fucking parts as like a lot of their other shit. It's a Scion XD and the, a few different models use like different tires and stuff. All right. Now that we have a pen, I guess we could go ahead and... Hell yeah, dude, my house! Oh my god, yes, it's time. It's fucking time, dude. This is it. This is it. Right here, my house. <laughs> yes! <laughs> fucking finally! Finally a game did it! It let me do it. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Let me put a... Uh, fucking my house. Okay, well now we know now we know where Hootie's bait and tackle is, so we can always come back. Uh do we still have a snack? We probably shouldn't be running around at night. I just realized that. So let's uh let's go ahead and uh Let's eat our open can of chili, I guess. Oh corn dog got it. What? <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot our last name was corn dog. Shit. <laughs> I fucking forgot about that. That's amazing. All right, let's uh, let's sleep it up. Do we get we can sleep with the window open here? Because you know it's the it's it's on the second floor. Oh God! All right, corn dog. Okay, so we're panicked and anxious. It's interesting. Why? Uh, let's bust out the cheese. Uh, let's grab that. Let's grab the pickles, too. We'll take that with us. I don't know. Um, okay, so it's pretty easy to discern where my house is. Hell yeah, dude. Okay, so that is like straight up the woods over there. Um, we could go down. I think there's some other houses or stuff over here. Because there's there's the beef beef O'Brady's or whatever the hell that is. That's not good. Oh man, that's really not good. There were way more over there than I thought. Oh, this that's a general store. Oh wow. Uh we might back ourselves into a corner here, but like Dude, I didn't know we had like a general store over here. This is the greatest place ever. Okay, dirty rag, mop. Wow. I'm 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 thoroughly thoroughly disappointed in the general store excursion. Oh, there's a second floor. Thank God. Uh, farming for beginners. That seems handy. There's a rake too. Look at that.
Yep. Yeah, the XDs are basically like a bunch of other fucking uh, just Toyotas just stapled together. I gotta say though, man, my car has been fantastic. I, I have never had a single, single problem with my XD. Like that thing, that little thing has had never had a major issue. The only issue I ever had was one time in like one winter here, it was doing this bullshit where it was going back and forth, back and forth between like hot and cold, hot and cold. And one day it stuttered starting up because it was like, wow, it was like 30 degrees uh, this morning and now it's like 78. So, so naturally, I think it was like, oh shit, the TV's on. Fuck. Oh, there's a fridge up here with some stuff. There's some limes. Barn soda, some cheese. What year is the XD? 2011. If you're looking up, like, prices for stuff and shit, like, there, there were definitely a few things that were, like, a little bit less expensive, but the problem is, like, I need my car done by, like, this weekend, too. Like, because there's some shit I need to do this weekend, so... And I need the the space that the back of my car has since it's a hatchback. So I need to get it done. I didn't I didn't really have time to wait for like tires and shit to come in for like a week or two. Was there anything else over here? Ooh, uh did we already do foraging for beginners? Hammer if we did, just grab it. Grab it. Yeah, no, I'm not I don't want to wait like forever for tires to come in. I also do trust the shop I take it to. I'm not I'm not normally one who's like very brand loyal or whatever, but they're they're pretty good. They they've never they've never tried to fuck me on anything, so Wow, check this shit out. Yeah, I don't even care that we're like heavy right now. Maybe we got a lot of stuff. Candy, there's a trowel. Oh man. Yeah, we need to we need to make a run. We need to make a run back and then come here again, because this is incredible. God, there's so much shit here. This is amazing. There's some vitamins and some painkillers. All right, we got the very heavy load. Uh, there's a paper bag that has like a no. What the fuck is that all about? Can I cut through here? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm closing that. There, there was a back door, I think, right? All right, so we gotta we gotta scunch on back to Hootie's bait and tackle because the general store is about to be overrun here in a minute. <sighs> hey, how are the zombinos, jabron, jabronis? They're uh, jabrinos, I guess, is what we're going for there. Going good. Okay, do we have anything that's, like, fresh food that I need to throw in there? I don't think so. I could just cram everything in the refrigerator, because why not? I'll have to organize this later. Oh! There's so many little QOL mods I want to tell you about. Yeah, I would imagine that this definitely feels like RimWorld in that, like, the base game is great, but, like, the mods can help out so much with just, like, really like menial nonsense that just slowly adds up over time that would just drive you crazy you know <laughs> stuff stuff that would just drive you bonkers i'm just like please why can't this be easier i can't believe we found a house we found hootie's bait and tackle now i wonder if there's a way to uh like i don't know how do i word this i wonder if there's a way to like, how do you get started with, like, boarding up windows and shit, is my question. Because I'd, like I'd like to be able to go ahead and do that. We have we have some nails. I guess we need... We would need, like, wood of some type, I guess. I don't know if you get, like, wood planks from just, like, around or whatever. And then you could, like, board up... Board up the windows at Hootie's Bait and Tackle, and then we'd be looking pretty good. Hey, yeah, it's nice outside right now. We're a little... We're a little thirst. And we have... We have already partake... Partook in the, uh... Partooking. Yeah, I like this place, man. It's got the 
the this. Well, I think I guess we could leave our windows open up here if we wanted. Would don't wouldn't have to. Oh, I guess we need to fill this up. Yeah. You gotta chop down trees or disassemble furniture for planks, but I think you need tools for that. So technically, if I had like because I've got like a hammer and some other shit. I think there's like a screwdriver too or whatever. We've got uh the screw we got a shovel, we have I thought we had a screwdriver. Yeah, we have a screwdriver right here. Um yeah, we got a hammer, a screwdriver, and some other shit. I wonder if like yeah, if we tried to like break down a chair. Uh, it requires a saw or garden saw. So it seems like we're going to have to have a saw of some type if we're going to want to uh, disassemble those, which I haven't run into a saw yet. I haven't run into a saw yet. Dude, if there's a special zomboid that's fucking 15 feet, no thanks, man. I ain't dealing with that shit. Uh, let's see. So there's a bunch of... I mean, we could kill... I don't know what the... Ha, I mean, I guess, like, my question would be, like, how do zombies work? Are they... Are they actually just... Do they just always spawn? Or, like, if you kill, like, 50 of them over here, does that really thin out the population to where, like, you won't see as many in this area if you've already killed a bunch? Well, um, so the bathroom had an alarm from the looks of it. So I'm going to, I'm going to go back and I'm going to Hootie's bait and tackle. We're going to cut the lights off. Or not. We're going upstairs and we're going to wait for this all to blow over. I, I hope that alarm goes off at some point. That would be fantastic, but... If not, I guess, then... Whatever. <laughs> Fuck it. I can't really see outside either, so I'm gonna have to, like, take it on good faith that they're not gonna be trying to sack Hootie's bait and tackle. No, no cramming on using my shitter. Alright, it's time for me to do Lurkatron, then bed down for the night. I'm so glad you're enjoying Zomboid. I hope to see more of it. Good night. Alright, Vagrant. Take it easy, buddy. wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. <laughs> That was so intense. There's no option. There's an option to turn off the zombie respawns, but it's turned on by default. So no matter how many you kill, they always come back eventually. Yeah, I kind of like the idea of there being like a really like a shitload of zombies. But like as you slowly thin them out, it gets like less whatever. It seems kind of nice. Ooh, maybe I can kill that one. Sneaking up on him. Well, never mind. Bitch. Dude, that backhand is the... That's the jam right there. Oh, my God. There's so many of them over here. Well, at least we at least we run at, like, regular speed now, so we don't have to worry about getting, getting caught with our pants down. There's a taxi. Oh, my God. There's so many over here. Holy shit. I feel, I feel like shit. Just wanted to find some kind of saw. Uh, yeah, but we're not in, like, the worst situation here, because, like, we can we can run pretty quick. Uh. Wow! Woo! Okie dokie. Is this where Dead Space Man learned how to stomp? I think so. Yeah, there's a lot of them over here, man. Holy shit. Well, let's, uh... Hmm. I guess we could get back on the road. I mean, most of these cars are... Wow, holy shit. Since you already got half of it, zombies also gravitate naturally towards cells that have been depopulated. Uh, That's kind of shitty. But I guess it kind of makes sense to sort of... We did... Well, yeah, we did. I was about to say, we did notate where our fucking house was, right? Ah, oh, slight panic. Ah, you're fine. You're good. I love how the field of vision works. I think it's really nice that, like, it's cool to see from, like, an isometric having, like, a 
fog of war type thing where you can't really see everything. But the vision's also still good. It's not like exceedingly frustrating. It reminds me of a game, uh, a game that had really poor like vision. I think it was a game called Darkwood. And I tried really hard when like I, every time I looked at Darkwood, I was like, I just I can't do this. I was like, oh shit, I could probably. Oh fuck, I could have filled like a, a gas can. That'd be neat. I don't know. Uh... Okay, there. The window open? Hell yeah. All right. Well, th this also seems like a pretty good place to hold up. It's got uh, just a couple windows. I did have an empty gas can. It's back at a. Uh, it's back at Hootie's bait and tackle. Dude, we're gonna eat that ice cream. I can't tell if that tinnitus sound is coming from the game or that's me. Dish towel. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Plastic bag. Got some trash. That's, I, I, I do wonder what happened to Hootie. But then again, I guess. Call, call on phone. Okay, so this is a gas station here, so that's good. Whoa! Holy shit! Oh my god! That one's got a backpack. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no! Run! Okay. There's three backpacks over there. Oh. Man, that's a lot. That's, there's no way I could thin this crowd out, though. I'd have to, like, I'd have to, like, kill him on his own. Just the likelihood of that's, like, really low. Oh, that's like a, it's just got like, it's got like a military backpack or some shit. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. We still we still have trash bags, so it's okay. Unless I can like really thin them out here. Like maybe if some just like oh. I don't know, man. We could just pop them. Cause that dude, he got that Jan sport. <laughs> he got he got that real shit. Uh, okay. Oh, I don't know, man. He's over there by himself. Oh shit! This is it's so not worth it. We're to we're totally gonna get bitten. Cause even even if I can even if I can kill him. Again, the likelihood of me being able to like grab it in the in the well, I guess I could bait them and then just like sprint away or whatever. Yeah, if we can if we can somehow end one and then like run back for it, that would probably be ideal. Okay. All right. Oh shit. We're also, we're also in, like, turbo panic mode right now, so we gotta be, like, really careful. Extreme panic, accuracy, and vision severely reduced. Right. At least we're not, like, damaged. So we got that. Alright. Mmm, I was hoping maybe, like, they had thinned out. You guard that garbage bag with your life. Ah, uh, yeah, there's just too many of them. I really want one of their backpacks, though. That's nice. Yeah, this, this bit, this bit's been going on for a minute, man. We uh, a lot of, there's a lot of road. Like, how how far away is my house? Oh, holy shit, we've already come so far. I don't know how long the power stays on and shit, though. So, uh, high exertion can barely jog. All right. Well, 
Looks like they have finally have finally ceased. So hey, country rule. Hey, me who? Dude, I'd be so disappointed if we got back and it was just fucking zombie house. <laughs> I'd be so... If Hootie's bait and tackle had been overrun, we will reclaim it. We will absolutely reclaim it. Mamma moo Get back to my house. Man. It's a heck of a... Uh, it's a heck of a crawl right here. Missouri corn dog. Do you think we're even like, is the laceration even there anymore? I don't know if it is. It's not. No, we're good. We're no longer damaged. Hooray. We are drowsy. We are moist. And uh, we are on big, big high exertion. So. Zombie House probably is an indie crap beer brand. Like that is probably a real thing. <laughs> like that is probably just straight up. Straight up just a real thing. God, look at this stretch of road. My God. Where the, where the fuck? Oh my god, is this really the holy shit? There's a lot of stuff on this map. I'm really hoping this doesn't just go out of town because that would suck. No, not a Missouri corn dog. That sounds like some weird sex thing. Yeah, it looks like it is going to go off the map. We could always, like, scrundle through the trees, but that seems like a really bad idea. Let's do it. Oh, man. So if you go through the trees slowly, nothing happens to you, right? Oh man, we we in the deep wood. We in that deep shit. Uh I think we have I think we have some food. Uh yeah, we got some cheese. Right click plus walk, I think, to keep will keep you from scratching yourself on trees. I think you just need to not uh oh wow. It gets like really dark. Did it get dark out or is it, does it just get really dark when you're in like the deep, deep wood? There's a Missouri hot dog on Urban Dictionary. What is not on Urban Dictionary at this point though, right? Like, at least we got good shoes. The, the rest of our outfit's not great, but. Quiet out here too. We should just build a house out here. <laughs> just, just build a house out here. Welcome to Missouri Corn Dog. I'm Missouri Corn Dog. Welcome to the Corn Dog. Have we got Corn Dog? <sighs> the urge to sprint is high, but. I did I see that tree move? Oh, shit. <laughs> if a zombie shits in the woods, can you see it? Yeah. How's the, uh, how's the fire mechanic work? Is it like pretty robust like if you start a house fire does it burn down like the whole place this is pretty it's pretty sweaty man i'm not gonna lie i mean we our character's not sweaty anymore but yeah this does this does remind me of kenshi a lot then i i just feel like something about this is just very that <sighs> Turn the stove on. Dude, that would be awesome if we could, like, leave, lead a shitload of zombies into a house, just shut it with, like, the oven on, just leave them in there to cook. It just set the whole house on fire, but, like, there you go. 
<laughs> Enjoy the burning house, you assholes. Oh my god, where are we? <laughs> That's a lot of trees. Oh god. Man. Yeah, I was very impressed when we interacted with the oven and it was like, oh, what do you want to set the temperature to? I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, that is, uh, that's a lot. Mm, we're pretty, uh, we're pretty far away from house. We're over here. There's my house. So we are a good ways away. Mm, I don't know if the... So I started No Man's Sky, and now I'm on a planet that has penis trees. So, like, that's your new home, right? You live in a penis tree land? Or what? Or <laughs> what? Like, how? what are we doing here? I'd live in penis tree land, I guess. Hell no, it's toxic. Damn, that's not very nice. What did it do to you? <laughs> what, what did penis tree do to you? What do you call it toxic? How could you do this? Uh, oh, man. It's trying to kill me. What? What, what? what are you talking about? Okay, you can't just say penis tree tried to kill. Like, what the fuck? You went to its planet, right? You're the parasite. Leave penis tree planet alone. You you leave PP planet alone, damn it. All right, so we're once we're done scrundling through these woods, I guess uh, we should pr probably start way, making our way back to my house, but. We are we are very protected. The, our our shoes are good. We the rest of it's not. We're our cover. You would think the coveralls would actually be pretty good for like the legs because uh, I mean they're they're normally denim. So Hale's just walking around yelling. I'm telling you, man. He this is this is some days with him. I really hope I don't get scrundled by, like, a zombie in the woods. That would suck. I would say our stream probably has a much higher ratio than most streams of brand new sentences that are said. I would, I, I would wager. <laughs> I would wager pretty good money on that. Oh, yeah, there's Castlevania NFTs. All right, great. Nice. My favorite. Yum, yum. Unbelievable, dude. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, my God. Why won't it stop? <laughs> Why won't it fucking stop? Yeah, didn't they, they, well, they took a big hit to their uh, pachinko profit, I think, during COVID. Because a lot of those places were shut down, so. They took a took a big whack to that. Well, we basically just went in a circle, but we did at least map out some of these woods. So now we know that there are indeed uh, a lot of woods over here. Might have been a good idea to scrundle through these woods when we were being chased by the Zimdas. That might have been a good idea. Sound a little busy in the woods over here. All right, we're almost back to the road. Oh. Oh. Why do they have some shit? What? Oh, that was a bite. Oh, uh, sometimes it's really, really easy to whiff. Oh no, that's terrible! What? What the fuck? Is, what is going on with this? 
This rando ass piece of shit zombie all the way out here. Oh, we are exhausted. That's right. Yeah, we took a nasty fucking bite. Wow. Holy shit. We bled out like crazy. Oh my god. That was nuts. However, that was our longest survival yet. Look at that. Man, that is a that was an unceremonious way to go. <laughs> Look at that zombie just tore us up. And now we are the zombie. Uh, this does have multiplayer, yeah. I think if we do single player for the night for the night we uh 26 zombies, sudden desire to eat people. I like how it leaves your status effect as a zombie up there. That's funny. Yeah, no, they got us. They got us good. They got us good. All right. Well, since that runs over, I guess let's uh, let's talk about what's happened tonight, ladies and gentlemen. We have now been streaming for three hours and twenty nine minutes, and in that three hours and twenty nine minutes, ladies and gentlemen, we have gotten sixteen subscriptions, which is fucking rad. Thank you guys so much for that. And on top of that, we have made sixteen dollars and ten cents, which is also incredible. So thank you guys so much. And uh, thank you for throwing money at my face and also for subbing and stuff. I appreciate it. Thank you for keeping the lights on, keeping the food rolling and all that stuff. You guys are great. So thank you so much for being awesome. We've done uh, we've done Rosewood a few times, but Riverside seems to be pretty good. Uh, keep the tires rolling. And we do have a big ass fucking <laughs> a big ass, uh, big ass car thing tomorrow. So that's super fun, but need to go ahead and get it done. You know how it is. No, nah, we can't keep playing as a zombie. That would be pretty sweet, though. I get there's nobody like alive to whatever. So, all right. Uh, type in uh, type in Zombo if you want to be the next uh, character. Last one was of course was of Azuri. Um, I'm gonna go get up for just a second. Go get a snack and stuff. I'll be right back. Don't uh, don't break anything while I'm gone. I will return. Welcome to Bitter Bits. Welcome to Bitter Bits.
All right, I'm back. Oh. Also, Kombucha gifting out some subs in chat. Thank you so much, Kombucha, for driving the old bus. Driving the old bus down to Money Lane and pulling people on and being like, Welcome to Money Lane, people. <laughs> Welcome to Money Lane, people. But thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys have had, had fun tonight. And uh, thank you guys again for any of the follows, subs, donations, anything like that. It's always amazing. Thank you for keeping the show in business and all that jazz. Uh, it looks like... Um, I guess there's there's some sounds happening there. That's interesting. Uh, I'm trying to th take a look at like uh, what I could add here. It looks like we do have a decent chunk of points to spend. Extra knockback for melee weapons, increased carry weight, plus two strength. I'm gonna add that in there. That seems that seems pretty nice. Uh, and then we can do low thirst, uh, which is pretty whatever. So less chance to have food illness. That that seems nice, but we really haven't. Drives very fast. What is that? All right, let's roll the uh, let's roll the next person here and let's see who is gonna be the next uh, easy coup. All right, let's do four name. I don't know why in the world I even bothered shutting the fucking door like Kale wasn't just gonna bust in here. So then immediately start going crazy. Easy coup. I promise it's just as bad as it sounds. Low thirst, aka turn the horny down. I threw some uh. What was that? Oh, okay. Yeah, do do that, you weirdo. Um, ah, make my last name Eastern Blade. So you want to be Izaku Eastern Blade? That's what you, you want your entire name <laughs> to be Izaku Eastern Blade. <laughs> Would you like to be Mel or Femel? Yeah, Kale's just going fucking crazy. What else is new? The, the child, the child is nuts little critter this man needs a katana I mean he's gonna be he's gonna be a melee person naturally but like you want Mel all right make these uh salted caramel chocolates anyway I put some uh I put some chicken in the uh Mm hmm. <laughs> the reading glasses. Let's get in the jeans. Uh, we got socks, shoes, of course. Oh, I like this because, like, um, you're like slightly bald. I like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Give him the goatee. I posted my latest print in Discord. All right, hold up. Oh, nice, Zalgo. That looks good. That's a, what the hell is that? Is that like a dog shark? That's interesting, though. Wait. Wrong thing. I was looking at something else. Nope, nope, that was it. Funny story, I wrote bitter LOL subconsciously while messaging a coworker. <laughs> Looks like a balding Gordon Freeman. Perfect. Okay. These these have like the hardest container to close. They're very good too, but like, so it's salted dark chocolate caramel. Well, the problem is that there's so much fucking salt on them. You're just like, oh. all right, here we go. Oh, wow. Um,
So it looks like Izuku of the Eastern... Izuku Eastern Blade is... Looks like shit has already gone wrong. Um... For us, so... There's like nothing... Oh my god. I don't even think we have a trash bag. Dude, that bald spot is... That's fucking strong. Is there like a... Let's see if we can find like a container or anything in here. I don't even know. Is there like a bottle? Oh, ooh, ooh. Uh, cooking pot? No, I don't know. We could use the grill... Uh, the saucepan. This is the classic, dude. It's the classic. Got a muffin tray? VHS, you are dead. Perfect. Oven mitt is the best. I bet oven mitt does somehow maybe protect against like bites. But naming your character any variation of blade will cause them to spawn pre bitten. <laughs> oh my God. Wait, what? Dude, I thought you were serious because I was like, holy shit, is there a health thing? Because it looked like there was. And I was terrified. I was like, you got to be kidding me. Nick's biggest upgrade tonight has been a trash bag and a saucepan. That's not true. It was a trash bag and... It was a tra- Come on. It was a trash bag and, like, you know, a pipe. I mean, that's basically true. So, you know. You're not- You're not- you Whoop! Hey, bitch. I thought he had, like, extra melee knockback. What is this? Come on, Izuku of the Eastern Blade. Like, what? What even? You gross tissues. Who blows their nose? What the fuck? We're in my house! Yeah. Nice. The Eastern Blade strikes again. You merely studied the blade. I was born in it. Okay, so the door is like... What the fuck? Is it a Dude, look at this little closet! Oh, I love it. That's where I want to live. Well, oh. <laughs> oh. Izuku, Dark Star of the Eastern Blade. Uh, there's another saucepan. There is the rolling pin, which I suppose could be used as a weapon. Ooh, it could be, couldn't it? Eaten it. <laughs> hey, look at all this. Uh, yeah, the only problem with this, though, is that these, uh, all these foods are all fresh. Uh, so we're gonna have to eat these like relatively soon. You know, I bought I bought these little tiny, tiny like slider hamburger buns, and then I bought some chicken. So I'm gonna make these little tiny chicken sandwiches. I figured I'd do that because I'm trying to like cut down on what I eat, and I feel like if I have smaller portions like that, I'll actually not gorge myself on a million different things. Is that a speedo? Ooh, oh, the guitar case can be used as a the V-neck sweater. That's nice, even though you can't see it. Oh, because of the button up. Uh, let's, um, put this in the secondary, I guess. We'll start carrying shit in that. Nice. <laughs> With the fucking bonk stick and the guitar case. Uh, metalworking for beginners. Auto manual. Uh, trapping for beginners. There's VHSs in here as well. Expert foraging. Metalworking for intermediates. Okay. Uh, let's get that. Yeah, this is amazing, dude. That's it. That's a solid. What's the? What's the? Uh, uh, that, hey man, I I ain't hating on that. Yeah. Bitch. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Come on, Izuku Eastern Blade. Get him. Dude, these guys are hardy. Holy shit. Can we not? Oh, are they dead dead? Finally, Jesus. Izuku of Eastern Blade. Can we metal work a weapon? I really hope we can. I don't know if we can, though. I would imagine probably, right? What the hell do they just lose with those glasses? Get down! 
Oh my god! It's ridiculous! Half the time they don't even fall, we just end up beating them to death. Alright, let's clean up this uh, glass. I'm going through the window. Oh, shit. Did you have a police jacket on? Whoa! No way. Oh my god, there's a lot of them coming. Uh... Pineapple, pin pine, pineapple, apple pan over there. Uh, there's a frying pan. Oh, shit. She's got scissors in her back. Okay. Oh, shit. That was not what I was supposed to do. It's okay. Stay on it. Oh, shit! Okay, are they dead? I can't tell if we got, like, uh... I can't tell if we got bitten. Not yet, anyway. <sighs> okay. No, we haven't. Dude, we are a god. Oh, man. Okay, that stupid thing over there. Just, uh, I need a... Wristwatch, briefs, uh, police blue shirt, house key, a pistol, bulletproof vest. Oh, my god. Uh... We're gonna have to, gonna have to clean all this, but... Okay. Uh, alright. Oh my god! He is an absolute murderer! Look at him! Izaku is incredible! Holy shit! Yeah, get him, there's Liquid Snake. Take him out. Oh my god! What an absolute... What an absolute monster. Uh, okay, we've got... Uh, keys over here. Canned corn. Um, like, seriously, what a fucking beast. Like... We also got this, uh, we got a pistol, which, that's pretty sweet. I don't know if... Uh, there's a holster, too. I don't know. Does the holster, like... Can you do anything with that? Like, what happens if you... Equip that, I guess. I like how I was worried about those other clothes being, like, bloodied. Which is hilarious, because it just seems like... It just doesn't even fucking matter. Oh, it's like an extra, um, equip slot. That's cool. Uh, let's see. Shoes, house key, there's scissors... Uh, classic wristwatch. I guess let's wear one of the wristwatches. I can't believe, like, we lived through all that. That was unbelievable. You need to close the blind? I can't, I can't close shit. They're all broken and torn. <laughs> like, there's nothing to close. Okay. Uh, we're not staying here naturally because that's a, that's a shitload of, it's a shitload of death. Um, however... Uh, we are thirsty. I can't imagine why. Uh, do not fill the saucepan. Drink, drink the toilet water. Okay. I'm going to wash myself in the sink. Uh, we're going to wash ourselves, and then we're going to wash everything we have, because all of our clothes... <laughs> Look at him over there on the left! Oh my god! What a fucking demon! Fucking covered in blood and his goddamn rolling pin. Oh, that's beautiful. Now start the hunt for that five, for the 5,000. I'm trying, man. We're getting there, though. That's going to be sweet. Oh, I feel like you could have just drank from the sink next to the toilet, but do you? Well, of course I'm going to drink from the toilet. If I have the option to drink from the toilet and not be, like, judged for it, I'm going, like, going all in. That's the face of a warrior. Uh, it does seem like our chest is relatively well protected, but I don't really think we have much else going on. Um, shoes still suck. We need, like, gloves and stuff, I guess. 
I mean, drinking from the toilet tank is basically the same same as drinking out of just your tap. I mean, it's it's like it's identical as long as you're okay with drinking from a ceramic filled container as opposed to. Uh, Yeah. You can now escape penis tra I cannot believe the wave of I hope we got a clip of that shit. That was amazing. Like, I can't believe... Izuku's a, a, a beast. Like... I was I was so not prepared for that level of just, just absolute beatdown. I mean, he, he felled, what, like, 10 zombies at least? It's nuts. That box doesn't have shit in it. Uh, I guess let's poke around and check out the rest of the houses over here. We got a we got a headbanger over there. Um, oh God Almighty! Is it worth it to just keep beating on him? Like, oh, nothing there. No, no, no. Fuck! Fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah. What a, like, what an absolute demon. Alright, get ready. Bitch! Oh my god! That was fucking awesome! Okay, close the curtains. Whew! Alright, let's go close this window. Because that one we can't really do anything with anyway, but... Uh, let's close the window. Well, they got like firefighter equipment over there, though. Dude, this is crazy. Uh, let's. So these all seem to be pretty good. Give me that fireman's helmet. Uh, the pants are probably good too. <laughs> oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> yeah, military boots too. Look at that. Uh, yeah, what's their protect? Holy shit! Look at their protection, man. We're actually doing pretty good. Um, the firefighter's jacket might be better than like. I don't know if that's better than, like, the police stuff. Uh, that's pretty fucking good, man. That's, that's a good, that's a good set right there. We need to get some gloves. Uh, let's see, we got long sleeve t-shirt, gas mask. Um, I would imagine the gas mask is probably useful. I'll put it in the guitar case. I, I don't know if... Oh, wait, is the guitar, is the guitar case full? I think it is. Uh, what about this guy? Does he have anything good? I don't think so. Yeah, we're, we got, like, a, that, this is the most protection we have ever had. Like, the easily. Easily, easy coup, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there's a baseball in there. Advanced mechanics cooking for intermediates. I need to find something that's, like, uh, you know. Uh, we are heavy, though. Oh, my God. A lot. Uh, let's drop the jeans. Eat the carrot. We, we're in. We're in trouble. We, we got to eat. We're thirsty. We're fucking falling apart. Discomfort. Something doesn't feel right. Yeah, we're just running a very heavy load right now. Uh, so I have to figure out what to do here, really, because like all this shit's really heavy too. I think so. I need to just like drop the guitar case in here somewhere. Not permanently. I just need to figure out what's going on with our inventory. I really didn't solve the problem. We're we're still. Still looking a little dusty in here. Uh, the pistol is probably pretty heavy. Um, this V-neck sweater is not being used. The VHS, neither of these shoes, neither the police jacket. Uh, the planks. Well, I'd, like, I'd like to keep the planks, but... Yeah, now, now we can grab the guitar case again, I guess. 
I want to. I want to grab the the case itself. I don't want to grab the. Uh... There we go. Yeah, those planks were. Uh, those planks were crazy heavy. Little sad creature. I can hear him. They're just yelling. Um, the saddest, saddest creature you've ever seen. He gets played with all day. He gets loved on all day. He gets real nice food. And he gets to sleep all the time. Really, I mean, his life is is basically... Uh, it's I mean, it's basically agony. Like, it's just the worst. It's just the worst. Feel for him, you know? Feel for him. It's hard, hard shit being a cat in a well-loved home. Pretty, pretty tough stuff. Oh, there's some jeans... God damn it. Everywhere I find a every time I find a place that's looking like alright. Oh, that's that's looking nice. What's that? Pot of stew, fresh, uncooked. Oh my god. Get out. Like zombies, like if it's just one of them, like we got it, man. We got it. Okay, I'm not not worried about like uh, magazines and shit. Main thing I want to find now is a better a better melee weapon. Even though the rolling pin is incredible, don't get me wrong. Uh, better melee weapon. Oh, some of these ambulances sometimes have some good shit in them. Oh shit, it's broken. Oh my god. Uh, do I have anything? Else? I have the saucepan still. I think. Yeah, okay. Drop the rolling pin. It's okay. We're still we're still good. Damn. Oh, jeez. Okay. Woo. Well, it's uh oh the trunk's actually unlocked already. Which means it's probably trash in there. What the fuck? Why are there red frilly underpants in the ambulance? What's going on? What's what it, what is this shit? And jack shit in there either. Aviator glasses, bandanas. Things are a bit thirsty, drowsy, unpleasantly hot. Okay, the, the hot thing, I mean, you just got to get over it, dude. Like, you, you're a walking tank. You feel the need to express it's spiffos. All right, cool. It's like a burger joint. Great. I gotta go. I gotta go make my. Uh, gotta make my sliders here in a second. This is a really cool game. I like this a lot. I really hope you guys do too, because like, this could be a thing that shows up on streams more often. It's fine. It's 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 like easy enough to like pick back up and keep going and like grab a weapon, start bonking. You know what I mean? Like. It's not like the worst thing in the world to start over. Oh, I'd absolutely be willing to do multiplayer, 100%. I'd also be willing to have my frames not drop right now. That'd be pretty cool. Woo! I thought that was a different room. All right. Yeah, man, we could do like a we could do like a zombo whatever. It'd be crazy. Good time. All right, we got a nice little sink in here. Let's get some water. I don't fill the saucepan. Stop filling the saucepan, damn it. Oh, I'm gonna eat a floor burger. Don't worry. I will. These bathrooms seem like pretty safe places, too, because there's no windows or anything in there. All right, who's bangle dangling? I hear him. Oh, come on, man. I'm just gonna open the door. I don't want to break in the door. Come on. 
What? What the fuck? Oh, what was that shit? Oh, I hate like the way the uh, swing cadence works sometimes. It really sucks. It always feels like you're, you're like you're about to hit it and then it just doesn't do. I cannot believe. Thank you. Oh, I'm exhausted. I keep forgetting that's a thing. Would love if they just died. Would love it. Yeah, we might just want to, like, run. Because we are probably doing, like, minimal damage at the moment. Oh, no! Welcome no! To the oh, my God! I'm sorry, did they eat through my pants? Did that happen? Okay, we just gotta go, dude. Because, like... Oh my god! Come on, baby, you gotta get in there. Smash that head. Fuck! Get him. Get him. Okay. Okay, that one's at least, like, incapacitated to some extent. We should probably just walk away now. Because, uh, I don't... We, okay, we did. We did abs. Of all places, actually, we just got hurt on the left hand, which makes sense considering, you know, everything that just happened there. Uh, I'm going to rip this formal shirt up. And we're going to get some ripped sheet. Oh, come the fuck on. <laughs> oh my god, there's more of them! Get out of here! Okay, we are uh, currently extremely tired, so we need to... You, you bastard. Now we've been bit on the fucking right forearm. Just push him. Just push him. Push him! Okay. Yeah, gonna be, uh, gonna be kind of hard to get away from these guys, considering we are uh, tired, panicked, bleeding, wet, discomfort. Hey, Dragon says, heard this is a game for crazy people. I think it used to be a game for crazy people. I don't know if it still is, because, like, there's a lot of, like, it was, like, a new update or whatever. It's been out for, like, seven years, though. Fuck, what are you doing? Dude, there, okay, we gotta just retreat. There, there is no way. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna walk... Oh, I can't go in that way. That sucks. We're just, uh, just sashay. It's fine. So tired, so desperately inhumanly tired. Oh my god. Alright. Mm. Hold the line. Love is in hallways on time. This might be it right here. I'm trying to just get a kill on these assholes. Oh my god. It's gonna be like really hard though, considering our uh. Shut the door! Can't have more. Oh my god, I keep opening the door. Please shut the door! Oh, now we got that. Now we got that groin hurt. The big dick hurt. What do? You know, I got. I gotta say though, Izuku's character has uh has definitely hung in there for a long time, all things considered. Yeah, I think when you've got like all the all the debuffs up though, it's like really hard to fucking really hard to like actually actually get a kill. I mean, as you can see, like normally things go down pretty quick. Like this is nuts. I don't think I don't think we've been able to kill a zombie since we hit like yeah, here we go. Oh god. It was, it was so bad. The bitchy in the dick. They did, they got me. I can't believe uh in the short time that Izuku's character was around. God, I love these frame drops. They feel so good.
um, in the short time that Izuku's character existed, they they mowed through like a shitload of people. Like that was incredible. Like the amount of people they went through in that very short window is wild. Absolutely crazy. What time is it? God, it's already twelve thirty. What the fuck? Yeah, twenty nine zombies. That's like that's a shitload, dude. Or twenty six rather. That is uh that is a lot. All things considered, I like how they're banging on the door trying to get in to get some eats, and like it doesn't matter because whatever. All right, if you want to be the next character, type in Zombo. I'm gonna go and grab uh, some chicken and I'm gonna eat it. Yeah, type in Zombo if you want to be a thing. You only use ninety five percent of your damage when you're exhausted. Why couldn't we secure a kill then? What happened? Who has the big brain on this then? Explain that. All right, so here's the deal. Also, thank you again, Dragon, for the resub. I appreciate it. I hope you're doing all right. I hope you're doing all right. I saw you're doing Final Fandango 12 earlier, I think. I actually popped in there for a minute. Something about, there he is. I don't remember what was happening. What? Oh, there he is. I didn't, I, I hadn't heard him yelling for a little while. I was wondering what he was up to. All right, so next, uh, next lucky Zombo is gonna be Janny Black. So here's the deal. Um. I'm gonna let, uh, I keep doing these kind of like neutral builds because I'm still absolutely figuring out what the fuck to do in this game. Uh, and I'm thinking, I liked the, uh, I like the idea of big, big bonk smash. That definitely, that definitely had a lot going on. That was, that was very, very solid. And, um, I'm gonna do, uh, I like, I like dexterous. That sounds nice. Transferring inventory stuff quickly. So, um... That was a good learning run. I, I mean, we we killed a lot for sure. So, Janny, you want to be Mel for Mel, or what? And we'll uh, we'll go through here and we'll add we'll add stuff, whatever you want to do. I don't remember what was a uh, good negative ones over uh, overweight was one you could get uh, rid of. You could get rid of rid of it by moving around. Oh, that's interesting. Like you like lose weight or whatever. But that is interesting. Very interesting. I got these little teeny tiny, little teeny tiny buns for my, my chicken thingies. Super small. Make, make yourself like a little, make yourself like a little like chicken sandwich thing. Uh, but yeah, so just let me know, Mel for Mel, we'll go from there. Whatever you want to do. I want, I want Chimkin boy kind of like this for Janny Black, damn. <laughs> with the red glasses. I might just go with that because I think, I think they might be on a, might be on a bit of a delay. Uh, if it's up to them if they want to change something here. Mel is fine. All right, let's go back to Mel. Damn, they, look at this. Look at this get up right here. This guy looking good. 
I do love the Ash Ketchum hat. I do like that. Um, let's go. Let's go with the Ash Ketchum hat, and then let's do. Oh, absolutely with the chest hair, right? Gotta have it. Uh, let's drop the. Let's drop the baseball cap. Let's do. Do a little. I like that center part too. This is some weird. shit. What are you? What? What? What's going on? Oh my God! No, I saw this, and I'm very confused. What? No. Okay. Thank you. What? What is happening? Or like the weirdest thing. I look up and I'm like, what? What is going on? This is like a whole thing happening in the door with the dog and everything. I'm like, what is going on? This is crazy shit. All right. Uh, like Terry Bogar. I can't even like. What? What are we gonna do with this dude? Uh, give me the. Oh, dude. What if we do like a? I like. I like the quest for pants. That actually seems like a pretty fun quest. I like the idea of wake. Okay. Here's the deal. Janny's character woke up naked, but they did have their shoes and their undergarments on, right? So, like, yeah. So they woke up naked, but they did have their shoes and their undergarments on. So let's see. Let's see where we can go from there. Because obviously, I'm very proficient at this game. So, like, I'm going to be able to handle this. No problem. But well, my, the question the question I have for Janny is, what the hell were you... You want cargo pants? We're going to find cargo pants. Don't worry. We're going to get you taken care of. Janny's got to figure out the story here of why the hell they're naked. Their door's open. And, uh... Again, if you die in, like, the first five seconds, like we established earlier, I will absolutely just re-roll your character, because that feels terrible. Uh... Oh, there's some lipstick! Okay. There's a sheet. We can rip that to bits. <laughs> just put... All these shoes and undies when waking up. Same. Has anybody ever actually woken up in just your underwear and your shoes? Because I feel like that is a very, very particular set of circumstances that I just can't imagine. Can't imagine it happening that often, right? Can't, can't imagine it happening very often. God, I'm still just baffled by what was happening a minute ago. I'm so, so confused. Erica's like, I'm sorry, I'm confused. I'm just like, I thought like, I thought like... The reason I'm like, what? Like, what's going on? Is, like, I genuinely thought she was, like, hurt. She does this thing where, like, I, I don't I don't know. Like, the, the reactions to things are very, like, interesting in regards to, like, what you would normally think. And I'm just like, who's fucking dead? And she's like, I just, I was just wondering if you need some more water. I'm like, what? I'm like, what? Well, that's not how you say that. I appreciate it. That's not how you say that. Now I'm thinking somebody's dead. I'm going into, like, fight or flight mode over here. Oh, there's some chippies. Yum. Give me the chips. <laughs> the chips and the cigarettes. I don't know if he knows. I, can he even put them anywhere? I don't think so. We have like very. We don't even have pockets. Uh, I apparently cannot grab these cigarettes. What a what a sad day. I could grab the sponge. Uh, let's sit here naked and let's eat ham. Uh, directly out of the refrigerator. <laughs> After a long day of video gaming, you fell asleep before you could change the sleep where- Well, like... What? What? But why are your shoes on? Okay, I don't want just like a regular t-shirt, dude. We gotta find good shit. We also need, uh... We also- we have to find the cargo shorts first before we're allowed to... Before we're allowed to equip anything. You wash your stink. Ooh, a sewing kit! That's nice. That's the kink. It always has to be about a kink, right? Like, no- Nothing, nothing could just be like a ha ha funny. It's got to be like that's the kink, right? It's got to be ha ha sex thing. Like it can't just be ha ha. It's funny because the man fell asleep and he only has his shoes and underwear. It's like ha ha. He liked that because he wants to fuck like that. That is what he want. It must be the fucking. It must always be the fucking. We must always sexuals. Oh, garbage bag. Sign me up. Put it in the offhand. We don't even have a weapon yet. I could battle this man with, like, lipstick. Look at this shit! <laughs> what is with all this garbage? There's so much of it! There is, a, there is an unreasonable amount of trash out here. I had to eat, partner. I'm just coming on in. Oh, shit. Man, that must be miserable. Whatever. <gasps> Whoa! Check this place out! Holy shit, they're barricaded. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, and it's got one window that's open. That is interesting. 
Woo! It was a survivor. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. We can do this. Okay, we got him down. Fuck. Dude, this is good shit. We can't, we can't pass this up. Yes! Okay, we got him. Alright, uh, is there a way to... Can I grab that plank? Can use that as like a, use that as like a weapon. Uh, oh my god, yeah, this is, this is good shit. You see that guy's backpack? We like, we ran across like a survivalist house. Oh man, now we just gotta board that window up, but I don't know if we have like, we need like nails and shit. Okay, that one's also there, but like... Okay, I think the, the boarded up shit's gonna give us some time though. As long as we can defend this one spot right here, which I think, I think we should be able to. Oh, did I cut my hands on the broken window? Oh, shit, I did. Fuck. Oh, lodged glass shards. Oh, no. I did. I went through it too fast. I should have fucking, uh, should have fucking cleaned it up. Shit. Okay, we got tank top straps. Uh, you want a cargo shorts, so I gotta find cargo shorts, but I don't know if we have the time to choose right now. Uh, there's a bloody hoodie. Let's, uh... But that's shit. Oh, you can wear the hood up. That's interesting. Uh, riding boots. Those also seem good. Uh, some pants. That large backpack seems amazing. So we're definitely gonna grab that. Um, so I guess I need to find, like, some alcohol or something like that. Oh, I don't want to equip that in primary, but... Um... Needs to be equipped in... How, how does this work, actually? Can you, like, put these in your... Can you put the... Can you put them on your back? It seems really weird that you would, like, have to wear that... Oh, equip on back. There you go. So the trash bag you have to put in offhand, but, like... Okay, what else was over here? He, I feel like he should have more. But I guess not. Digital watch. Uh... There's military boots, which I think that might be better than what we have. There's a wallet. There's military camo shorts. Lumberjack shirt. Okay. So this area ended up not being as, uh, quite as useful as I thought it would be, but it's still not bad. That's true. If he had more, he wouldn't have died. <laughs> that is true. Uh, we could burn this son of a bitch down, I guess, if we wanted to. But yeah, we don't even have, like, a good weapon for this anyway. So, uh, I guess we can drop the trash bag, because we don't need that. Door hinge. There's some planks here. I guess now, if we wanted to carry around planks... Let me, let me remove this bandage and put, like, a good bandage on there. God, I hate that there's glass shards in it. Is there a way to, like... Yeah, remove glass. Try to pick that out, and then we'll, uh... Okay, we got the glass shards out of there. Uh, let's use the actual bandage on it. <sighs> that was worth it, though, man. Nice peanut butter and tea bags. That's nice. I, I would imagine peanut butter is probably would probably be pretty good in the the apocalypse, because like, okay. Oh god, did they just break something? No, they're certainly trying, though. I, I want to get this, like, fixed up. Um. Okay, what are we using as a weapon right now? Nothing. I think I broke that, uh... Oh, no, I didn't break the plank. Alright, let's remove the glass. What the hell's happening over there? You see that zombie over there? What the fuck is that all about? Let's go, uh, let's go end this so we can stop listening to this asshole smashing up our house. Oh, we were three assholes! Oh my god! Fuck, run, 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 run! Dude, I thought it was one. Oh my god. Oh my god, I thought it was one. It was not one, it was several. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna bleed to death. Uh, yeah, we are ma massive blood loss. Death imminent. Take your time. Take your time. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll be able to live this. Who knows? I think I have enough ripped sheets to at least bandage up. Quick, eat the peanut butter! 
Well, we had the dirty rag with the last one, but I guess that ain't the worst thing. Okay, uh, massive blood loss, but we did we did patch up. It's because your last name isn't Corn Dog. You don't have the resilience. I cannot believe how many fuckers there were just chilling there. It was unbelievable. Uh, I guess uh, yeah, very severe damage, of course. Um, but we're not we're not dead, so that's good. I just need to get somewhere where there's like we can we can take a fucking moment of reprieve. Uh, how are we looking on the it's alcohol wipes? Uh, tape. Run! Oh my god, they just ate my ass! Wait. I wish you could exit, like, the other side of the fucking car door, but you can't. No, 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 no! Oh, no! Uh, oh, you can exit the other side! Shit. Dude, that was, like, that was, like, so fucking high-octane for such a short, like, endeavor. That was crazy. <laughs> like, that was so weird. I was like, there was like zero to 60 where we're just like walking around, somehow land in an area where there's like some survivalist who's like boarded up a fucking house. Unbelievable. Yeah, the real, the real shit is having the last name Corndog. That keeps you around. Let it be known that this was the first time we had survived long enough. Survived long enough to uh, actually see a hoodie, or rather, gotten lucky enough to see a hoodie and a backpack. is long enough none how long how we last land was that the was that the song we were singing uh hey hey nah. we're alone <laughs> ah the cursed backpack it was i'm sorry Janie. sorry we tried <laughs> your your quest for cargo shorts <laughs> You never know, man. You can always, uh, I guess maybe having the last name Corndog does, uh, I, I, hey, leave her alone. Come on. Can't get past your own lawn. You talking about like, uh, you talking about like your weenie? Like, what are we talking about? All right, type in Zombo if you want to be the next character. I, I, hey, I don't know. Both of you stop Quit being animals for like two seconds. Anyway, type in Zombo if you want to be the next character. God, I hate that Janny's was so fucking short. That was like, that was promising. Especially after the patch job walking away, because I was like, man, we might have this. We did not have it. I would imagine it's pretty common to die a bunch when you're first starting this, because, like, definitely a lot going on here. I think the easiest, the easiest, like, death we've had yet, where I just, like, was we were doing good as Azuri, and we came across that lady in the dress on the road, and she just whooped our ass in, like, two seconds. I was like, oh, my God. Also, what's the major difference between the maps? Is there, like, difficulty to them, or, like, what? Oh, you think it was from the forest excursion? I don't know if that had too much bearing on it. I think she just hit, like, our neck or something like that, and we bled out super quick. Oh, it's the same map, just different starting towns. Oh, that's actually really cool. I didn't know that. 
Very neat. Oh. You can always get back to the bait shop. Talk about old Hootie's, old Hootie's bait and tackle. All right, let's roll it out. Jigakuro, you're up next. Prepare to die. I do like the... Uh, I kind of want to do something different here. Like, it doesn't seem like, uh... Faster running speed could run for longer without tiring. Okay, so we could do, like, athletic, I guess, if we wanted to. Um... We would have to do a detractor, though, I guess. Uh, for one of the detractors, makes more noise when moving, transfers inventory items more slowly. Uh, cowardly, especially prone to panicking, and short-sighted, slow reader. I guess it takes longer to read books wouldn't be, like, the worst thing in the world. I know, dude. Super rigged. Also, uh, if you guys if you guys haven't yet and you are interested in participating in the upcoming uh, Bits D&D &D session from the Shave It or Save It stretch goals last year, uh, go join the tabletop chat by using the roll thing in Discord. And uh, ping me if you would like to be in the running for being in the D I say in the running. We have, like, we have, like, about 20 people now who are in the pool for that, so I'm going to try to randomly select people and... Uh, bring them on, and because I figure pretty much everybody that's offered I know is has been around in chat for some amount of time. Even the newer folks I know are pretty cool, so I'm not like really worried about people coming in and being weird about being weird about stuff. I've read like 60 books this year, but okay, how you fucking read so many, dude? Oh, you think that makes you smart brain? Shit. Shit. All right, the question is, what are we going to make Jigakuro? We're gonna, probably going to make him like a... Uh, I, I like the idea of just a balding man running around in his diaper until he finds, like, the right shit going on, right? You don't like being in the running? Do you want me to take your name out of the pool? Is that what that means? I'm, conf I'm confused. You don't like running. I have lush hair, but can't grow a beard. I'm gonna give you a mullet. All those words sounded like, give me a mullet. Oh. Why did the track why did the track teacher hate his car? He couldn't make it run. <laughs> oh. I had a joke about being unemployed, but I couldn't work it out. That's fine. That's my brain at all times. And that's the worst part, because, like, this is this is my job. I'm supposed to be good at making jokes, and yet uh, they're all terrible. I went to the store earlier today and saw some guy I graduated high school with walking around with a mullet still, and I was like, how are you more successful than me? How do you know that they're more successful than you? Cause like the mullet might be holding him back big time. You know what I mean? Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Jigakuro said... 
that they had long hair, which means we're gonna give them that, but then we're gonna give them like none. That's an interesting. That's an interesting look right there. Oh. I, I like the idea of the long socks there. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, let's do. Let's do some shorties. Maybe give him like a little little tanky. Looking good. Looking good, dude. Looking good. Looking good. <laughs> I don't know. Should we give him should we give him the last name of uh instead of Jigo Kuro? Should we give him Jigo Kuro uh What was it? Dump truck? What was the last name that was really good for Azuri? Yeah, it was it was like Gary Dump Truck or some shit? Thank you guys for being patient while I ate my chickens. Corn dog. I'll leave it to Jigakuro. If he wants to be one of the corn dog lineage, he's welcome to, or he could just be Jigakuro. It doesn't matter. You want Jigo McJiggles? That's a uh, that's an interesting name. All right, you're not part of the lineage, so you better be careful out there. You better be careful out there, man. You had the uh, we gave you like the um, super fast running speed, right? Oh, look, a knife. That's nice. Grab the butter. It's a fucking butter knife, though. God bless. God bless. McJiggles is pretty good. Hot sauce. I got some of that sitting right next to me. By the way, I've tried uh, all those hot sauces that are made in um, uh, South Carolina. It's like a South Carolina-based hot sauce hot sauce company that Erica actually saw at like a little kind of like market thing she went to. Um <laughs> She was talking to him and she's like, yeah, my husband does like online broadcasting stuff and he's a big fan of hot sauces. They're like, oh man, if he likes it, maybe we'll you know sponsor him or whatever. I can confidently say uh, their hot sauces are extremely good. Um, and I am I am considering it. Considering reaching out to him and be like, all right, what would this what would this agreement look like? Because your shit's good. It really is. It's called um, radiation therapy. Very, very, very good. Like, very good. Very, uh, they're very like hearty, like, uh, Hot sauces, I guess. Like, they got a lot going on. They're not, like, just stupid hot or something like that. Like, they're, uh... The one I just had, uh, this one right here was a... Uh, this was habanero, garlic, and tomato. Hey, man, one of these days, if donations and shit dry up, we may have to look into sponsorships. Hmm. There's a dead mouse right there. That's nice. Uh, there's a can of, can of soda... Yeah, they got they got a really good like flavor profiles to them. That, that's my problem with a lot of hot sauces these days. Is it seems like it turned into a big dick measuring contest for who could put the most fucking like ghost ghost pepper and fucking Carolina Reaper into shit. And I'm just like, great, this is so good. I love that this just burns and has no fucking flavor whatsoever. That re really does feel like that that became like the pissing contest. Don't let that meat go to waste. Uh, well, I can't really do much with it now. I wanna, I'm gonna see if I can find at least a trash bag to carry stuff around in. But ooh. Oh, okay, so there's like survivor house. Might be the same survivor house as before, but oh my god! All right, Clark, it's good to see you, buddy. Take take a uh, take care in the thing to do the do. Uh, trash bag. Trash bag. Why haven't I came up with that? I can't tell if you're being serious. I mean, I saw a trash bag. I saw it said container, and I was like, "Can I? Can I like? Can I like stuff stuff in the trash bag and use this like an actual container?" <laughs> Chat's like, "Yeah, put it in your fucking offhand." I'm like, "Oh my god, dude, look at that salami! Eat that shit." Yeah, I mean, like I've always said before, like I, I'm not a big fan of like sponsorship shit, but I mean, if it ever hit a point where like we weren't getting like. <laughs> If we ever, if we ever hit a point where like we weren't getting a lot of subs or donations kind of dried up or whatever, um, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be opposed to it because I would need to, I would need to stay in business somehow. So, you know, if that's what, if that's what I gotta do, that's what I gotta do. Hey man, if I, if I had to go with Raid Shadow Legends, I'd do it. What? What? What are you yelling? What? I didn't, I didn't say it was, what, what? I didn't say it wasn't. What, <laughs> what's happening? 
Oh, here's uh, there was I don't know if there's anything in this car. Let me uh, let me double check again. Uh, there is a comb, a pencil, and a wallet. Great. <laughs> great, great. Oh, yeah, no, I like it a lot. It's good shit. The only one I haven't had is their uh, blueberry ghost pepper one, which that does seem, uh, that seems interesting. I need to get a weapon so I can try to take on that, uh, take on the survivor house over there, because, like, I really want to go in there and see if I can get, like, a hoodie from that guy or whatever, because hoodies seem really good. So, <clears throat> nothing like t-shirts and trash in here. I gotta, gotta find, gotta find something to swing, dude, even if it's, like, a saucepan. <laughs> Steal the wallet. Yeah, man, that'll do it. I got the sniffs, though, from that last one, but it's pretty spicy. Oh, they broke into this one. Um, maybe I can, like, grab that plank really quick. Oh, you bitch. I guess we did have the butter knife, but let's be real. Oh, my God, you can equip something in both hands? Whoa, I didn't know that. You could, like, dual wield? Or, rather, you know. You could beat the shit out of him. Fuck. Yes. Nice. 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 Stomp him. Wait, what's happening? Can, can you not stomp when... Get him! Yeah. God damn, dude. I couldn't stomp because he was already dead. I thought he was, like, still up or whatever. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Is it... Do you think it's... Oh. Mm, they don't look like survivor people. Like, they don't seem like they have any good on them, so I'm just gonna leave them alone. is doing pretty good so far, man. I like this, uh... This extra run speed's really nice. I gotta go find the, uh... I gotta go find the house that was, like, boarded up or whatever. I think it was, like, over... here, maybe? Oh my god. Stupid trees! Oh, this is like a... What is this? This is something. <gasps> Look at that little American flag. That's cute. They got, like, they got a little stuff going on here. That's a nice-ass oven. You see that thing? I should probably shut the door behind me, shouldn't I? <laughs> Just in time. Idiot. Okay, what all we got in here? We got a... <clears throat> We got cigarettes, uh, which I don't know if those are, like, worth anything. I'd imagine they are. Oh, a lighter! Wow, okay. Uh, some glue might be good, too. An eraser. All right. Sheet of paper. I don't know, like, if you can actually use glue on anything important, but I would imagine so. I didn't shut the curtains. That's a nice fucking stove, dude! <laughs> Those music stings keep getting you. I don't know if you're stupid for not using it. I can't tell if you're being serious if you're just talking about the trash bag thing. Get him. Get him. Get him! Oh, wow. Okay, planks have, like, none durability. However, we do still have, we do still have the fucking, the griddle pan. Fuck yeah. I wish you could, like, uh, two-hand the griddle pan. Go for, like, the turbo bonk, you know what I mean? Uh, did that guy break in yet? He, Lord help him, he is trying. Trying he damnedest. Trying he damnedest. Uh, what is his strength, actually? Are we able to, like, hoist up that, uh... Maybe we could, like, get this thing... No, I don't want to set up... Uh, I guess I'm gonna open it. Hello? <laughs> oh, there's a garbage bag. Hell yeah. Yeah, like, garbage bags, like, I'm not even joking, like, they actually do seem to be pretty good to put, like, your offhand and, like, throw your shit in. <laughs> like, it seems to be pretty, like, a solid, uh, solid way to keep some stuff, like, safe and kind of out of your main inventory if you're trying to keep stuff organized. Um, 
Oh, I guess we can replace the plank. Let me just drop it, I guess. I'll miss you, plank. Oh, I suppose we didn't see the option to two-hand anything because we were normally dual-wielding to some extent. No, that's all jammed up. Wasn't this... I thought this was the house we started in. I guess not. Uh... Crawl in there with a dumbass. What a what a fucking what a fucking idiot. All right, so let's see. Oh, that one. Jesus Christ, that place is burned down. I don't know if uh, I don't know if like that's a what. I I don't know. You have you would be able to check just as easy as. Uh, do you have, do you not have your phone on you? I mean, yeah. I mean, I'll 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 look I'll look it up for you. It is only fifty three out. <coughs> Okay, this is one of the survivory houses. So if we can somehow get in here, but I would, I would, I would assume that we would need like some way to. Uh, maybe we could disassemble that. Oh shit! Oh god! Get out of here! Get Stomp him! Yeah, no, Erica was asking if it was cold out, and I was like... Oh, no! Oh, my God, I hope we didn't get... We absolutely got bitten. Fuck. Okay, do we have anything we can rip up a... Uh... uh... Fuck. God damn it. Well, this may not be the worst thing ever. We should be okay for right now, but we, we're definitely hurting a little bit. I just... I hate that, like, uh... I want to get in that house. I don't know how the hell we're supposed to do it. I don't know. It does say slight damage, so... Maybe it, maybe it's not that bad. I'm just trying to figure out how to, like... Is there any way to do anything with this? If you're... Low. Yeah, because it's like, it's like prioritizing the shelves or whatever. Yeah, I guess there's no... Fuck, I want to get to that dude right there. Oh, oh shit. Uh, remove glass. Yeah, I, I guess you have to do something to get, like, some of the barricades off or whatever. I mean, I could let these people just sit there and smash it until... I mean, they're, they're gonna be there a while, but, you know. I like how it says... How it says that we're panicked, and it's like, well... Oh, you have to have a hammer for it? Okay. Yeah, I think... I guess Erica's alright. I think she was just heading outside to take the dog out. I mean, we could have a little sippy of orange soda. I love the idea of Jigakuro just sitting here with the soda. <laughs> just... Just sipping it. As they bash their brains in on this fucking barricade. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit, that's beautiful. Uh, I definitely want to check that place out. I just, um... Yeah. It doesn't seem worth it right now, I guess. It's fuck. This entire area doesn't really seem super, super worth it. Like... We found like a trash bag and a plank. What we need what we need is like a baseball bat. That's what we fucking need. Oh god damn it. Every time I go anywhere, did that close it? There we go. How could bash your brains in somewhere else? Water bottle. Oh, I actually think we need a water bottle, don't we?
Yeah! Stomp him! Is the AC on? Alright. I was very confused. Uh, let's see. Okay, it's a padded pants. You know, honestly, padded pants might be the better way to go about this. Let's uh, wear these padded pants. Let's, uh, let's rip up the... What were we just wearing? Oh, these shitty shorts. Let's rip those up. Oh, our bandage is dirty. Oh, no. All right, let's remove. Okay, so yeah, I think Jigakuro is fine for the most part. I think it's a... We might want to use... Are these gross? No, let's get rid of the dirty rags. Uh, oh! You can apparently... Oh, you can clean them. That's interesting. Well, it's not super hard for us to get, like, rip sheets and stuff like that. But we do need to get a... Uh, we do need to get a... Uh, tank top. Round neck sweater. We do need to wear something that has some bite resistance. Because I'm assuming being naked is probably a bad call. Uh, let's wash. Wash up. Wash. Wash up. He sent him a $5 link. Damn. There it goes. Not gonna... I don't know. I don't, I don't think we've had any $5 links tonight. None. None $5 link. However, Jigakuro has, has stayed up on the $2 link game, which is impressive. He upped the game, and then everybody disappeared. None could hang. Dude, washing ourselves took forever. My god. Let's, uh, let's wash the clothing, too, I guess. I can't tell if that one Zambi just gave up, or what. <laughs> I have no idea what happened to him. Really want to get in that barricaded place and get that backpack from that guy, but I just don't think that's going to happen. I just can't see that happening. Ah, oh, I don't have a can opener for that either. There we go. Now we're all nice. Look at that. He's all nice and clean. Looking nice and prim. Uh, there's another garbage bag in there. Good. Life is full of distractions. Uh, let's see. What what's in here? Okay, I'm gonna check this place out, and then we're gonna head on out, because, like, I feel like we've probably been in here for too long already. Oh, god damn it. It's the tinfoil hatters! Shit. Oh my god. What the fuck? Get out of here! Oh my god. I was so unprepared for two of them. God damn it. Get them out of my face. Oh good, my thing's broken. Perfect. Push them, push them! Get him! Get him! Okay. Did they come through the fucking window? Yeah, I guess they did. Alright, well. Uh, I suppose we should probably grab one of the tinfoil hats. That might... I wonder if that, like, actually offers bite protection. That'd be really funny if it did. Uh, let's check and see if there's a... We just cleaned up, too. Now we're all covered in trash again. Let's get the fuck out of here. It's so dark. Uh, yeah, I guess let's just kind of hoof it. Uh, I think we've been to most of this shit over here, so I'm just gonna kind of stick to the road and just start heading up. Because th this place, this place definitely doesn't seem to have anything of merit. If I can find any, I need to find like a, I need to find like a park. Go get me a baseball bat and just start beating stuff. Did we try that car yet? Judging by the pool of blood on the floor, I am going to assume that yes. I think that was where Jigakuro got bitten initially, anyway. Uh, we don't have too much trash. I hate the griddle pan's broken. I'm very upset about this. <laughs> I'm very, very upset about that. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, there's like 50 of them. That's great. Yeah, we're just running around at night. This is perfect. What what could possibly go wrong? Why, why do I feel like the... F <laughs> you got like for you guys. Like, it's really bad for me. It's like basically just pitch black for you guys. Which is great. It just adds to the effect for this. Uh, there are some houses and things over here, I think. 
Thankfully, Jigakuro is pretty athletic, so we haven't really had a trouble with any, like, stamina issues or anything like that. What is this? Well, there's a parking lot here. Uh, there's a diner. Yeah, this is bad, though, because, like... I don't think we're going to be able to get in there easily. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, they're going to be, like, overrun in the place. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. It was actually open. Oh, shit. Uh, there's an exit back here. Okay, I'm... This is bad. <laughs> this is really bad. <laughs> we don't even... <laughs> we don't even have, like, a bonk stick. Oh. Um. Mm. Oh, yeah, they're right there. This is bad. This is bad. Uh, well, as long as we have... Let me make sure... Make sure we got some, like, stuff to... If the garbage bag has anything in it. <laughs> Smoke a cigarette. <laughs> oh, we do have the butter knife, though. Uh, we could use that. Let's, let's smoke it up real quick, though. All right. So we've got the butter knife. This this could be our saving grace. It just depends on how many Zambi there are. All right. All right. Here we go. Yeah, here, here we go. Oh, I'm sorry. Are we uncomfortably hot? Woo! That's a lot more than three. Run! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's actually working. It's working! Oh, my God. The butter knife strat. <laughs> yeah, clip it. The butter knife strat taking it home. Unbelievable. Look like me after I've been up 26 hours and I'm fighting my demons at 3 a.m. I can't believe that worked. Oh, well, there's another clump of them. That's not good. Holy shit. I cannot believe we got out of there. That was unbelievable. Fuck it, we butter knifed him and then peaced. <laughs> and it just started. <laughs> Naturally, we are under a state of strong panic. I can't wonder. I can't even imagine why, right? A uh, little unhappy that I didn't get to loot the diner, but there are so many of them behind us. Uh, again, though, Jigakuro is pretty athletic. Seems like they're doing pretty good on the on the hoofing it here, so not the uh, not the worst situation. And we've got street lights too, so we can kind of keep an eye on stuff. Thank God for the street lights. Uh, okay, there's a path over here. There's a bus busted up car. Uh, what the fuck is that? Okay, we don't need that. Oh, is this like a massive building? Holy shit, I think it is. What is this? Oh my god. It is. I didn't think this was like a big building. Wow. Uh, I think we could take this asshole out. Uh, I don't know. I feel, like, I feel like it'd be easier to handle him now than... Yeah, it's like a big warehouse or something. Whoa. Uh, no, it's a factory. Okay, so... Man. This is uh, not exactly what I expected. Those, those empty pallets... Pro oh, shit. All right, here we go. Get him on the butter. Would, would you believe that the butter knife had shitty durability? Would you believe it? Uh, they had loot earrings, red digital watch. Okay, go upstairs. We don't have a weapon right now, so this kind of sucks, but... At least we've got, like, uh, at least we've got, like, some semblance of... Oh, jeez. This, honestly, the shove is actually pretty good. Okay, they, this dude had a hard hat. Uh, he also had a foreman's vest. A hard hat, though, that should be kind of handy. All right, let's uh, let's redo this bandage because it's dirty at the moment. So let's uh, drop this and let's yeah, because it's just scratched now, so that's not not the worst. Yeah, see, we recovered from that pretty quickly. That's good. 
And we've got the power of the push at the moment. A clip-on tie, a house key. I don't know where in the world that house key would go to, but I guess it's... I would assume that the game uses house keys, like, if you come across one. Oh, man, I like that area. There's nothing. Uh, if you come across a house, like, that's locked or whatever, and you try to use it, I don't know if it'll, like, automatically try your keys. Uh, rubber band, sheet of paper, pen, paper clip, oh, fucking adhesive tape. God damn, we cannot get, like, anything, like, weapon-wise. I have a feeling we're about to get Ooga Booga here any second, so just prepare yourselves. <laughs> just prepare yourselves for the whatever's about to happen here. Lights in here suck, too. Uh, no, no zombies in here, though. We've been alright on that. It's actually been a relatively safe area. Oh, I suppose I could check the, the desks. They might have something in them. Uh, Bible readings? Perfect, that's what I need. Oh, come on, don't show up. Aw, oh, bless it. Spoke too soon, I guess. Let's see here they fucking come. Uh, some more cigarettes. Uh, a lot of cigarettes. We're still here. We're still smoking. <laughs> We're still smoking. Uh, some scrap metal. Uh, maybe, there, maybe there's something good in, like, the trash over there. I don't know. Okay, so we're back here. We can get back to the factory floor, I think, this way. So I'd imagine they're going to probably start like, swarming here in a minute. I got to try to get through this. Oh, it's like a storeroom. This might be good. But bleach, thank God. That's what I needed. Dirty rag, dirty rag, dirty rag. This place sucks. <laughs> I saw like a giant like factory warehouse. I'm like, hell yeah, dude. We're going to have some good shit here. And there's just nothing. Just doo doo. Oh my god. There there really isn't shit here. Maybe over here and you're like the some of these oh, Jesus. I got a good feeling. Push him. Push him. Push him. Uh, he's got a letter opener, so, like, that's, like, something that will probably break. Shit! Bitch, get out of here. Shut that door. Turn on the light. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, paintbrush, paint, small metal sheet. Uh, metal bar. Oh, hell yeah. Give me all three of those. Are you kidding? Like, they're kind of heavy, but I would imagine that they don't break very easy. Oh, thank God. Might be able to, uh... Might be able to two-hand that, too. Let me, uh... Let me put her unequipped bag... <laughs> Let me unequipped garbage bag really quick. So you can't... You can't two-hand that one, which is... Like, what... So does anybody know, like, how, uh wield with both hands works because it doesn't seem to really be consistent well there's a saw we really wanted that last time uh make sturdy stick okay uh i'm definitely taking the saw definitely taking the nails uh, i know the planks are heavy too oh fuck those are really heavy um Grab the nails. Let's uh, let's drop the planks. Let's drop. Let's re-equip this in the second hand, I guess. <laughs> it's just a different upgrade path. You're right. You can also drop a tinfoil hat, I guess. Um. Okay, they're not banging on our door yet, so we're okay for right now. How many metal bars do we have? We had several, I think. Yeah, we had two extras. I just wonder if there's a way to, like... That's really strange that you can't wield that with two hands. So... But we do have, we have a very sturdy bonk stick now, which is good. Oh. Fuck. Oh, 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 oh. I can't see shit, dude. Oh, God. 
Oh, good, and that's stuck. This is bad. Oh, it's so dark. I think I can do this. Come on. I like the beat. Fuck! Oh, God. That's not a door! That is, but I can't get to it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> what dude's crawling? Okay. I'm out. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it does do a really good job with darkness, yeah. Very, very good. So now that we have the saw, we can, like, break down, like, furniture and shit, I think, which is really good. Seems It seems like getting a few of the tools is, like, really, really great. Because if we had had the option to get those tools... Okay, let's, uh, let's, let's get out of here from the factory area. I feel like we got a couple of good things. I... We didn't get anything incredible, for sure, but, uh, it wasn't the worst. I wonder if there's anything in this car. Let's find out. I mean, it seems like the cars that are, like, smashed up like that, uh, it seems like you can't get in those. <laughs> the, I like, again, the only problem Jigakuro is having right now is he's, like, a little, uh, he's a little, he's a little hungry. Um, which we do not really have a lot of food at the moment. There might be some in the garbage bag. No, it's mostly glue. <laughs> Unless he wants to eat a little bit of glue. Thankfully, we do have water though. So while he's a little bit hungry, he, he's not. We're not. We're not hurting on the on the thirsting. Uh, a lot of a lot of them hanging out in the middle of the road. Shit. I feel like Bella's got like eight birthdays. Oh. Oh, here's a like long path. Where does this go? You think? His name's Kel now. She's so mean to him. What was no, that? That's her. Hey. Well, it's because he's always barking at him. No, she was fine. After. Then she barked at him. Okay, I'm going to remove this bandage while we're walking. And then I'm going to put the new sheets on it. Change the sheets. I really want to check this place out, but there, again, are so many of these assholes around here. Maybe I can, like, pop the window open? Ah, window's jammed. Shit. And I don't want to, like, put myself inside and... Metal bar does not have the stopping power that I thought it would. Yeah, it's way too many. I want to see. I want to see what's in there because, like, I feel like that that could be pretty cool. This game does like it does expo exploration pretty well because I think like you get you're just very limited as to what you can get. So naturally, the prospect of like any house is like okay, that might have like e fucking anything in it that could be useful. Uh, this is a barn which is full full fucking open. Great, there's already assholes in here, so <laughs> I guess never mind. Okay, Jigakuro is actually getting we he's actually getting wearied weary now. We should call him by his, his proper name, which is McJiggles. Uh, uh I would agree that Barnes would have weapons. I mean, like at least something, right? Like some kind of hook or like a little bit a little bit of scythe or something like that. I don't know, something out there. A little, little sickle. You've actually got good uh you got good head protection. So like the hard hat the hard hat's gonna carry you on getting bitten in the face. Which I would I would say hasn't happened a lot, but I'm pretty sure that's happened to two of our people, and I'm pretty positive that's killed them. So, yeah, battle steer, whatever, dude. Such common bar tool, <laughs> hydraulic press, <laughs> fucking flamethrower. You know all the things you would normally find in a barn. Uh, not actually super tired yet, but definitely drowsy. We need to find another area that's similar to uh, Hootie's Bait and Tackle. Because Hootie's Bait and Tackle was like... That was like the salvation, man. That place was so good. I love I love Hootie's Bait and Tackle. It's fantastic. Ooh, what is this? What is this? Oh, shit. Nothing. I'm sure.
Ugh. Okay, now we're now we're hungry. Moderate exertion. Okay, so we need to uh we need to find a place to rest here soon. And I'm sure if we can find like a house or whatever, there'll probably be some food. Because he's just he's not gonna be able to run the same. Oh, what is this? Oh. Oh no, I dropped my sack. Oh well. See if we can find anything in these cars. Uh, I don't want to try to break a car window because I feel like some duct tape and a tarp. I was going to say this area seems pretty safe because it has big fences, but there's toilet paper. Oh, God damn it. Is there anything in the glove box? Value tech, portal disc, a pen, a magazine, and an eraser. Oh my God. I'm about to just go sleep in one of these cars. I don't want to lose my trash bag. Ooh! What is this? Uh, empty gas can. Four of them. Okay. Fucking kill him! Oh my god. Stay away. Is he not dead? Oh, he is dead now. Okay. I could go for it. I could go for it. I could go for it. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, it went for the, uh, that makes sense. It went for, like, the, the kill as opposed to... Oh, no! Get out of here. I just want to check that car out, but I guess never mind. Okay, I have to remember where the, uh, where the trash bag was. It was on the fence on the south side. We'll get it. <laughs> we leave no trash bag behind. Oh my god, there is nothing in this fucking game. Unbelievable. Like, there hasn't been shit. Like, we have just had the hardest time finding anything. Because, like, when you think about it, we have run super, super far. Oh, good. Porta potty. There we go. Oh, there's a busted up that. There's more zombies, thank God. Uh, what else? I think that's gonna be my next like project thing. I think I'll get a 3D. You know what? I I got bigger things to worry about than getting a fucking 3D printer and doing that. Um. Well, I shit. I guess I was I was gonna remember where this was and everything for all the <laughs> shit, but. Did we even check this trunk to see if there's anything in here? Yeah. No, I gotta, I gotta, I got way more important stuff to worry about than a 3D printer. I gotta do, I gotta do car shit. I gotta do my surgery. Got way more important things to worry about. Is there anything in, in here? Uh, there's a battery. There's some cologne. There's a pencil. Oh, that ain't shit, man. It rigged the car to blow. Perfect. What were you expected to find in the porta potty? You know, man, with this game, I, I don't know, something. Okay, dusty ass rags. Uh, we need a we need a bandage. Uh, it is infected. Um, so. Did we have alcohol in the trash bag? I'm thinking we did. Hello? Uh, let me equip that on secondary. We had tape. <laughs> we, we had tape. We might have to rip up our shirt again to use it as a bandage. Uh, yeah. I think we're going to have to. All right. Damn, you look a little, you look a little pale. Oh. All right. Well, we're all, we're all bandaged up on our infected ass wound. God damn it. Can I get a break?
All right, let's try this uh, fancy car out and see if... Or not. But the boot, boot got anything? Nope. God damn it, nothing. All right, what is this? This is like a gas station? God damn. Oh, that dude got, he's got like a spear. What is that shit? Holy fuck, there's some stuff going on over here. All right, I need to get in there, man. It's gonna be a bit of a fight, but if I can... Oh, come on. Oh, I wanted to get in there before the, the, the horde got over here that was following me. Oh, come on! There's a broken window there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't have time to clean the glass. Uh, maybe I could, like... Well, we could disassemble... What do you mean I need a propane torch? I guess that makes sense. Uh... I guess I could also... Yeah, I think one of these dudes had, like, a spear or some shit. Oh, hello. Well. Uh, well, they're... They're pouring out. Um... Yeah, I guess I could call him over here. Yeah, we could call him over here and then go inside. There's there's the back there's backpack Betty over there. I don't know if that was the backpack guy that I was looking for though. Um There he is, that spearman. Get him. Fuck. Okay, he's dead. Alright. Now we just have to like I, th I think it's, I think it's like a Spearman. There's also, uh, there's also Cop over there who has like a, he's got like a beat stick. Oh shit, he does. Oh my God. That would be so good. <laughs> that would be incredible. Yeah, it's a shitload. Thankfully they're following us pretty well though, which means I might be able to bait them around and then go get stick. Yeah, I think I have time. What is that? Uh, it's a face bandana. I don't need that. Um, it is. It's a wooden spear. Holy shit. Uh, he also had military boots. Leather gloves. And a hoodie. All, all of that's pretty good. Okay. Uh, throw the hood up. If I can. They, they're not even following me at the moment, I don't think. Okay. Oh, God. You're looking sketchy. Holy shit. Um, let's put the leather, the, the gloves, shockingly enough, this was actually how we died on one of our other runs, was not having a protection on our hands. Uh, so, I think we also got, like, military boots? Yeah, there we go. Let's, uh, put the boots on, and let's then get rid of sneakers, uh, the hard hat, I think, dirty rag, I was about to say, I don't know what happened to most of them, but they all just kind of disappeared. Uh, so let's go ahead and also put on the uh, equipment both hands. Okay. So we we might be able to handle... Okay, so we're right now we're at high exertion, very tired, and hungry. Uh, here's what I'm going to do, though. I don't know if we have a pen at the moment. Oh, shit, it saves the... That's my house. Where are we now? Uh, I don't think I can notate on the map yet. I do look I'm about to mug a bitch, but... Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh! That's the cop! Oh! That's exactly who we needed! Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, because he's got the nightstick. Okay, we're like a little over encumbered here. That deputy jacket might be good. And the bulletproof vest. Uh, bulletproof vests don't seem like they're that great, though. Uh, I'll have.
have to I'll have to take a look at this here in a minute. But yeah, we're we're like heavy right now, which means I I've got to drop something. Let me check the. Uh, let me quit the trash bag. Put the nightstick in one hand. Cause the bandage is dirty now, so I need to. I think I can I can clean. Oh no, I can just take that one off. That's have really good scratch and bite protection. That makes sense. Yeah, I, I just wonder like if the hoodie would outweigh it just because it's uh got like the head protection. Yes, it's not. <laughs> it does not. Oh my god. It does not at all. I thought, I thought the hoodie was. Oh, you can wear it in addition. Oh, that's interesting. See, I didn't know that. I thought you had to wear like one or the other. Uh, I don't know if like the trooper pants are better than what are the what are the pants we're wearing right now? Padded pants. They do not appear to be better, so I will rip those up. Okay, I think I'm gonna I think I'm going in, dude. Because uh, I think if I, it seems like whatever, whatever was going on outside appears to have. Oh, hello. Are we just like, are we so like tired that I just can't do shit now? Is that what it is? Yeah, we're ridiculously tired. Okay, so we need to drop like a little bit of weight. Uh, let's drop the... I hate to do it, but let's drop the metal bars because I know those are super heavy. Uh, how are we looking now? Not ridiculously overweight anymore, but we're still pretty bad. Uh, I can drop these nasty-ass rags. Uh, what else can I get rid of? I'm not getting rid of the spear. The spear's incredible. I'm not going to get rid of the saw, either. I guess we can drop, like, the one other metal bar we have. I just feel like the... I guess the nightstick and the... Yeah, that'll do it. I, I just needed to get him out from under... Oh, look, a gnome. Okay. Uh, let's try to get into this house and try to do it semi-discreetly. Because, like, I would like to be able to get in there and get some rest or something. Okay. Nothing in here right now, so let's lock the door. And let's switch over. God damn it. <laughs> I like how as soon as I'm like, alright, we're good. Just kidding. Is the wooden spear already broken? Oh my god. Okay. Lock the door. There is a bed right here, and we can uh, close the curtains. Oh, I guess let's see if we have any food first in here. <laughs> really hoping, uh, really hoping there's zombies here. Okay. Oh, thank God, there's avocado. <laughs> this must have been a wealthy millennial house. Big soccer Tyrannosaurus sex has returned. I hope your zombie survival where you kill every member of chat has been fun. It has been pretty fun. I like it a lot, actually. It's a good time. Yeah, just need some toast. Okay, so we have solved the food issue for the most part. Uh, let me grab this as well. Get this canned, uh, canned mushroom soup. Yeah, I know. I wish we could... <laughs> the gnome? Yeah, we need to weaponize it. Uh, sleep on the ground. Turn on the sink. Do I need to get... Oh, there's cereal. That's good. Eat that, too. Okay, we're good on food. Now we're sad, tired, and on high exertion. So let's uh, let's go in here, and we're going to turn off the lights. Turn off this lamp. And I guess actually sleep, because we, we should be able to sleep here, hopefully, without getting, you know, bongled on. Sad and tired, sound like me. <laughs> yeah, I like Zomboid, though. It's fun. This is this is really good. Okay, well, there we go. Jigakuro, or not, yeah, this is Jigakuro. I just thought we were done somebody else for some reason. Uh, I wonder how easy it is to fix this spear, because... Like, that thing, that thing's great. So, 
We also don't have a pen to like notate our location, which I need to do that too. Uh, painkillers, incredible. Get that. Um, I don't. I need to like lighten the load here in a minute. Um, close this. Amazing to me that most of these curtains do not, or most of these windows do not have curtains. Red pen, there we go. Newspaper, electricity for intermediates, tailoring for beginners. We'll grab that because we'll need that, I'm sure. Okay, grab the gnome. Okay, now that we got the curtains closed, we can cut on the lights in here, I guess. Excuse me. I I don't think it was one of the windows here. Okay. Um I'm going to figure out how we can shed some weight really quick. Yeah, I really, really hate that this is like there there is a way to repair stuff, right? But I guess it doesn't give you the option if you don't have like the thing to do it. Oh, god damn it. Get the fuck out of here. Uh he had a he had a house key, that's nice. Um Guys, as soon as I turn on the lights, here it comes, right? <laughs> like, here it comes, of course. Uh, tailoring for beginners. We could probably read this. I'll be here a while. Oh, yeah. Well... There's blood everywhere. Okay. Well, I would say this is rapidly approaching not a safe space anymore. Uh, I did want to shed some more weight, but I'm not really sure what to kick right now that I don't need. Um, I I guess the hoodie, but then again, it's helping a little bit too. The belt is nice. Uh, we could drop tailoring for beginners. I, I, I am not parting with the saw. I realized how good the saw was last time we were playing through because I was like, oh, look, the saw can like do all kinds of shit to break stuff down. I don't know. I need to figure out where where the hell they were even coming in from. Because, like... Where were they coming in from? Oh, they came through this window. That sucks. Uh, well... I, can't, I mean, I guess we got out of there in time, right? Uh, what do you have in here that's, like... I, it's got, I hate, I'd hate losing the fucking spear, but I would imagine we could probably craft the spear once we get anything, like, whatever. Okay, we're not, we're not super overweight anymore, so. I guess let's try to get up to, oh, there's an ambulance over there, let's see if we can. If we can sneak up here and get a, get a bead on what's happening. Um, does not seem to be any zombies over here. This seems really familiar. There's a riverside map. Ooh, how does that work? Read the map. Oh, wow. Okay. Pride of the Mighty Ohio. Uh, the, the Mighty Ohio? <laughs> does that automatically, like, update your map? Uh, it, it does. Yeah, it adds all this shit over here, I think, maybe? I don't know. Uh, is the trunk open? Would really love to have a backpack to stop with this fucking trash bag shenanigans. I love the... Tr oh! 
Look at this. Damn, like actual medical supplies. Holy shit. My God. You can make a spear with a plank or a branch and then some type of knife to sharpen it. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I had a friend who would never stop. Who would never shut up about how like any zombie movie, they're like, I don't know why they just don't make spears. They could just make spears. They could just make spears. If they just made spears. I'm like, man. I'm like, all right, look. Yes, I know. Spears are like really good weapons in the zombie apocalypse. And they don't get used nearly enough. But like, it's okay for a movie to just be a movie sometimes, right? Like, it's it's all right. We don't have to fucking sit here and be like, why do they just use spears? Why do they just use spears? If they just used spears, it would have been fine. But can we just have a good time? Can we just, can we just have a good time? Why has it always got to be like this? Okay, we're we're heavy again. Ooh, this place is locked. Come on. I do. This is just burglary simula simulator at the moment. Out here trying to burgle. Oh, there's a TV on in there. Wow, I actually cannot get in this place. I can smash the window, but we know how this goes. I'm sorry, did it <laughs> did it smash the window and then like I Oh no no no. Oh actually that's fine. Perfect. And yeah, I I smashed the window, but it didn't smash it, it just opened it. Which is really strange. Oh hey, foraging and cooking, cool. Now we just gotta find a safe place to read. Whenever that happens. Really could use a backpack. There's the bathroom. There's some grapes. <laughs> it's an unfortunate sound. It sure is. All right. Uh, well... I thought there would be more in here, considering, like, everything this was. There's a dish towel, empty kettle. Uh, it's canned carrots. I guess this house is, like, relatively safe. I mean, nothing's broken yet, so... I suppose we could lock ourselves in the bathroom and read a book. We do that really quick, yeah. Do that. The way we can trim up the load here. Just sitting here in the dark reading. I thought we turned off the TV. I guess not. Reading this book till daylight. It's interesting that the... Television networks are, like, still working? Oh. Oh, I guess we could... Well, I was going to say we could set the sack down for a little bit, but I guess not. We also have a gun. Put that on our uh, belt. Or not. I guess because we're currently reading. Oh, no. Empty water bottle. We also had three water bottles, which is like... Well, I'm trying to get him to fire through these books so he can throw them down or whatever. Just a little toilet book. Oh, I thought it said the boredom was going like like you were gaining boredom. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, how the hell does that work? I like that you're reading this book also while just hauling around a massive container to like enormous. <laughs> like this gigantic container. <laughs> Let's set the uh, garbage bag down, I guess. Um, the this that mechanic reminds me of um, Outward. If anybody remembers, uh, if anybody remembers that one. Uh, let's do the can opener. Actually, let's not do can opener. Let's just pop out here really quick and just eat some more trash out like the fridge or whatever. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, so we're, like, I guess the apocalypse has, like, just started in this. Like, that's why, like, the TV stations are still running, the power is still running. But I think the game gets harder as it goes, because it, I would imagine services and stuff like that start to, they start to disconnect. Like, power and, like, all that stuff. Water and shit. Which is interesting, because I wonder how the water thing is going to work. I guess, like, you need to find, like, purification tablets and stuff like that. <laughs> I think you underestimate how it doesn't matter what kind of apocalypse it is, but you're always going to find a marathon of NCIS on television. <laughs> Fucking just NCIS. Oh, okay. Whoa. Tearing through that book. I'm pretty sure that's the speed read sound. I could be wrong, but pretty sure. Ridiculously tired. So tired. So desperately and humanly tired. That's because we've been champing through this book. Oh. I was about to say, we could just sleep on the ground. <laughs> just sleep in the bathroom. It's safer than anywhere else. And I would imagine the character would wake up if something was banging on the door, right? Okay, can we come back to reading that book? Or is that going to fuck me up? Uh, I don't know. Which one were we reading? Was it... Oh, it was cooking. Okay. There we go. All right, cool. So we've read, we've read these books, which means now we can them. No, oh, no, no. Like, gone. I don't need these. I don't need these. Uh, did I read this one yet? Oh, fuck, I didn't. All right. <laughs> Here comes tailoring. Oh, I guess we could drop this bandage now, too, because I don't think we need that anymore. Never mind. All right, let's finish this book as well. So good, I just can't put it down. Help me. Right, be on the lookout for shows on life and living. Free XP even while you read. Oh, really? That's neat. I didn't know, like, the TVs would actually have, uh, have anything like that. That's fun. Oh, god damn it, dude. I'm just trying to eat. Get out of here. Just trying to eat some pickles. <laughs> like, bro, I'm eating my pickles. Get out of here. You're stupid. Drink this malk. <laughs> I love the idea of, like, sipping on the malk. I'm telling you, it's the bathroom of safety. Like, we should have never, ever, ever left the bathroom of safety. Bro, I see you. Come on. Come in here. Come in here, get your justice. Get your justice. Oh shit! Oh shit! What? That's not good. Okay. Okay. Just gotta get a knockdown. Get the knockdown. Yes. Some of that firefighter shit, we might want to... Shit! Oh, we got him? Damn, girl. Bashing him up. Okay. Uh, there's canned carrots in here. I'm trying to see if there's anything else we can just, like, kind of grab. Uh, there's another GC box. You can drink that. Oh. <laughs> so good, I just can't put it down. All right. Uh, well, we need to go get our we need to go get our trash sack. But I do want to see if these guys had anything else useful on them. They got the firefighter stuff, which I, if I remember correctly, is like some of the best because uh, we had that before and those were pretty damn good. Uh, the bite defense is if it's in green, I think that means that uh, like I think if it's if it shows like an upgrade or rather that indicates an upgrade if it's green right there. Uh. I do know it's easy to get hot in this, I guess, but. Okay, so how are we looking on bite protection? Wow. That is, uh. That's. That's pretty damn good. That is. That is thoroughly. Thoroughly solid. 
Uh, I don't know if maybe one of these is like better and better shape or I don't know why the left arm's so shit. That's interesting. But yeah, we're gonna get like the the heat thing or whatever, which is I hate that the firefighter stuff is so good because it looks so stupid. Uh, what was what were we doing? We were um reading the tailoring. I think. Yeah, we're gonna finish this up. Okay, we're hungry, but we'll we'll figure out the food situation here in a minute once I finish this. So that way we can drop all the books. I need to re I need to resize the um I need to resize the the UI as a whole, but what is this? Is this is this tired? Yeah, we're tired again. This is the bathroom. Of, this is it. This place is great. This is where we need to stay. This is the safest place on earth. Uh, I guess let me uh, get rid of the any of the police stuff that we took off. Yeah, we'll get rid of that here in a minute because carrying all this heavy shit's really bad. I think it's interesting that as you get more tired, it seems like the area kind of like gets darker around you because I guess you get close to like passing out, which is which is kind of interesting. Yeah, my monitor is fourteen forty p, so uh, that makes that's probably why it is like super fucking small. Uh, let's, um, let's drop those, uh, let's rip that up, uh, let's do, okay, so we're, like, slightly under, oh, I think our, our weight limit's a little bit lower, too, because we're, uh, we're 49.99, who'd resist? Shut the door. I think, that, yeah, there's some, there's some canned carrots in here, and then we also had... Uh, we got our can opener. We can open the canned mushroom soup. And open the canned carrots. I do I do like this. I can see why, like, I, I don't know what it was looking like, you know, before this most recent update, but... Even if this was, like, slightly jankier and, like, not quite as here... I mean, I could still understand what the appeal was. I remember a few people described this game to me over the over the years that, that played it, and it's definitely, it's definitely fun. Yeah, I saw text size. I didn't think that was a... Uh, exactly it or what we needed or whatever uh let's try i don't know if you get like a bonus for sleeping in a bed but i'm i'm just gonna i'm just gonna fucking sleep in here again this is this is safety <laughs> this this is safety the bathroom floor is the safety this is this is where i belong the bathroom floor is the safety i have uh i have actually slept in a bathroom before all right, let's see. Welcome to uh, welcome to Hurricanes in the South. Okay, we're back up to eleven. I need to, I need to just grab the garbage bag. Let's go ahead and throw it in the second hand, and uh, we're gonna be overweight again, which is unfortunate, but great, great, awesome. He broke my damn window. I like this house. This was like this is a cool spot. He comes here, and breaks the damn window. Uh, we got empty tin cans. I'm just trying to think. Can, I can equip this, right? Yeah, because the holster allows you to put shit on, like, the hip and stuff. So maybe I could, like, throw the pistol there? But then I don't think that fixes. Does that solve inventory stuff? I don't know if it does. I don't even know why I have the damn pistol. Also, shout out to me waking up, like, early ass in the morning. Like, this is a smart call. Um, Because we're in, like, a suburb. So... Oh, this is this is already open. <laughs> what? This, this is already a mess in here. Uh, it's not too terrible in here though. Could be worse. I was looking on water. Now let's fill all of our water bottles, which also increases weight. I'm telling you, man. Every single time we leave that bathroom to safety, it's fucking it's, it's terrible. Uh, pot of stew, fresh, uncooked. Oh well. Turn on the... Turn on the eye. I don't know if that will solve the... Can I, like, grab the stew and, like, throw it in the oven? I mean, that's not how you do... That's not how you cook stew, but... I don't know. Oh, my God. Get out of here! All these people coming in my houses! Guys, there's a window already broken. Uh, 
There's a bathroom of safety here, too, though. Uh, I guess let me just eat the... Let me just eat this, too, I suppose. Look at how long it takes to get this thing. Holy shit. Oh, I should probably turn that off before I go to sleep. Um, let me see if there's other food to grab in here. Processed cheese. All right. There's probably blood in that stew. I mean, fine. It's fine, man. Oh, or canned potatoes. Canned potato. Fuck. <laughs> the fuck, dude? I understand the tomato, but I, I don't, I don't know if I've ever used canned po potato. Can't, uh, can't, can't say that I've used that for anything. <laughs> yeah, ever. Potato doesn't exactly seem like the best thing to can. Oh, I'm sure it exists. There's a lot. Of, there's canned bread, for God's sake. So, like, I, I totally believe that. I totally believe that that's real. Don't worry. You don't. You don't have to sell me on it. Did we ever knock? Did we ever take that bandage off? Because I think we're good now. Uh, let's see. Again, we are overweight, big time. So I need to figure out what to do to trim this. Oh, we didn't get rid of tailoring for beginners yet. Uh, we could also drop. I don't want to get rid of the screwdriver or the saw. Um, the pistol is holstered, I believe. So there's that. Um, I don't know if, like, maybe I can... Can I put, like, the nightstick on the side, too? Oh, okay. Yeah, so that, like, adds it to the side so you can, like, switch between stuff pretty easy. Yeah. That's cool. I like that. Okay, neat. Well, it's almost... It is morning now. Still, still a bit heavy. I can't lay down in that place either because it's been compromised. Oh my god. I feel like it was a much more it was much more enjoyable when we were wearing like nothing and just like running everywhere. That was a uh, that was pretty rad. Can't remember if we checked this yet. Like okay, the trunk's already unlocked. <laughs> what you got in the ambulance? Oh, you know. Socks. Uh, pop the trunk. Alright. What's in here? Uh, that's interesting. A tote bag. Unfortunately, we... I don't think there'd be any way to... Yeah, it would be the same situation there. I am gonna grab that wrench, though, because that seems... That seems useful. What is... What's over here? Oh, what is this? A trash land. My favorite. I've always wanted to go to trash land. <gasps> what is this? Oh, it's milk and milk, milk and more. Hmm. That is a, uh, that is, that is certainly, that is, that is certainly a name for a place. Uh, so I'm probably gonna have to break the window, I guess. Oops, that sucks. Uh, let's read the broken glass. But, I mean, there's some good shit in here. Or at least it looks like it. Okay, let's look for... We got pop. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I just, I just want to eat, like... Open egg carton. Okay. <laughs> Drink all the milkies. Can you go in the sewers? Oh, no. Sewers would probably be a solid place to go in the apocalypse because, like, most of the time they're not super easily accessible for human human face. So, like, that actually isn't a bad idea. Considering, like, most uh, most sewers and things, like, you have to like remove like gratings or something like that to get down into. So, I do feel like it would probably kind of hard for like zombies to get in there. I guess a fresh potato. Did we just play a game and decide that sewer levels are the worst thing? Oh, no, no. It didn't take that game for me to decide that sewer levels were the worst thing. Sewer levels are just the worst thing, period. There's no arguing about that. Ooh, that one's got, like, an axe in its back. Okay, here's here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop the, uh... This is why this reminds me of Outward. Um, we're gonna drop our sack on the floor. Alright. Now we're not super over-encumbered, and I'm... <gasps> the dude's got a backpack. He's got a... Sh he's got the raccoon backpack! Get him. Oh! No! 
no, 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 don't push me. No, no. I do want that raccoon backpack, though. It seems like there's a cap on like how many you can like cleave. Do you think if I ooh, I got an idea. Maybe if I hop in here and then force them over the edge, I can stomp them. I can get some, I can get some good hits there. Yeah, we just had to funnel him. Oh no! Thank God we got good bite protection. <laughs> Otherwise, I would not be attempting this. Okay, I think he's dead. Oh, there's backpack. Yes! Give me that backpack, you son of a bitch! I need this. Please, I need this. Wow, he got up quick. Do you see that shit? Damn. I like that there's, there's like a good like confirm on the uh, like when you when you kill someone it actually like you can or when you smash a zombie proper like you can really tell. Hell yeah, dude! All right, I'm pretty uh I'm pretty I'm pretty jazzer sized on this. So let's uh open up the backpack. Which probably doesn't have a ton more weight, but the nice part about it is at least you can, uh... Wow, I don't know, that's actually pretty fucking good, man. Uh, let's move the box of nails over there. Uh, lighter. Basically anything that doesn't need to be, like, readily accessed. Screwdriver in there. Painkillers. Let's be real, I ain't fire. Well, we're gonna keep the gun just because I have a feeling that, like, we might need to do something with that. That metal bar is just, like, I keep saving it because I feel like it might come in handy. It's so heavy, though. You served us well, trash bag. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure we'll be using another trash bag at some point because this running ain't gonna last forever. <laughs> so, like, whatever. Uh, there's tons of rip sheets, but I do need to keep those out. Put the pen in there. Um, I think it's just also, like, the gear itself is, like, really heavy. Because, like, we're wearing all the firefighter shit, and we just can't quite... We, we just can't quite handle that. I don't know if there's a way I can, like, fix any of that, but... Hey, house keys. Yeah, the firefighter suit's super fucking heavy. I wonder if, like, maybe... Since we have some bite protection on our head from the... Uh... Like, a little bit... You can get swole to carry more. I mean, like, what do you do? Do you just, like, exercise or whatever? Like, is that what you have to do? I, I don't know. Like, I, I genuinely have no idea. We're also not super heavy overweight now. I think we're at, like, 11 out of 12, which is nice. So, that means we could probably grab some food, I would imagine. Um, I don't know. Some of these are, like... They, these say fresh, so I'm kind of wondering, like, if we should take those. Maybe we should find, like, some more crap that's on the shelves or whatever. One of them did have an axe in their back, but I don't know if the axe... I, if I didn't check to see if the axe was, like, better than the, uh... Um... Wow, they have, like, a lot of necklaces and shit. Uh, okay, we're getting pretty tired. The house key there. I don't know how much those weigh. Yeah, hand axe. Holy shit. Uh, it is... It might be better than the nightstick? I don't know. Is there a way to check? I can't tell if the damage on that is, like, the damage it has, uh, taken, or... Yeah, I don't know. I wonder if the axe is, like, what that is, actually. That's interesting. Nightstick feels like it's probably a little bit tougher. <laughs> Right-click yourself to jazzercise. That's the kind of words I need right now. Okay, I'm gonna put that in the backpack, too. Again, I never see now we're, like, heavy again. Well, I guess I guess let's give the let's give the hand axe a shot and see what we got. Damn. Oh, was there a back room? Shit, I didn't even know. 
But now it says we're not, like, overweight, which is weird. I don't know what the deal is. Oh, shit. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff back here. There's a trash can. There is a... Uh, oh, oh, here we go. Yeah, it's much like dried goods. Uh, dry rum noodles, mac and cheese, rice, TV dinner. I don't know why the TV dinner is in a box. That's kind of gross. There's more cereal. Oh, yeah, this is great. Because all this stuff we'll probably keep forever, so. Aluminum, baking soda, flour. Okay, so there was just a lot of, like, cooking shit back here. Uh, it's actually probably pretty safe to camp out back here, I would imagine. It seems safer than some of the other areas, so. I'll lock that door and... I guess I can turn on, cause I can turn on the light in here and... Yeah, let's, uh... Can I sleep here? It looks like no. Oh, it's because we're not super tired yet. It's mainly just the... No, we are tired. I don't know what the fuck that's all about. I guess let's try to find a bed. Uh, we need to figure out something to do with this, uh... This gear situation, because it's, like, really fucking heavy. Oh, my God. Well, we ain't sleeping here, I guess, because these assholes are everywhere, so... Can I hike that fence? Yeah! No! What the fuck is this? Is this a diner? Damn. Can't, uh... Oh, it's when you can barely stay awake. Okay, that makes sense. Well, can't get in there. How does that smell? Please. No, nah, it's fine. Uh, oh, it was like a video store? Oh, there's a back room here. <laughs> oh, look, a pond tutor. There are so many VHSs. Oh my god. Yeah, they're banging on the fucking doors, though. God damn it. Oh, hey, man, what's up? Wow, I fell. Wow, that was crazy. Hmm. This is not, a. Uh, this is not ideal. We probably need to go ahead and get the hell out of here. Are they banging on both doors? Yeah, oh, oh, absolute. I'm just cracking open. We're going. <laughs> Let me just Resident Evil past these assholes. This is like a strip mall. That is crazy strong. I can't believe that. <laughs> Give me a cow. Look at that fucking cowboy hat. Gonna gonna grab that cowboy hat really quick, because there's definitely there's definitely priorities here. Okay, still super heavy. I don't know really what's holding us down. Like, I mean, I don't know how heavy that like. Uh... Okay, what's all over here? There's lickety lickety split, which is a liquor store. Uh, back to the nurture or chiropractic services. Uh, wow. There's probably some good shit here. Um, but we can't do shit here at the moment. Mm. Okay, this area... Oh, shit. Even one of the windows is open? Shit. Oh, no. Oh, come on. That one's stuck to... Oh, this is already... Never mind. I was about to say, that's already compromised. I didn't see there was already a broken window there. Okay, a lot of zombies over here. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, I'm wheezing a little bit. Uh, let's see. 
Oh, well, can't do anything there either. Is that a fence or what? Yeah, it's a fence. Okay. Great. Perfect. Okay, so we're at the ridiculously tired point now, which is not good. All right. What about here? Worth a shot. I'm going to get in somewhere. Oh, God. Okay, there we go. Oh, good. There's a giant, like, there's a giant... Oh, that's a mirror. Okay, I thought there was a window. Well, there's some sleeping tablets. That's good. This is not a good place to sleep. Yeah, because I was about to say, they're already fucking in. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Oh, come on, game. Don't do this. Don't, don't do this. Did we get bitten? No, we didn't. Yeah, the, uh, the big, the big tired is, is pretty bad at the moment. Okay, jump the fence. Oh, there's nothing on the other side for once. There's another fence. Oh my god. Wh one of these houses has to be unfettered. What? <laughs> What's that dude? Oh my god. Dude, the alive hunter guy? Oh my god. I'm ready, dude. Early access me. Okay, this is open. Uh, Where's the bedroom here? Shut up. Yeah, maybe we can get lucky here if they just, you know, don't notice we're in here. Too panic to sleep. Bed quality, good. Pop some sleeping tablets. We're safe here, right? <laughs> we are, uh, we are turbo firefighter, man. We could barricade. This is gonna kill us, right? Like. like absolutely gonna kill us. Yeah, you can hear him bonking over there. I mean, kid, uh, well, I guess we're gonna find out. I, I was curious if while you're resting, if something starts banging on the door, like if you wake up. I think so, yeah, because it says we're panicked. Yeah, because we're panicked again, I guess. Uh, let's take the pills again. Do we have any of the anxiety ones? No, not at the moment. <laughs> trying to get trying to get a better sleep. I don't know. I don't think we have any alcohol at the moment. Uh, it's heavy load. This is sucks. However, it looks like our uh, our weight is twelve point three nine out of fifteen, which oh never mind. That's the backpack. Okay, right. Uh, exercise. Perform regularly. Exercise fatigue will be felt on legs, reducing movement speed. I don't know what increases, uh, so if we, like, work out in here, because working out increases your, can't take much more, movement compromised. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, do the push-ups, get, get nice and, get nice and jacked. How the, how fucking long do you have to do this to, like, see a yield on it? Probably... Probably a horrendous... Where is my backpack? Oh, does it unequip it? Okay, yeah, let's set the backpack on the ground for a minute. Uh, so that should be that we're no longer, like, crushed under that weight, so that's good. <laughs> Hell yeah, 30 minutes of straight push-ups. I guess it goes into your uh, skills, maybe? Is it strength? Strength or fitness, maybe? I don't know. Either one of those. I, I suppose it's probably strength. But I would imagine you can't... Uh, or moist. Yeah, we should have food in the bag. Uh, a decent amount of food, actually. <sighs> okay, let's see. 
Uh, we never did. Uh, we never did go. Fuck the cowboy hat, dude. It's, it's, it's awesome, but like we can't. <laughs> we can't. We can't deal with that right now. We need to. We need to wash up. We've been nasty for a minute. Oh come on! I don't have any of my shit. My my weapon on. Oh, oh no! Where's my wee upon? I was about to say, where's my fucking axe? Well, this is a bite. This is absolutely gonna be a bite. Now our, like, combat capabilities were reduced or whatever. So great. Perfect. Awesome. Did we... Hello? Hello? Oh my god. Great. Great, dude. This is going great. Just, just move past them. I can't get past them. Oh my god. I love how fast this game goes to shit. Like, oh yeah, it's good. Yeah, you just get, you can't get fucking around anything. Like the movement just turns to shit. <laughs> that was a that was a good run. I hate that. Like, I don't know. I, I, that feels like ridiculous. I, I guess it's because like our, I don't know. I couldn't get my weapon to equip for some reason. It just kept being like me. But oh well. I guess that was that. That was that was pretty fun though. That's uh, that went that went pretty well. God. Ooh. Local man tried to get fit, but society brought him down. <laughs> what? You can use it. All right. Let's see. Sorry, we have the wheezes. I don't even know if it was from the stuff. All right, let's, um... I'm we'll trying to decide if I want to do one more, because it is 2.30 almost, so... How about, let's, uh, let's stop there, I think, for tonight. However, I'm glad to have found, uh... Yeah, I use my inhaler periodically. Uh, it's okay, I just started wheezing for some reason. Um... But, uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think that's gonna be it for this time. Um, I wanted to get shredded, not get shredded. Firefighter role play. <laughs> yeah, I just feel like that was a scramble. I don't know what the hell I was, what the hell I needed to do there. But uh, if you guys are new to the stream, you're more than welcome to go follow on Twitter, Discord, and all that stuff. And then also here, if you'd like to catch this again, we'll probably be doing more Project Zomboid, but maybe not tomorrow night, but in the future for sure, because I, I do, I do like it a lot. It's fun. It's actually a lot more, uh, a lot more interesting and a lot more accessible than I thought it would be. Uh, and I, I think maybe some people's opinions of it being, like, uh, like, super uninviting probably came from, like, earlier versions of the game, but it, I, I, I think it's, like, pretty, I think it's pretty straightforward. I don't think it feels very, like, needlessly obtuse. I, I think it's got just the right amount of jank, too. Like I said, it's very, reminds me of, like, a Kenshi kind of thing. It's fun to, like, pick up and go again. I hate when runs like that end, but... I guess the the firefighter firefighter getup was probably pretty bad for Jikakuro because he was like a runner type person. So I think that we severely limited their capabilities of doing that. We also didn't pick a base uh, or anything like that to store all of our shit. So that also sucked. So uh, at least we have on the map we know where we know where all Hootie's bait and tackle is, so we can go over there and go do the thing. <laughs> so. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, if you're new to the stream, you're more than welcome to follow and stuff. Uh, I always appreciate it. We do stream at 8 o'clock Eastern Time, Monday through Friday. And, uh, yeah. We never found a half-decent one? What? Of the... What are we talking about? The runner man? What's going on? Good old Hootie's bait and tackle. Oh, that's true. Yeah, like a base. Yeah, there was really nowhere to, like, do that, unfortunately. That sucks. Anyway, no, this is a lot of fun, though. I think we'll definitely be visiting this again, and uh, thank you to everybody who decided to throw their name in the hat for that. And remember, if you want to participate in the Bits D&D &D thing, make sure you go and join Tabletop Chat on Discord and uh, send me a PM and let me know you're interested. But that's going to be it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I will see you guys all tomorrow, 8 o'clock, and uh, see you then. Take it easy. Have a good one. See you next time. Goodbye.